Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewelry Maker, Sewing Street and Hobby Maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Good morning, everyone. Shall I start the morning with a really horrible squeamish story? So if you're eating your breakfast oh. with your children, um, okay. I just might need to warn you. So okay. imagine, imagine the scene. The alarm goes off at quarter to five. Uh huh. Okay, I get up, I go downstairs. Don't bother to put the light on. Oh no. I did have my slippers on. Okay. What, just your slippers? My slippers and my dressing gown right. to go down to make a cup of tea. <laughs> right, and I stood on something and, and, and I skidded and went into the patio door. I think I know what you're okay. gonna say. So I put the light on and it was like a massacre. Oh no! Not one, not two, three back ends of mice with tails, nothing else, blood everywhere. And I skidded from one end of the kitchen to the other. Then, then, oh, no. <laughs> after I cleaned that up, I went into the downstairs loo and whatever they'd eaten of these mice, They'd brought back up again all, over the, all, over, the, all over the bathroom. Oh. So I had that to clean up as well this morning. All that before five o'clock. Don't we love our animals? I mean, yes, <laughs> absolutely. So any cat lovers out there, you'll know exactly what I went through this morning. It was horrendous. I've had similar, but ours are house cats. Right. So not so mine. You've not, you've not had bits and pieces of animals then? N well, no. well, my mum's cats used to do that, but right. um, not mice. Ours are long-haired cats, oh. and... See, we've never had a fur ball in our house. Not fur ball. Oh. I've got up, and there's been a cat, obviously, do what it needs to do. Yeah, yeah. And I've stepped in that. Oh. It, where it's obviously yeah. stuck yeah. <laughs> and travelled. Right. And right, then yeah. dropped on the carpet somewhere, got up, darkness, stepped in it. Yeah. Oh, God. That's well, pretty For Christmas too. morning, Andrew got up and did what I did with bare feet. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> So it's so it's, it's it's come to my turn. They, this but them. they bring us we so much them. joy. We love them. So we love them. So much joy. <laughs> oh, yes. Honestly, honestly. I know, I know. They're, but they're worth it. They are worth love it, aren't them. they? Absolutely. Cats, so. dogs, all yeah, of the above. Yeah, absolutely. Oh my goodness. Firstly, Mark. Good morning. How morning, are you? lovely. Mm -hmm. mm. I was being careful because I got a cold sore, so I don't want to. Yeah, just stress. 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 Literally stress. Yeah, we, we have. We just spoke about nothing else that we've got here. Have we? Stress. Just, stress. just we just yeah. Yes. Just stress. All good though. Because but for the next five hours, well, complete and utter escapism. It is. That's the yes. thing. We're so lucky yeah. that when we do come into this mm. amazing bubble with you, that all the stress, everything it else does, that you've got strange, going on, kind of disappears. Completely and utterly. 
Yes, yeah. it's, uh, yeah, it's five minutes of almost... <sighs> yes, it's lovely. So as much for us as well. Um, <laughs> and I tell you what, it's five hours of absolutely jam-packed beautifulness. This we morning. always say this, and, and the viewers are thinking, oh, they're going to say it again, but I really don't know how we're going to fit this all in. I do. And there have been a couple of shows that you and I have done recently. We weren't able to get everything in. True. <laughs> so I it don't know. It might well be that I don't problem. Know what's happening today. Um, uh, well, yeah, should we go through it? Because your early bird, firstly, this morning, you have type A jadeite in faceted rectangles. It's a brand new shape. That's your early bird. Oh, God. And this hour also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was just admiring I was this. Isn't that amazing? It's amazing. Look at this. So, how do we pronounce it? The Ouroboros. Look oh. at how beautiful. So, you can see. Oh, it's, that it's a dragon. It's a dragon. Oh, yes. We've never, ever, ever. Uh, well, I haven't. I've never seen anything like this. It was launched on Christmas Day. Um, now, it is a lounge hour this hour, so you can go onto the website. There are only 11 available. Um, it's Taipei, of course. It's that wonderful gents, old... Oh, yeah. So cool. Yeah, and it's really nice to have a larger ring as well. Well, whether you, if yeah. you could wear it on the hand, but I was thinking yeah. you could also wear it as a pendant. Uh, as pendant, yeah, yeah, round the chest. Oh, because... It's oh, it's not a ring ring. It's a... It's a ring oh. shape, but it is... But because they're so varied, some will be a bit smaller, some will be a bit larger, oh, they're master right. carvings. Um, you can absolutely wear that as a... a oh, I came in this morning and put it on my middle finger. I thought, perfect. Did it oh, fit you? Yeah. Oh, there we go. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Oh, yeah, that's why, that's why I, th I thought it was a ring for the gents. I didn't know it was a pendant. Because oh. uh, I looked at that and thought, oh, it's a lovely pendant, almost like that high goo oh, right. uh, um, connection. But right. there we go. So it can yeah. be worn as a piece of jewellery as well on, on the hand. Right. Um, so this is available in this hour because it is lounge hour. You know what that means, lovely jewellery makers. That means you have to check out before nine o'clock. All these items will disappear for, from your baskets. Mm -hmm. Um, again, that's incredible. That was launched on, what was it, New Year's Day, did you say? Christmas Day, Christmas apparently. Day, Christmas yeah. Day. Yeah. Um, if you have a look on the website, there's 11 of those. There's loads of beautiful goodies. We've got nephrite. We've got loads of amazing strands, beautiful pearls. Um, go to all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Scroll down. Click watch live just below Mark and I. There we go. Um, there's, the, there's your early birds, brand new shape, your faceted rectangle. So they're going lower than 99.99. I would recommend shopping ahead if you've got your eyes on those. Look at the quality of that tanzanite as well for 29.99. Some of these items are ready at their prices. Some will go lower regardless. Everybody will pay the final low. Um, if you are checking out now, then obviously you are securing your place. I mean, look at those amazing pills. Some are selling oh, out already. Yeah. <laughs> That speaks volumes. Um, you've got beautiful Herkimer quartz. Speaking of Herkimer quartz, you've also got beautiful black dotted quartz coming up in today's show, which is stunning. Seen. And I'm going to come to your kits last. I'm going to save okay. the kits till last. Right. We have wonderful Dave stepping into the studio. Um, I've been very excited about this launch. First time ever, Type A, completely natural, black jadeite bicones. Look at these. Never. They're amazing. Not on Sotheby's, not on Bonhams, not on Christie's have I ever seen faceted bicone jadeites. And it's logical. Why don't we see this shape of this beautiful gemstone very often? Because they won't cut the carrot weight away. Mm. This is a gemstone which is uber valuable, obviously. So this is... As rare as hen's teeth. It's incredible, isn't it? Now, I've bought in a piece of jewellery that I'm going to show you. I'm not going to show you until Dave gets in at 10 o'clock. OK. That I recently made on the show using black glass bicones. Oh. And I bought it in on the off chance that we had the small four millimetre, which we do. Which we do. So I'm going to, sh I'm going to show you the piece of jewellery at 10 o'clock. Oh, my and you'll goodness. you'll be able to replicate it in How, jade Oh, can you imagine that? How amazing mm. that's going to be. Yeah. So beautiful. Yeah. And I, that will be a sellout. No if, buts, or maybes. It will be a sellout. So that's happening. Look, some beautiful jewellery here made by yes. our lovely Anne and Sue. Um, plus, we've got some really gorgeous drops you can see here. It's all coming up today. All coming up on today's show. Turn wow, that around. Just one that. simple, yeah. one simple little pearl there in between. So that's happened at 10 o'clock. But also, your kits today, we have been shouting from the rafters about how beautiful <laughs> your kits are. You know, the 9 o'clock and the 12 o'clock. But let's start yeah. with the 9. So in the 9 o'clock, we've got a selection of kits using buttons. 
Now we've got base metal buttons, we've got gemstone buttons, we've got silver surrounded buttons, all miscellaneous and even, this. I love this piece, this is, this is something, something for the home here. Now, you, I could have turned this into a bracelet, mm -hmm. but I decided that I was going to make a pillar. Because the last, the last um, show we were on, we were talking about decorating candles. We were. Weren't we? So this is, in one kit, you get, the, you get the seed beads. And if I turn it round, you get two oh. of these buttons. It, look at that. Look at that goldstone. Amazing, The Mark. goldstone and then the labradorite. And then we've got dragonflies and butterflies. And it's just beautiful selection. Really uh, lovely, a real, lovely a real kits. real different sort of range. And some lovely, lovely cords and threading materials yes. as well. Yeah. But what's happening at 12 o'clock? Only three weeks late. Is it two weeks late, three weeks late? New Year's Eve, two weeks. Two weeks. Two weeks. Gosh, so, it seems like yeah. more than So we weeks. should have had these New Year's Eve. And we've, they've, just, they've just arrived. Oh, Look my goodness. These. Now, I've put a little video on my Facebook page. And I've also put some pictures yesterday of the pieces I've made. But these are coming up at 12 o'clock. They're quite limited. We've got two bundles going to the most extraordinary price. And they're absolutely brilliant. I think, I think you have to get both bundles because there's so much scope for ombreing. Both of the bundles Imagine those together. in like spring yeah. and summer. You and know? I think for the first time, we've got them in six and eight millimetres combined in bundles, which so we haven't had before. The weight has been so worth it because they are, st uh, this, uh, yeah. this is, I love this. They're beautiful, aren't they? So you've got real baby colours and you've got pastels, you've got brights, you've got dragonflies, you've got a whole range here to do peacocks, dragonflies, mermaids, everything you could beautiful. possibly want. They're amazing. So beautiful. So it yeah. truly is going to be one of the most incredible Tuesday morning shows. It really, it really fun, is it? going to be a lot of fun. Now, um, I did say last night, I, was, I can't do it every single day. I can't, but I did promise one little six-year-old girl that I would say hello. And I can say hello as well today. You can. <laughs> you can, because it's been a while since it, you've seen our lovely women. I've not met Tiggy. No. I've not met Tiggy, oh. so hello, Tiggy. And hello, Willow. I know you're watching this morning. Yes. So big kiss from Mummy and me. Oh, bless. Mwah. Mwah. And be good at do, school today. Do this. What's, what does this mean? So I. I. Yeah. Love. Love. Ah. You. Oh. Bless her. Bless. Bless. She's like, please, can you do it again, Mummy? She'll she's be all, she'll, hold, she'll go shine in Barris now. Yeah, she? she's, she's been a bit sad <laughs> lately because um, I'm to and fro with my mum at the moment, who's mm. not been very well. So, yeah, that's why. So, thank you for bearing with me on yeah, that one. So okay. Good be good at school today. Be good. Yeah. Be good. Listen to the teacher. Eat your sandwiches. Yes. Yeah, all the things you say with two kids before they, they leave yeah. the house. Right then, right then. Yes, no, she must eat her sandwiches. I was like, you eat your sandwiches first and then you go on to the, the, the treats. <laughs> <laughs> right then, should we get cracking? Because items on the website are already selling out. So right. um, it is worthwhile shopping ahead. But starting the show, as we always do, the best bit, absolutely. Your wonderful creations, it's the Wall of Fame. <laughs> That was very enthusiastic, wasn't it, of our Adam? I love his fleece wear today, I have to say. Strong fleece wear. Yeah, yes. Strong yes. fleece action today. Yeah, yeah very nice. loving that. Yeah. And, yeah, you've got and the gilet. fleece and the fleece gilet. <laughs> yeah, double fleecing today. <laughs> <laughs> they say double denim, Adam is double okay. fleecing. <laughs> <laughs> Middle-aged man, that's all good, don't worry. Mm. Listen, I had my midlife crisis earlier on when I had my top of my ear pierced. I told, I, 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 <laughs> you did, you, you, yeah. fleeces come at a certain age, is that right? I don't think I've ever grown mm. out of fleeces, no. I always, or, or into fleeces. I always wear fleeces. I do as well. They're very practical. Yeah, I love fleeces. Very <laughs> practical. Right then, starting us off. Good oh. morning to you, Joan. This is very beautiful. Wow. Uh, yeah. Melting. Number 442, uh, Joan Barron says, Hi there, jewellery maker. This week's make relates to a demo and a kit I bought back in 2021. Star cut labradorite, gold wow. seed beads and gold hearts, all from JM, and inspired by a demo by Claire McDonald. Good luck to all this week, says Joan, and to you. Good luck, Joan. And yeah, wrap up warm today. You need your fleeces. It's very cold outside. Uh, 443 is from Anila. 
Um, very oh, beautiful, look. Anila. Look at that. Uh, Anila says, Dear Jewelry Maker Team, I have made a necklace which could be worn as a bracelet using shell pearls, pre night nuggets, quartz, jasper, gold coloured wire, and gold plated finings. All from Jewelry Maker. I hope you like it. That's amazing, isn't it? Very it's dramatic. So beautiful. I love the combination of gemstones. Number 444 is from Trisha. And Trisha says, Dear JM, please find a touch my entry for this week's Wall of Fame, a red agate coin and barrel weave chainmail bracelet. Hope you like it. Kind regards. And that's Trisha. I love the colour of those stones. Beautiful. They'd go with these agate amazing. bundles, wouldn't they? Definitely. Number 445 is from Deb. And Deb says, Hi, here's my entry for this week. Having lost my mojo for quite some time, I decided to go through my stash of JM goodies. And these dyed blue agates and beautiful mookites spoke to me. Hope you like them. And that's from Deb. They're love. Beautiful. I love those I, barrels. I particularly like the yellow. Yeah, gorgeous, the yellow and blue. It? And number 446 is from Gloria. And Gloria says, hi, everyone. This is a pair of silver clay fan earrings with seed bead pearls, which I purchased from JM quite recently. I'm slowly using up all of my silver clay. They're exquisite, aren't they? Very love art deco, aren't they? Clay, yeah. Very art deco. I love, the, I love the textures that you get yeah, on silver clay. Yeah, They're amazing, amazing, Gloria. Well done, everyone. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I'm just putting a pair of earrings in just because I can, you know, because they're oh, here. Oh, stuck those in. Yeah, I thought, well, you know, <laughs> might as well wear some bicones of type A black jade if I get that opportunity. They look amazing with the gold, don't they? Oh, so pretty, so pretty. Amazing. Make sure you tune in tomorrow for your Wall of Fame draw. Mm. Um, there is still time for you to enter, of course. Um, of course, but look, coming up at 10 o'clock today, these are so beautiful. They're perfection, aren't they? Aren't they? Perfection. So gorgeous. Look how they capture the light. Honestly, it's such an incredible show for you this morning. Um, right then. Where do we start on what will be an amazing, frantic first hour? If you look at the website, Ross is saying, click watch live, scroll down, there's all the items you can shop ahead. Some will go low, in, but will be going lower than the prices on your screens. Yeah, I know, honestly. How's that? 29 I know, I know. Look at all that Mookite as oh, well, 34 99 Bumblebee, Jasper, Jadeite, Fancy Donuts, Sterling oh, Silver. Gone. Look, yes, yeah, sell out, sell out, sell oh, out. No. Your Crazy Lace Agate, Cabochon sold out. You've got to be quick on these opportunities. Herkimer Court sold out, always oh, popular. Gosh. Um, and some will be going lower than these already amazing prices. So if you do, if there is an item you do want me to bring to air, then drop us a message um, into the studio. You can do that. My husband was saying, oh, I couldn't, I couldn't text into you yesterday because he bought, he bought me a strand of pills yesterday, bless him. He's a good egg. Oh, He's a good egg. Nice of it. He's like, I couldn't message in. I was like, you can. You just got to go to the website or the app. So I'll show you how. Because um, if you're looking for um, the text button, you need to do it this way. So all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Let me show you. Scroll down. Click watch live. And then where? Where am I looking? Oh, yeah, they're just there, to the right-hand side. Hey, JM. <laughs> oh, look at that. I, I love, love a fleece. fleece. <laughs> 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 Who doesn't love a fleece, to be honest? Um, amazing. So, yeah, you can send us a message. You just got to do it on the website or via the app. OK, oh. let's get cracking, we shall go. we? Let's get cracking. Time to roll up our sleeves. Do I have the two little lavender jadeite rounds? Yes, I think I do. They are oh, just look. here. I might need to scoop yes, just, a, just a smidge. That's all. Um, sorry, Dan. Dan's like, don't, don't, don't make a apparently, mess. Apparently, he's said. known as gorgeous Dan now. He is gorgeous Dan. He only answers to that, apparently. Yeah, well, he, he has got yeah. the most smouldering eyes, yes. our Dan. Yeah. Um, message coming from Joe. What, what, what? Midday is too far away <laughs> and uh, it's what? Minus 10 in our back garden. Oh, I missed the bottom of that. Sorry. Aww. Minus 10. Uh, can't wait. Lovely to see you both. Ah, oh, bless you. Love to Willow and Tiggy. Bless your heart. It's minus bless five you. when I left this morning. Minus I thought four that was where I was. Well. Minus four. But my car is tucked away, so it probably was uh, lower than that. Yeah. Um, hello, yeah. Kath. Morning, Elle, Mark and team. A big hello to your lovely girls, Willow and Tiggy. Oh. They'll love this, you know. You're <laughs> brightening a day, because Willow has been a bit sad lately. So thank you so much. Um, I hope you have a good day at school. Oh, bless you. Bless you. I'll have to bring him in, because I can't believe you've not met Tiggy. I've not Tiggy. met her, no. I, I described no. her yesterday. Tiggy is like, there's Willow, say, let's say Willow's the, the, the little cute yellow minion. Not saying Tiggy's not cute, because mm. she is. She's very, yeah, very yeah. cute. Yeah. 
Tiggy, in terms of personality, Tiggy's the purple minion. Right. It's just a bit more. Ah. Say no more. Just a little bit more. Um, okay, how about some lavender jadeite to start your day? Oh, oh, especially yeah, considering color. that we have got beautiful type A black bicones. How perfect would these be? Would no, amazing. Just one. Just one bicone yeah, underneath or yeah. above, whichever way you want to you want to do it. Nine ninety nine, certified completely natural. We all know the rarity of lavender. It's a whisper of lavender. <laughs> it's not. You don't. Yes. If you expect yeah. it, a, a suggestion. suggestion. Absolutely. Like a moment. <laughs> See if we can come up lots of different words to sort of yeah to indicate the level of colour. Well, it's not going to shout lavender at you. That's what we're saying. It's a very soft, lovely, subtle, pretty colour. Nine ninety nine. Amazing. How about some? Natural rubies. Those rubies you had yesterday were insane. I know. I think they sold out. Did they? Did oh. they sell out or did they not sell out? Oh, we got a handful. Right. Handful left. If we can, we'll, we'll get, get them. Sunday. Yeah, That'd we'll schedule them on Sunday yeah. show. Yeah. And if you don't know what we're talking about, tune in on Sunday. Yeah. We'll try and schedule it then. Um, yeah, parcel of Burmese ruby. How about a strand wow. of natural ruby? Now, we know that 95% of the world's ruby is actually treated in some way, shape or form. Um, this isn't. Hello, Nikki saying, hi, El Mark and Fab team. OMG, Mark, I'm so glad my cats are house cats. Yeah. I remember, well, I think what's worse than, than half a mouse is, is a live mouse to be honest, because I've tried to catch a live mouse before. Um, that's not great. Last summer, Andrew went, because uh, he, he mows the lawn two or three times a week, and he went into the back garden. And in the middle, we've got a circular lawn, and dead right in the centre, like a bullseye on a dartboard, was a head looking up at him. Nothing else. Alive? A live head. <laughs> oh, what? okay. I didn't know. <laughs> Yeah, it moved around and winked at him. <laughs> I thought you meant just like poking out of the No, garage. just the head. Oh, no. Just the head in the middle of the lawn oh, looking up at him. Oh, dear me, no. I'm glad eyes. my cats are house cats as well. That's <laughs> awful. Yeah. Oh, my word. Mm. Oh, dear. Oh, look at these. <sighs> How about some beautiful nephrite jade eye? Uh, hello, Lancashire, you've requested this one. They're so amazing. number seven and 37, 37 I will bring to you as well, so don't worry. Um, don't wait on these though, Lancashire. I can see you oh, actually with it in your basket. Are, yeah. Make sure you do check out. Nephrite, the original jade, as it's so fondly referred to, it's actually been mined considerably longer than uh, that of jade eye. You know, when you see the uh, sort of ancient, <laughs> We do my mouse for that one. Um, when we, when you sort of read the Chinese uh, um, historic uh, information about your jade, it tends to be about nephrite. Leaving it with you at twenty four ninety nine. It's actually sold out. Well, oh, done. well done. Amazing. Wow. Shall we do some beautiful white freshwater cultured pearls? Um, amazing. Oh, now these are feel very often. Do we? Don't see keshis either. No. No. Um, pure nacre, so full of iridescence, full of amazing luster. Under £20 for Keshi pearls. Do you remember the days when Keshi pearls would have been mm, at least yes. 50? Yeah, yeah. At least. And that's because these are wonderful little stowaways um, that are created during the culturing process. We can't call them natural pearls because they are formed during the culturing process. However, they're not instigated. So they are as natural as they can possibly be. You get amazing luster from a Keshi pearl. How many do I have, Roscoe? Two. Two. Uh, hello, Angela, saying, good morning, guys. Well, Mark, I once witnessed my cat eating the same end of a mouse mm. while I was on the phone to a customer. Oh, no, oh, so you couldn't God. even do anything about it, could you? Oh, dear. Have I opened up a can of worms? Um, <laughs> um, my mum's cat used to have one of those magnets on her collar. Right. So that other, because we were getting lots of other cats coming oh, yeah, in and everything. Yeah. Um, and the once we heard, it was, you know, it's just clums, oh, clumsily fallen through that cat flap. It was just crash bang, crash yeah. bang. And you could hear her going, ah, 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 not meowing quite like she would normally. And then I heard this squeak, this, this really loud squeak, and she'd brought in a baby rabbit. Oh, no. Baby did rabbit. You manage to rescue yes, I did rescue the baby rabbit. Yeah. But gosh, they make a noise. Yeah. Um, trying to catch a baby rabbit is not easy. <laughs> um, how about some beautiful black jet? Uh, Rachel say, Mark, my cat used to bring me live mice when I was. Uh, um, a oh no. When there was a thunderstorm, as the mice couldn't hear us oh, stalking them. Weird. Yeah. Oh, okay. Never yes. Of that. Yeah. Yes. Do you know when cats bring them to you? It's like a. It's a gift. It's a gift, it, an offering. Yeah. So I've just got this. Have you ever seen um, How to Train a Dragon? No. 
So there's a cartoon called How to Train a Dragon, when the dragon actually sort of presents this little boy a fish, and he's, oh. he's, he's yeah, it's a gift. And he's kind of going, <laughs> as if to say, eat it, eat it. <laughs> I visualise your cats doing that to yeah. you. Eat the mouse. <laughs> How about some beautiful black jet? Oh, very, very, very busy this morning. If you have a little look at the website, you'll see just how busy. They would go beautifully with the Keshis, don't you think? Um, look how quickly all of these items are already selling out. Sold out. Oh, black retail's gone. Yeah, that's oh. gone. Sold out. Get your request in. I will play number 37, well, I do gone promise as well. you. Yeah, they've sold out. Sold out, sold out, sold out. Yeah, we are busy, busy, busy today. And also loving your messages, loving your cat stories. Honestly, they I've, are got, funny. I've got some stories, I tell you. <laughs> they are funny. Don't yeah. forget, we have got the last remaining quantity. They will all be slightly different because they're hand-carved, yeah, obviously. Um, it's in item number 35, Olmec Blue, the lost treasure of Guatemala. Guarantee your place because there are only 11 of these available and they are coming to you at an early bird saving. I mean, look at that amazing intricacy. It's fascinating, isn't it? Yeah. Um, uh, incredible, incredible. I can't quite get my head around this. To be fair, I saw the price as we were going up the internet earlier. What, this? Yeah. You mean? Yeah, yes. I know. Considering the quality of the gemstones as well that you have yeah. within this tray, um, you know, you are an immediate collector. We always say that whenever we bring yes. these... Hang on. Whenever we bring these to... Uh, whenever we bring these to air. Um, you know, most people will probably have to source these from lots of different areas. They actually sell these, I remember quite uh, quite vividly, they sell these actually in Tucson. Um, <clears throat> sometimes they're already sort of laid out in a specific design, but your jewelry design, jewelry makers, you can do that yourself. Um, the collection oh. that you have here, I mean, look, at the, look, look, look how amazing Ridiculous. that topaz is. You've got fire opal, you've got amazing specetite, you've got beautiful pink sapphire, you've got some diopside, I can see. I'm, I'm intrigued, that one there. Yeah, I'm intrigued. I need to get a little bit closer. Let's have a little look. Is that the tanzanite? At twenty nine ninety nine, you're getting fifteen carats. A beautiful. Yep, that is the tanzanite. That is You'd a pay bike. That for that, exactly. Twenty nine ninety nine should be for that one stone on its own. But it's working out at like a, a couple of pound each, I think. I'll leave it with you because I know we only have a couple of those left. Wow. Um, let's do a r speedy auction, says Roscoe. I, I can't see it. Where is it? Oh yeah, there it is hidden behind those absolutely enormous pearls. <laughs> oh, these are nice. Bumblebee Jasper. I see Tom wearing that yeah, on a stretchy would, bracelet. Yeah, he would wear yeah, that. Yeah. He would. I think so, That's yeah. lovely. It's cool, isn't it? Forms in the shallow waters of Indonesia, yeah. totally natural. You get. It's one of the most distinctive gemstones, I think, Beautiful. that exists. That's, it's lovely. Stunning, stunning. Um, and we're effectively looking at the... Whoa, the side profile, aren't we? So imagine mm. if you were to do like a bubble yes, style with right. these. Yeah. You're going to see all that gorgeous marking. Seven ninety nine is what? going to sell out. Yeah, uh, yeah. <laughs> that should have that should be seventeen at the very very least. Um, don't forget your amazing early bird today. Brand new cut. Um, I don't recall ever doing this cut in type A jadeite, faceted, top drilled rectangles. A strand like this should really be, as it's set really on the website, uh, say let's say a hundred pounds for type A jadeite. Um, they're not closing anywhere near a hundred pounds this morning. So do shop ahead. Wow. Um, again, guarantee your place. I expect these to be an on-screen sellout. Type yeah. A green jadeite. There was a picture that Dan recently put up of a, of a, um, a jadeite bracelet with three bead bezeled. Um, yeah, if you could bring that up. Imagine those squares in that design. So don't, oh, don't, don't yeah. use the drill hole. Just bead bezel them and make them into the most amazing bracelet. I think that would be incredible. That would be absolutely beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, beautiful. Dan. Um, oh, here we go. Here we go. Sorry. I've got it now. Got it now. I was just trying to find. There's so many goodies in this hour, it's difficult to find them all. Um, how about some beautiful green amber? Um, yeah, Ross is saying, oh, a lot of them get snapped up before we can oh, even bring no. them to air. But we will honour the, of course, early bird price tags. Um, less than 2% of the world's amber is green. So we are looking at one of the rarest colours. I love green amber. It's beautiful, isn't it? Because we always talk about cognac having like a gold leaf inside. Yeah, it's yeah. not actually gold leaf, but it looks like that, doesn't it? Um, whereas... Green amber, I think it's almost like silver. It's like moss. It's it got is. embedded it's moss so within pretty. it. It's so pretty. It's such a lovely it? shade, isn't it? Mm. This oh. was a request um, from Rachel, a.k.a. Glitter Sloth. I love it. Sloths are one of my favourite animals. I think they're the best. If ever I come back in life as an animal and I get a choice, it's either going to be a dog or a sloth. 
because I can relate to both of them. Um, twelve ninety nine. Hello, Karen. Say so my cat uh, no. brought me a live mouse for breakfast and dropped it in my mug of coffee. <laughs> oh my! Poor mouse. <laughs> Poor mouse. Oh, Bloop. <laughs> Treading water. Imagine. Oh bless him. Oh, poor little I mean, thing. he's energised, isn't he? He's yeah, got his caffeine yeah. intake for the day. Uh, hello, Margaret. My neighbour's cat proudly strolled down our lawn with a frog in its mouth. Just held it by its foot, oh, swinging. <laughs> I managed to save the frog. Oh, good. Thank goodness. They squeal. Frogs. Do they? They really squeal. I like yeah. a frog. Yeah. We've got a, we've got a frog. It's unusual for them to actually kill a frog because they <laughs> do this horrible tasting slime. They do. The defence mechanism. Yeah, well. yeah. Um, what do you say? I can't see Jade Eye Nuggets. Don't see Tumbles. We can, oh, there we go. There we are, there we are. Um, we, have, we have a resident frog in our garden. Yeah, we oh, do as well. It's those I pearls, they keep yeah. hiding. They are, yeah. They're enormous. Yeah, and I'm always ever so paranoid about running over with the lawnmower. So whenever I cut the grass in the summer, I'm kind of like shifting it, making sure that he's not under there. Um, I've only got five opportunities. Again, imagine these with your beautiful black jadeites that are coming up in a bit I would later grab on. two of these and do the most amazing marla. Lovely. Because you'll have enough with the, with the two strands. Have a little marla. And with your pastel palettes of your yes. agate, I think would be That'd really be amazing, pretty. It's all certified completely and utterly natural. Those would you want, yeah? I think, <laughs> of course. Oh, yeah. oh, they definitely do. Nine ninety nine for Type A jadeite. It's Great. yeah. I don't think I'll ever get over that being able to and say. It's, it's a really nice. It's more like price. a tumble than a nugget, isn't it? It because is. The drill hole is is side to side rather than a, a jaunty angle. So it's perfect for knotting. At a funny angle. Yeah, funny angle. Is that uh, what I said? <laughs> no, you said oh, jaunty, but jaunty. I was like, I just had uh, flashbacks to that film, isn't it? Yeah. It's a funny angle. <laughs> uh, type A jadeite. Amazing, amazing. Let's do beautiful Jasper I rounds. Jasper. I think we're doing another Jasper show, aren't we, soon, I hope? Jasper mania. Jasper mania. Yeah, let's yeah. do it. Yeah. Let's do it. Yeah. Um, love African Look Jasper. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. There you go. Perfect. They go together beautifully, yeah. don't they? Um, we're going to give you an amazing deal on these, shall we? It's a beautiful, natural, genuine gemstone. For those of you that love to have, I'll bring you that strand next. Um, for those of oh, you that no. do love to have sort of your, uh, um, more, I don't know, earthy tones. Four ninety nine. Again, Marla. I'd, I'd get two of these and I'd use bright Shanghai red as nice. the knotting Ooh. material. Oh, here we go. Like this, for example, in between. Funnily enough. Perfect. Got that coming up in the we next have. hour, haven't we? Yes, yeah. Yeah, so if you want to do uh, take Mark's inspiration, we have the thread for it as well, which is like gold dust threading mm. material at the moment. I don't know why, but it is. I had to order some off eBay the other day. Did you? Yeah. Oh, dear. And I work here at Jewelry Maker, yeah. Um, we'll do that lovely Chinese Jasper uh, next. It's more of a soft... Uh, it, it, it's funny, isn't it? Just the polish and the textures of gemstones, how, how greatly they can differ. Chinese jasper, if I put the two together, you can see African jasper's got this really high luster almost. Um, and Chinese jasper is just that little bit more sort of muted, I guess. Um, love it, because I love the colors that you get within Chinese jasper. Again, it is completely natural. These are big stones, oh, six pounds and 99 pence only. I, I love it because there's so many different gemstones that it, it reminds me of. It's it just stunning, isn't it? Mookite, yeah. picture jasper. Um, what's the other one? Picasso, Justin. Picasso. One. Crazy lace agate. It, it's it's yeah. got all of those beautiful yeah, it's, things it's within one. How many did I have though, Ross? Only oh, seven no. left. So have a little look on the website. Lots of items are selling out ahead of us even actually playing them. We will honour your early bird price tags, of course. And keep your text messages in. Um, we are definitely a channel of feline lovers for sure, but also canine lovers and all other furry absolutely. animals. No, absolutely. They are the best, aren't they? Yeah. I couldn't be without. I, I, I just, I couldn't be without an animal in the house. Mm. I did the, I did the whole cat, cat years thing last night because Thomas is thirteen in May, Ooh. and he's sixty-eight. Oh. And we didn't realise, but he's been the oldest in the household now for three years. He over, he overtook Andrew three years ago. So bless he's him. the oldest in the house. Bless it, bless Thomas. He's a senior. Senior. He's got his <laughs> bus pass. Yeah. Um, let's have a look at. One auction's time. Ouroboros. Ouroboros. It's in number 35. You can guarantee yours there are only 11 of them. This is hand-carved Olmec blue Guatemalan jade. Think about how few, you know, how few 
Guatemalan jade mm. carvings we've actually brought to it. Sorry, we'll bring it in two auctions time. Um, so shop ahead, secure yours, everybody, uh, you know, all, all, all 11 or less, depending if people multiply. Uh, didn't, I can't remember whether it was you or Carol launched Meteorite recently with yeah, Jake. Yeah, me. Was it you, was it? Mm -hmm. it? Then we must have a piece that would, a little coin that would fit oh, into that Oh, how circle. perfect. And then wear that in your pendant. That would, would be amazing. Right just, just try and sort of either push it in Almost or like, it in. Almost like or... Rolex do with the dial. Yeah. Put it in. That, that would be incredible. incredible. Oh, great yeah. idea, yeah. great idea. Um, okay, let's do, oh, these pearls go. are just incredible. Now there is one, this is the one that you are getting. Three of you actually have this in your basket. There is a bidder on the phone line straight away. Um, there is only one there chance. There is only one. There is only one, exactly. Um, yesterday, my husband tuned in and he was like, I'm not tuning in again because uh, <laughs> clearly you want to buy. So yeah, it ends up, it ends <laughs> yeah, he's like, clearly it's going to cost me a fortune if I tune in on a regular basis. Um, one of the gemstones that I buy, probably the gemstone I buy the most is our pills. And I said it yesterday and I'll say it again. Our, I think it is our, one of our greatest strengths here at Jewelry Maker, the quality of the pills that we bring to you. You know, never lose sight of that. Just because we haven't got, you know, the, 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 the posh carpet and the security guard on the front entrance doesn't mean that you are not purchasing high grade quality pills. These are remarkable and should be at some point valued, should be at some point insured there are four of oh, you in no. for this one single opportunity these are some of the biggest pearls that we have within our entire inventory they're enormous they go up to 30 millimeters in their size huge huge and you're getting 13 on a strand i mean can you imagine wearing this can you imagine that's amazing isn't it that color is totally natural so if you see colored pearls more than likely not always but more than likely they've been bleached and dyed no problem with that whatsoever however when you get a pearl um, that's totally natural like this understand it's amazing rarity this is the one that you are going to be getting there was only ever seven in existence um, the fact that these are 30 millimeters in their size will tell me tells me that this would have been one pearl per mollusk the mollusk would have probably been like a serving plate it has never been anywhere near this low price tag goodness me oh my goodness me they're 30 mils upwards to 30 millimeters in their size and completely naturally colored. Yes. Um, we cannot go a single penny lower, take it or leave it. That is the best deal I've ever seen for, for, for yeah, it, it genuinely is probably one of the best deals that I've ever, ever, ever brought you on Pearls. Well, well done, oh. Lancashire, they're remarkable. They really well. are. And they look even better in person. So wait till you see those. Um, okay, shall we do, shall we do some more amazing Pearls? Put that back on there. Um, these come here. <laughs> Just wrecking the joint, sorry. One second. One second. Okay, let's do... Ugh. Number 27 on the website. You've got, what, 22 minutes left on this hour. So, again, if you've got items in your baskets, check them out. Some items have already sold out. Um, caged pearls. And we launched these, didn't we, as... Um, as, as, a, as a deal of the day, you quite did. recently. Yeah, you and I did. Yeah, yes. and they absolutely flew as well. There aren't many left. You are getting two of one design. Can you see that? Hang on, let me get my tweezers. See, I would, I would ignore the pearls and just, just focus on the, on the cages because you can put any gemstone in. So yeah. If you're gifting a birthstone to, to, a, to a, a relative, you can pop their birthstone in. Lovely and idea. Or something else. So that's what I would <coughs> recommend doing. Yeah, no, I think that's a cake. great idea. Yeah. yeah. I mean, look, look, we found, we launched them. We launched them the other day. Uh, <coughs> sorry, three of the same designs, just looking at a different angles. Mm. My bad. Um, and then you get the three culture pills. So I looked elsewhere and we found almost exactly yes. the same design, yeah. but this one's actually in, is that in gold plated sterling silver or is it? I'd, uh, sure, well, if it was rose gold, you would hope that it would say gold, wouldn't you? Um, 194. Okay, so you can either get it in silver or gold. Mm. 194 pounds to 470 pounds, but it's almost identical in it terms is. of the design. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and that's just for one, remember. You're not getting three. 
Take a look at this one, £89, Rose Quartz, Caged in Sterling Silver, Angel Whisperer, another cage design, £129 in Sterling Silver, really pretty, very pretty. <laughs> I tell you what, you're not just getting one, you're getting three. How about £10 per pendant? For a genuine cultured pearl wow. and all that sterling silver, all that amazing engineering as well, the fact yeah. that these literally open and close and the bale itself is the class. That's right. Imagine if you had three bridesmaids. Ah. Just that, you know, that piece of jewel. What? Three cousins, three sisters, oh, no. three uh, friends, yeah. whatever it might yeah. be. Children. So m meaningful these are. I love them. Yeah. And I love your idea of putting the birthstone in there. We're going to take these for the final few. They were a deal of the day. Mark and I literally launched them. Was it last week? I think it was. Um, it was December, I think, was it? It was December. It was in December. Wow. I'm so bad yeah. at keeping track of time just lately. 23rd. 23rd oh. of December. We're going to take these under £20 for you today. Again, if you want to substitute out the pearls, put another gemstone in there, you absolutely can um, do that, of course. Look. There you go. So all you do, they are pretty, aren't they? What would they look like as an earring? They wouldn't be, they wouldn't be too heavy, would they? No, I don't have a, think have a so. You'd have a couldn't you? Pendant and earring set. I don't think they'd be yeah. too big at all. I think they'd be oh, absolutely yes, perfect. Yeah, yeah. Under £20 for the nine... Oh, yeah, so this is the pendant, and these, are, these have got, like, a different jump ring. So they are different. Yes. <laughs> uh, so this one's got that disguised bail. This one's got more of the just Which the plain jump ring. Well. Just pop a jump ring on. And, exactly. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. 19.99. So beautiful, aren't they? Really beautiful, of course, June's birthstone. But if you wanted to use one of your faceted rounds or, or, mm. or, or, or plain rounds or yeah. any of your gemstones that you have already in your stash, you can absolutely do that. Helen has snapped up two. Well done. That means you've got literally six of these sterling silver components coming uh, coming your way. Conway, Antoinette, Leslie, Tina, Tyne and Ware, Maker. Um, remember the, uh, is it Aurora Borealis as in, as in the Northern Lights? Or a Borus? Thank you. Uh, thank you. Um, I'm, the tendency, yeah. I, I keep wanting to say Aurora yeah, Borealis. Um, the Ouroboros is coming up just after this, everybody. So hopefully you have jumped ahead and secured yours as well. For the three pearls at 19 99 I think that's amazing. But you're also getting the beauty um, of those wonderful, almost like a Cinderella's uh, uh, carriage. Carriage, yes. Isn't it? Um, with those as well. Times three. We only had 19, though. I think this is going to be the last airing. Yeah, I've got seven yeah. of them left, and I've got more than that of you with it in your basket. So, multi buyers there. Good morning, Irene. Good morning, Sally Ann. Good morning, Maker, Linda, Tyne and Ware, Leicestershire. Nice to be with you as, as well. Keep those lovely messages coming in as well. We're, I'm glad that it's not just our cats that te are terrors. Have we had a lovely message yet? Well, true. <laughs> That's true. Just oh. menaces, aren't they, cats? Yeah. Thomas, my old cat, he's never caught a mouse in his life. He's just not that way inclined. So what he does, he waits for Ripley to massacre something and he picks up the remnants and brings in and pretends that he caught it. <laughs> it's hilarious. Takes the credit. <laughs> wow. It's so funny. Just think, look at me. You didn't get that at all, honestly. It's like, yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. Funny. Praise me. <laughs> Pra oh, bless him. Bless him. Thomas. Um, okay. Right. Two have already gone on pre-order. There are nine remaining. Now, every single one of these will be slightly unique. And that's because they are all literally hand carved. You are literally purchasing a work of art here. But even more that, more than that, this gemstone was lost for centuries, 450 years. That's why they refer to it as the lost treasure of Guatemala. This is a, a type of jadeite that only in this one location, in dense jungle surroundings, forms in this beautiful Olmec blue. If you go to the GIA website, that's the Gemological Institution of America, and ask the question, as somebody already has done, does jadeite form in blue? They will mention that uh, only here. You only, only get blue in the Guatemalan jade. It is totally and utterly natural. 
And this location, I think, probably has one of the most exciting stories. All jadeite is steeped in history and it's got wonderful legends and myths attached to it. Um, but the Guatemalan deposit, you know, the, we've shared with you the Montezuma and the Cortez, you know, that, uh, that game of chess that they played on a daily basis, at which point at the end they would exchange gifts with one another. This is the treasure that they held the closest and the dearest. And they literally guarded until that civilization died out and hence the location of the gemstone. But what is the Ouroboros? Because I'm learning this with you as well. Ouroboros derives from a Greek word meaning tail devourer. So it's a snake eating its own tail. Wow. Mm -hmm. While the word is not attested in English until 1940s, the concept of the Ouroboros is very ancient, used across many cultures as a symbol of cosmic harmony, eternity, and the cycle of birth and death. Wow. It's, it's, it's a symbol of rebirth. Do you know, this is interesting, because I was trying to explain to, 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 to my eldest, you know, the circle of life. She was like, Mom, what's the circle of life? You know, that's what this is, effectively, it is. isn't it? Absolutely, yeah, yeah. The earliest known Ouroboros symbol comes from the 14th century BCE Egyptian uh, religious text found in the tomb of King Tutankhamun. Uh, the symbol appears in a passage about the origin of the sun god Ra uh, through a union with the death god Os Os Osiris, mm, yeah, yeah. meant to illustrate creations through destruction. Ancient Egyptians also used the Ouroboros to symbolize the flooding of the Nile. While occurred in several season cycles and was of great importance to ancient Egyptians, agriculture and society, other ancient cultures also incorporated the Ouroboros symbol. Norse legend tells of the great serpent, I'm not even going to try and pronounce Jorman that. Gundar. That, well done, Mark. <laughs> who encircles the earth and bites its own tail. Hindu uh, cosmology features the Ouroboros as helping to prop up the earth. Oh. The Ouroboros was specifically adopted by Gnostic, Gnostic mm. philosophers in the second century BCE. For them, it symbolizes the dual nature of existence, marked by life and death, male and female, light and dark, mortality and divinity, or earth and heaven. Alchemists notably use the Ouroboros, Ouroboros II to represent the element mercury believed to, uh, words here, uh, is that permeate? Permeate. permeate uh, and unite all matters. A drawing of the Ouroboros can be found in one of the earliest alchemy, I can't say these words, uh, alchemical, alchemical texts and that thing Chrysopia. about... <laughs> I give up now. Too early in the morning for all of this. Thank you. <laughs> From the third century. century. So, oh my goodness me! Yeah. It this has to be then one of the mm, earliest origins. Yeah, it must be. Yeah. Of, of symbols, because we've gone back right the way to second century, century BCE. BC. Wow. So there it is. In Tutankhamun, oh, there's, the there's the serpent head above. You can his see head. at the top, can't yeah. you? Oh, yeah. Literally eating its tail. Yeah. How incredible! So, like I said, I'm learning this with you because I wasn't here on Christmas Day when this was originally mm. launched. And the fact that 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 symbol is across multiple different cultures yeah. and passed through literally centuries upon centuries, but then to adopt that meaning the Ouroboros, into, again, a steeped in history, uh, history location of jadeite. It's just perfection, isn't it? Here's another depiction. This is pictured, uh, this picture is from medieval. 1478, so medieval even text, medieval yeah. times. Yeah. Yeah. How amazing is this? Now, every single one will be unique because they are all hand carved. Four have gone literally since we're talking about it. And when people ask you about it, um, you can say, you know, the Ouroboros is symbolic of the circle of life, you know, I, I, continuity, I, continuity, continuity yeah, I like rebirth, amazing. Yeah, yeah. I liked when, um, when, when they spoke about sort of that night and day, male mm. and female, you know, it's, it's everything that life really uh, sort of encompasses. 
Are you ready? Because this is going to be an on-screen sellout. They're all one of a kind, all completely unique. We've got six remaining. Oh, Started wow. with 11 of them at the beginning of this morning. It is type A, certified, Guatemalan, all mech jade. Every one will be unique. They are literally hand carved. If they were identical, then you'd know they're machine carved effectively. Um, and that's not ideal. Every single one has been placed into the hands of a skilled lapidaris, an amazing master carver. To be starting even here at £499 is just remarkable, isn't it? Um, let's half that price tag. Because I know also oh, if they were launched yeah. on Christmas Day, you'd have got an amazing Christmas Day price tag as well. I'm going to reread that. You know, do, do you have to read it and then read it again and di to digest <laughs> to digest all that information but that's fascinating absolutely yeah. fascinating um there we go completely natural the dual nature of existence marked by life and death male and female light and dark mortality and divinity or earth and heaven amazing incredible you can get this home today for 62 pounds and uh, 25 wow. pence um, hello, Liz. Oh, that ring. So lovely with such an amazing meaning, isn't yeah, it? Isn't it? Yeah. Fascinating. Like I said, I was learning that with you as well, Liz. Um, whether you wear it as a ring mm. or whether you choose to wear it as a pendant, it's, fun it's wonderful that it can be both. Great that gents can actually yes. wear it as a ring too. Yes. There is a drill hole, very discreetly That's placed. Very discreet. Yeah. I didn't even know it was there. No. It, yeah, you lovely. really do have to look yeah. for it. Um, so that you can actually attach it to a jump ring if you want to. £199. Wow. Pounds. <laughs> way, that's way lower. Way, way, way lower than I was expecting this to be. You know, all the complexities of carving a, um, a bangle, no disrespect, kind of goes out the window here, doesn't it? Because you've got something that's significantly smaller than bangle, hence the risk is elevated. Um, and then you've got all that intricacy. So I, I guess you would create that sort of almost like archer ring shape mm -hmm. and then go on to actually add that amazing amount of detail. And if you look up close here, certainly to the one that I've got in studio um, that I can see uh, I can see in the camera before you, very gemmy, you've got amazing translucency, but look at how detailed the jaw structure is, even down to, I don't know what you would call that part of a serpent, you know, where it's almost got like a, uh, like a fin of a, mm. um, of a a fish that level of detail you can get this home today for 49 pounds and 75 pence there are literally five of them left is that not your christmas day price point did you go lower much oh. is there You've got about 10 minutes left on this hour to get make the most of these deals. You've still got that type A jadeite strand to bring. Four of them are left. We might even sell out before we, we drop that price. Three left. We will still drop it. Don't worry. Don't you worry. Nobody is paying 199 The meaning behind this, three out of the 11 chances remaining, down to two. Where's this going? I have no idea. Uh, I, I was thinking this was going to be two hundred and ninety nine oh, pounds right. at the very least, and I would have been happy at two hundred and ninety nine. How much are the basic um, jadeite rings that we're selling? It's a very good question. Yeah, I think about they were. that and the faceted ones even more. Yeah, they? yeah. Oh, I, it, I, I guess because this was a Christmas yeah. day, uh, this was a Christmas day deal. Um, all neck jadeite with that level of de that level of detail, that level of carving. Just absolutely incredible. The meanings behind it as well. Um, all associated to the wonderful, wonderful circle of life, uh, effectively. That's what I take from it. £32.25 on your split payments. How amazing. There are two chances remaining. Sandra, Suja, Margaret, Ron, uh, Jenny, Sandra, new customer, Warren, I can see you there. Jenny, I can see you there as well. People wanting multiples. If you want those quantities that I can see, Surrey wants, uh, wants to, Maker wants to, Hertfordshire wants to. If you want those quantities, I literally have two. Um, so you need to be really quick checking out. Good luck, everybody. Just, just beautiful, absolutely beautiful. All that wonderful meaning. Ouroboros. I've got one remaining now. Just one left. One left. And that's fascinating. Oh, gosh. It might have gone. Our system's a little bit behind. A little bit behind than the call centre system. It might well have sold out. 
Um, it's worth asking the question. Well done. Well done, well done. Um, okay, let's go straight into another roll mate carving. So, amazing, incredible. This is huge. It is huge. It might well, do you know, Guatemalan jade might well be my, my, yeah, my favourite. I love the colour. Me too. I love the colour. It's so distinctive, mm. isn't it? And not just in the gemstone world, you know, in, in Mother Nature itself, you know, it is rare to get this particular shade of colour. You know, you think there's very few um, birds, plants, animals that actually have this natural blue. It was requested earlier on. The level of detail that you're getting here, and you, you know, every time you look at it, you'll probably find something new and exciting. Again, like uh, your uh, Ouroboros, you've actually got, uh, everyone is done by hand, so they will differ ever so slightly, but they're all amazing works of art. Because of the popularity of the last one, we're gonna bring you this amazing, amazing landscape. <laughs> to what, sorry? To a brand new low price tag, okay, okay. I can see real movement with this one. So everyone has got different designs and that's because they are literally done by hand. The catch is though, if we're gonna take it to a brand new low, you only have five minutes to make the most of that brand new low price tag. Wow. Type A, Guatemalan Olmec Blue Jade Eye. You can see the differences. So for example, I've got one here with flowers at the front, just there, can you see yeah. that? Um, and the one on the recording, you can see you, the pagoda, you can see the little man looks in the like boat a, at the like bottom there. It's like a dragon there. poodle thing on the left-hand side. Yeah, can incredible. You I also see the, wheat, uh, the, yeah. the, the, the leaves blowing. Can mm, you see that yeah. as well? 199 pounds, it's a brand new low, but it is only available for five minutes. How many do we have then, Ross? Five. Oh, it's a massive carrot weight. You know, we've shown you in the past Olmec jade eyes. You know what? Never mind the Guatemalan location. We know that's rare. We know it's exciting. We know it's expensive ordinarily. You know, we've shown you carvings from wherever in the world of beautiful jadeite for significantly more than what's on your screens right now. And you actually have trouble deciphering what it is in those carvings yeah, exactly. you know there was i think there was a black jadeite carving that's a similar kind of shape and it said dragon but i couldn't make out the dragon whereas we absolutely know what that one is it's a brand new lowest ever price we cannot go a single penny lower than that that's astonishing deal wow. well done um okay don't forget coming up your taipei burmese jadeite two more auctions we're literally yeah squeezing in as much as we possibly can um make sure oh i'm so glad oh. you said that ross there are two of this strand. Is this, is this, it's this one. Oh, this strand. Is this the strand I have? I think it is as well. Um, yeah, Tom, I'm chuckling because Tom said to me, like I said, he bought me some pills yesterday, he was watching. Um, and he said, um, <clears throat> yeah, you only have to sell one of your pills though. So I was like, do I? <laughs> do I? <laughs> Look at these. He, I think he was joking. There was only ever 10. I know. Amazing color. Natural ultraviolet color. Natural. There are literally two chances from the 10 that we originally launched. These should, yeah, that's okay. They, uh, these are perfect round pearls. Yes, you've got the odd little indentation, little, I don't want to say blemish, because I think that sounds like a, a negative word, characteristic um, on the surface of these pearls, and that should be expected. At the end of the day, these are natural organic gemstones that form within a living organism. You know, much like we have, I don't know, freckles, moles, whichever it might be, the odd wrinkle here and there. That's because we are naturally organic. That colour as well, all down to those amazing mollusks. Can you imagine the length of time that it would have taken to literally match those, those colours when they are already single anomalies of nature? Huge in this size, particularly given the fact that these are round shape. Again, the rarity of the colour, the five virtues are absolutely being ticked and then some. There are just two left. I mean, we had 10. That's it. We had 10 opportunities. These are the quality of the pearls that you see in your Yoko of London. They're the quality of pearls that you see in or, you know, your Boucheron, your Boodles, all of those big high-end jewellery designers that we, you know, quite, quite almost flippantly mention. Do you think they source their pearls from different pearl, uh, uh, pearl farms than we do? Absolutely not. You know, when I was at Tucson, we would have been stood alongside their same buyers. 
Lowest ever price tag for each and every single one of you today for round what? pearls, perfect round pearls. <laughs> As a rule of thumb, it is changing ever so slightly. Um, spherical pearls command the highest price tag. Wow. Spherical pearls, then it's probably drop pearls and your baroques, those because they're huge at the moment. <clears throat> but to get that perfectly uniform shape, um, I have one left now. Anna, if Anna, is that? Oh, <laughs> you have company, Anna. By the way, I've one of these available. You need to make sure you check out those baskets. Um, Anna upstairs is interested in these as well. Anna in Derbyshire is interested. You've got yours. Well done, Anna. They are truly beautiful. And for me, I love to have those kind of little, 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 little characteristics on the surface because that actually showcases that they're genuine pearls, not imitation or faux. Um, incredible. Absolutely incredible. Now, I'm going to leave that last one with you. The jadeite is coming up immediately after this auction. You know it's special, don't you? These are beautiful. You get the box. I love ripple pearls. There are just two available. That's all. I'm just going to tilt it forward for a second. All natural colours. Ripple pearls are oh my word. so, so, so popular at the moment. And again, it goes back to what we just said. You know, those little textures only demonstrate that they are genuine. They're not faux, they're not plastic, they're not imitation. These are genuine pearls and they're celebrated for having those beautiful. Do you remember that? Do you remember the advert, the, the um, Cadbury's Flake advert? Mm -hmm. Back in the day when they used yeah. to throw that silk sheet up in the air. Only and it the used crumbliest flake. And she used to eat it in a bath, didn't she? Looking all saucy. Yeah, yeah but it was, it, it was how that silk mm. fell. Yeah, that's true. It's yeah. like a ripple pearl. Yeah. You get those really beautiful, beautiful folds of nacre, which only enhances the colors and the natural iridescence. Now, there are only two available opportunities. Who would like these today at a lowest ever price point? Should they be reduced? No, absolutely not. You know, just because, especially given the fact we're saying, oh, we've only got two. Listen, most high-end jewelers would only have one. Just one. Just they one. would have one, and it would be knotted in silk, and it would have an 18-karat gold clasp. The quality of the strand, the pearls, and the price that we are taking to do not match up. So please, please, please forget what as little as you are paying for this, because, oh my word. <gasps> oh my word. Yeah, it's far too low. That really? is. E do you know, even if there was a zero at the end of that price tag, it's far too low. Far too low. That's ridiculous. It is ridiculous. You're right, Mark. Because look at it, look at the colours. Pistachios, coppers. The amatrines. Uh, yeah. yeah. Mm. Amazing, amazing multiple colours across the surface. We talk about overtones and undertones when it comes to pearls. You've got multiple colors. And again, I have to say the difference in the light and the recording, that's purely because the one I'm holding here is flooded by literally floodlights. And the recording on your screens right now is one single light source. A pearl will take on the color of its surroundings. So for example, if you're wearing blue, you'll see more blue. If you're wearing pink, you'll see more pink. Mm. They're fascinating. They're little oh. mirrors, if you like. That price point does not match up. So make the most of it, 49 pounds and 75 pence. You've got just a couple of minutes to get hold of that. Um, now the big old make carving update that we took to a brand new low to 199 pounds. There is one left of that, oh, cool. literally one left. There's the details on your screen, so you can still, look at it, it's huge. Um, it's absolutely huge. There's one of these uh, pieces remaining. We're actually over allocated. Possibly the biggest Olmec jadeite that we've actually ever had. So um, loving that, absolutely loving that. What about the Ouroboros? Is that so? There's one, one left of the Ouroboros. We'll bring the graphics live for that as well, with all that amazing meaning and history. <clears throat> I love that, and I love the fact that I like jewelry that has a conversation behind it. So to say that the you know, this is an Ouroboros. This is what it means. It's sort of a, um, it, it, it sort of has. It depicts the circle of life, if you like. Um, I love that, and it has sort of 
That symbol has been used across many different cultures and civilizations. £129. We've just realised you can get the Olmec Jadeite and the Ouroboros for less than £300 today. Three, less, sorry, less than 350 My maths is terrible. Um, absolutely amazing. And £32.25 right now. Do you know, simple lark's head knot. That's, it, that's all you need. Yeah, I, I, I'd there. give this to Tom. I think Tom would wear something yeah. like this. It's just cool, isn't it? Does he wear jewellery? Yeah. He does? Yeah. Yeah, he does. Mm. Loves a stretchy bracelet. Mm. Loves paracord. Mm. And things like that. So, yeah, absolutely impendence. Um, £129 only or use your split pay. Are you ready, though? Because we are running out of time now. The whole of the entirety of the hour will close when this auction closes. We've never done this cup before, we believe, um, in your jadeite. They are huge. They're absolutely huge. I'm looking at one, two, three, four, five, six, seven on the strand. Seven solitaires, because if you want to use them as cabochons, you absolutely yeah, can. Yeah, absolutely, I would. Or just one single pendant. On a memory wire necklace. Ah, beautiful. Just, just one, nothing else. Beautiful. Lovely. But look at that lovely apple green. Beautiful, isn't it? Amazing. Now, this is one of the most limited early birds that we've ever done. Oh. It is brand new. It is a premiere. It's never been on your screens before. Remember that you have got your type A black jade out rounds coming up as well at 10 o'clock. Um, you'll need to be quick on this one because I have less than 50 available opportunities. That beautiful apple blossom green comes from Mother Nature and Mother Nature only. It's your early bird and we're doing it right now. So to start here, though, let's be honest, to, to, to even suggest starting at double figures, let's be honest, is too low, isn't it? Is far too low. But... Wonderful jewellery makers. Listen, um, I would consider myself a collector as well. Um, I know what this is going to, and all I'm going to do from one gemstone lover to another is give you a, a gigantic hint, a big wink, and suggest that if you love it, you dial extra early, because I know what the early bird price is going to be, and it's no way near this, that, which is ridiculous. Mm. Absolutely ridiculous. Seven on a strand. I tell you what. How about if we said, <laughs> look at that, look at the size of them. How about if we said £10 each? You mentioned earlier on about that Wall of Fame mm, entry. Yes, yeah. It'd be perfect, wouldn't it? Completely, yeah, it'd be beautiful. Type A grade. You know, we spoke yesterday, we had, we shared uh, sort of the, the, the messages from Sally Hewer saying that nobody is... Her team are primarily working with type B jadeite. Mm. Primarily working with type B because they can't get hold of type A jadeite. It's fantastic, she said, if you're a seller because you can choose your price. She goes, not so fantastic if you are a buyer because it's expensive now. Yeah, something like this, this beautiful creation. That, is do. this in tomorrow's Wall of Fame? This, this, this was made by Hannah at Osborne, I think. Oh, OK. Yeah, yeah. But you could do that, couldn't Easily. you? Easily. It'd be perfect. Just because it's drilled, you don't have to use the drill hole. No. That'd just be stunning. Just, just exactly replicate that with three. And I'd go for probably the same colours, you know, gunmetal. Lovely. And a sort of turquoisey blue colour. Oh, look at that. On average, these are over 10 carats in each individual solitaire. We're wow. at £10 per stone... We're going to half that price and we're still not stopping there. You need to be quick on this one because, uh, again, for what... Oh, we're halving that price, yeah. not the first price. No. Oh, my God. Uh, we're still what? not done. We're still not done. That's £5 per Taipei Burmese jadeite. <laughs> and, and, again, faceted jadeite. Oh. Whenever you see faceted jadeite, if you love the appearance, snap it up as quickly as, quickly as you possibly can because it is a gemstone that they really facet. Quite literally, when you're looking at, when we're holding something that is physically one of the most valuable commodities that exists on this planet, a lapidarist, uh, a gemstone dealer won't want to cut the carat weight away. They will sell it literally on its weight, um, which I, I totally get that. However, when you have got faceted jade, uh, jade art, you really appreciate it for the, the level of beauty that it brings you. Because jade art has got such an amazing luster. You know, it's, it's almost, well, we say jemmy, don't we? Um, we talk about that jemmy, jemmy, beautiful, almost liquid, melting ice-like luster. Then when you actually facet it across the surface, we call this a checkerboard faceting, it just seems to be multiplied. 
Are you ready for this early bird deal? It's one of the most l one of the most limited early birds. Good. Uh, see what I mean? And that's lower, Ross, than it says on my star by sheet. That's three pounds sixty per stone. I listen. When when Ross sent me the star by sheet last night, it says. 75 carats, type A, green jadeite, faceted rectangles, da 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 da, KMRU 93, 50 of them available at 29.99. I'm more than happy at 29.99, you just got a little extra, a little extra five pounds from our lovely Roscoe. Imagine they are... how difficult it must be to drill as well. Yeah, because it's shallow, isn't it? Yeah. So you don't need to point. veer off at an angle and you'll pierce the front or you'll pierce the back. Split the gemstone Split the in gemstone. half. So that alone. Yeah, you might have uh, what we call like a fault line. It's almost like a um, like a, a, a very tiny fracture that occurs naturally within the stone. Yeah, they would split. So they, I imagine they lose a huge yeah, amount. During, that's probably why we've only got 50. Yeah. <clears throat> um, now, everybody, we're over allocated. We're going to put 60 seconds onto our screen. Um, and at the end of the 60 seconds, we are closing this auction as well as all the other pieces that we have brought you this morning. So please check out, make sure you don't miss out. It's so frustrating when um, you go to check out and it's literally sold out. It happens even to us, doesn't it, Mark? All the time. Um, but you can always wish list it. Well done, Rupal, Richard, Angela, Diane, Pauline, Jenny, Suja, Maker, Penny, Patricia, Pauline, Gabrielle. Um, already confirming. We've got multi buyers. Hello to you. Yorkshire, Catherine, Linda, Gloucestershire, Penny, Helen, Sally, Oxfordshire. Well done to you. Um, people coming in who, who made an, uh, a purchase have then dialed back through again to, uh, to up their quantity. In 18 seconds, every single item that has been brought to you and is on our website right now will disappear. The Ouroboros, we've literally got one remaining. Um, carvings, one left of that. Beautiful amber, rose quartz is still available, but are you just... Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call centre with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those New Year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewellery Maker, Sewing Street and Hobby Maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewellery Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewellery Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. 
Jewelry makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, we have a mega sale on our website right now. There is up to 70% off items with over a thousand items available on all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. So pop along, take a look and start shopping. Did you know that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Again, we wish you could see what goes on behind this. We've just spent two and a half minutes looking at the beautiful woman that is Dua Lipa. I, did, I was like, I can't think what she looks like. I've just discovered her and she she's is amazing. She is breathtakingly yeah. beautiful. So I've got her CDs in CDs. Do you still do CDs? No. Oh, don't you? No, I, I'm not into streaming. So I've got the CDs in the car. Okay. That's the only CD player we've got in our entire house is in my car. We don't have one so at home. So you don't have Spotify streamed. or anything like that? Yeah, but it's streamed, isn't it? Yeah. I'm not good with streaming. I like to have the physical, okay. the physical Fair enough. thing. Yeah. Fair enough. I was, quite, I, I was quite late to the party on streaming. Yeah. I feel yeah. like I was, yeah. Um, yeah, I didn't know what she looked like. Yeah, she's very beautiful. Yeah. We're talking about the most yeah. beautiful women. Yeah. Who do we think? Who do we think Dan, who do you think is the most beautiful woman? I'm going to say my missus. Ah, oh, oh. yes, Dan. Good <laughs> right answer. answer. <laughs> Good answer. You said Elizabeth Hurley. Elizabeth Hurley, I think, is beautiful. She is yeah. very beautiful. Very, very yeah. beautiful. Kate Middleton. Kate Middleton, she's absolutely. Because she's yeah. got class as well, hasn't yeah. she? Yeah. Very classy. Yeah. Um, you mentioned that lady off Countdown. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Ross did. Sorry, Susie Dent. Mm. Ross says he loves, he loves Susie Dent. Um, who's the other lady that was on Countdown? Not Carol Vorderman. Rachel Riley. Rachel Riley. Yeah. I think she's very beautiful as well. Yeah. And the fact she's so intelligent as well. Anyway, <laughs> very good at maths. Yes. Do you know, can you imagine? I, I'm just visual having Rachel Riley and me sat next to each other, like just trying to work out. I just have this expression. <laughs> <laughs> no clue. Oh, Mark, kits, first lot of your these amazing are, these kits. These are lovely kits. Really different, again. Beautiful. And we were admiring yeah. your jewellery earlier on. Talk us through it once again for those that didn't tune in. So, or so tune all, in all the nine o'clock is all about buttons. OK, so we've got gemstone buttons. We've got silver buttons. We've, we've, we've got different mediums to work with buttons. This is really cute. This little... Um, this little macrame bracelet. It's got, it's got a mukite button, which I've used as a little clasp, a little loop. Oh, that cute, that's so. gorgeous. So I've made a, a multi-strand macrame bracelet and then I've used, you get two of these in the kit. So it's a really nice way of, of finishing off oh, your Oh, that your, kit's your, gonna your, absolutely fly macrame out, macrame bracelets, it? they're very, very cute. So that, we've got that style of button. Yeah. And then we've got the buttons that we mentioned earlier. So again, you can make this into a bracelet. I'm gonna demo this. You can make this into a bracelet or as I've done here, I've turned it into a bit of home decor. Beautiful. So we've got the, obviously, we've got the Labradorite, which is beautiful, look at that. Isn't that stunning? And then on the back, so it's reversible, you've got, oops, going off kilter there. You've got the gold stone, which is really beautiful. Amazing, so oh, that's gold stone. We've got that stone. style of button, yep. And then we've got these buttons. So we've got, we've got a little dragonfly on the necklace here. That's, again, that's just on um, memory wire. Bring this across. And again, you get, you get all the components. You get the CBs, you've got leather cord, brand new leather cord. So we've got the dragonfly here. And then I've got a multi-strand on the bottom here, which has got a little butterfly. You can see that. Oh, I love yeah, that one. So I does, love so that one. It's just landed, doesn't it? On your, it literally on does, bracelet. perched on the colours. Yeah, so this is, this, this is amazing leather in massive amounts we've got today. So that's just plaited with the 8 CBs here. And then we've got this 
for again, we've got all sorts of, of um, different styles. We've got day wear, evening wear. We've got this, um, again, we've got the silver circular button, which I've got on my pearl necklace just at the top here. That's it? beautiful too. So, um, yeah. Absolutely beautiful. It's all different styles of buttons, really easy to use. And can they make completely different. So they can be class, they can be features, they can be yeah, charms, yeah. Absolutely. Um, embellishments. Six different kits. Yeah. Ross, are you going to put all of them on the website? All oh. available, there we go, on pre-order. Silly prices, <laughs> great threading materials yeah, yeah. as well. So if you yeah. have a little look at, uh, at the website, all the dubs at jewelmaker.com, they are going lower than those amazing prices. Wow. We are going to start with quite possibly my favourite kit of all of them, actually. Oh. I love this. I want to get this kit, Mark, because I love that thread. It's lovely, isn't it? It's so it's like pretty. Mink. It's like a mink yeah. colour, isn't it? It's no, a it's pinky, yeah. minky colour. Yeah, pinky exactly. Minky it's a pinky yeah. minky. Yeah. Um, <laughs> it's so beautiful. Lovely, it? And that's just literally the threading material that I'm talking about right now. Um, uh, this is what you've made, or well, used the thread I, yeah, for the so macrame. I used the thread for the macrame bracelet on the front, and yeah. then I used everything else for the And the, the button necklace. in that pearl necklace. Yes, yeah. There it yeah, is, yeah. that pretty button. Yeah. Oh. I love the asymmetry as well. I just wanted it on the side rather so than So wearable too, yeah. so, so wearable. Um, you also have got your beautiful pearls, so a string of wonderful pearls. Um, in terms of the size of the potato pearls, meaning they're a little bit more oval, there's a really lovely pinkish overtone to these that I'm hoping will come across um, on the screens. Plus you get the two tubes of your lovely Mayukis. What size are these? Atos. Atos, yeah. So great for things like spaces as well, aren't they? Have I got that right? It says leather cord there, I'm a bit confused. I'm confused as well. Are our graphics wrong? Should be nylon cord. We'll double check. We're just going to double yeah. check. But start dialing through. I mean, all the different mediums that mm. this is going to work with. Standard beading, macrame, you knotting. can use it for your knotting, yeah, your tassels. Yeah, your, 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 um, yeah, as I said, your tassels, your malas, yeah, all sorts. All of the yeah, above. Nylon cord. Yeah, no, yeah, there we go. Yeah. I think it's just our graphics that are incorrect. Is that yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, that's okay. So yeah. you are literally getting this. What you can see. You know, there. what is yeah. on your screens, that is literally what you are getting. We've just checked the specifications on the website <laughs> as well. Um, amazing. Um, okay, yeah. I, I mean, I, I want to get this kit so badly because it's so beautiful. The pearls the have got a lovely gorgeous. pinkish colour. Really can you nice see that size. pink? Yes, yeah, absolutely. Which Charlie was saying to me once upon a time that the pink overtones um, are the most popular. Oh. Most popular colour of pearls. Yeah. £49.99 and pence only to get hold of this amazing kit. There are only 64 available opportunities. Um, does the thread work through the pearls? You, you have to ream a couple of them. Okay. But other than that, no, it goes through. Obviously, you condition your thread with yeah. a nail varnish to, to harden it to use as a needle. But no, as I said, there was only a couple I had to ream. There you and, go. And all the rest that <gasps> goes through. When did uh, that price through. drop? Uh, I mean, they're seven ninety nine each, aren't they? Are. they? That's the price of the pearls. The pearl strand is beautiful. Yeah, oh, it's lovely. Twenty four ninety nine. You buy your pearls, you're getting everything else for free. There's sixty four yeah. of these available. I'll be joining you on this opportunity. Um, every single, you know, some. I love every component. Every single component, that beautiful little button that you can see here, that wonderful flower detail. Ignore the fact that it says leather cord. It's not leather cord, it's this. That lovely minky. It's lovely. And you I, get, I you get masses. You get, you, get a, you get a lot of meterage on this. I can't remember exactly. You do get a lot. Do you know the answer to that, Ross? 70. 70. Yeah, I thought it was a lot. Wow. So if, so if you wanted to go down the Kumahimo route as oh, well, nice. you could do that. As well, you've got more than enough. That would be beautiful. Certainly macrame, as Mark has shown yep. in his lovely jewellery. £24.95. pence. you've got, what, one, two, three, four, five components. You're talking £5 pounds each. £5 pounds each. Yeah. Alison, Devon, Susan and Brian, London, Angela, Mary, Caroline, Geraldine and Nina. Um, new customers getting involved. Make sure you dial through. There was only 64. I love this one. I'm going to be joining. Oh, the little loop on the back of the button. I was going to ask you about that. It's the size of an 8 so it, 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 oh. right, When I come to do the demo, I'll show you how it, in, it embeds. It's seamless. It's just beautiful. So it, 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 you almost replace a bead with this button yes. and yeah. it goes into the weave itself. Yeah. Ah, that's Great very color. clever, isn't yeah. it? That's very, very clever. Lovely. Well done, everybody. Limited kits, though. So make sure you do shop ahead and have a little look at the other different colorways. Um, yeah, and any questions you have for Mark, of course, about these mm. amazing demonstrations, um, then text in. Text in. We'd love to hear from you. Shall we do our... I love but that. the butterfly one. I would buy this whole kit just for those um, eight O's. They're amazing, <laughs> aren't they? Yeah. Oh, there we go. It's the butterfly. 
it's a flutter back. Yeah. That, that bracelet's beautiful, Mark. So what I did, I took three strands of leather, about two foot long, and then I threaded a hundred of the eight O's onto each of the pieces of leather. Started at one end plaiting just with the leather, if I turn it round, just with the leather. Yeah. And then I, I think it's three inches of, of just plain plait. And then I plaited, as you can see, the three pieces of leather with the seed beads attached. I dropped the little butterfly in to replace one of the eight O's and then plaited. That's so the effective. And you can also, it's long enough to wear around the neck if you wanted to as well as a little, as a little choker. I, I, I just like the way the little butterfly looks as though he's just landed. It's ever so lovely. I would never consider yeah. actually putting the seed beads directly onto leather. I wouldn't yeah, assume that they would Yeah, eight O's go on fit. this leather. It's really nice with these kits because you get a lot of leather. Normally you only get a couple of metres, yeah. but you've got a lot in these well, Oh, hang on. Yes, I'm missing that out, aren't yeah, I? So here lovely. it is. Yeah. There's the leather that you're getting within this kit as yeah. well. Again, beautiful components. You've got that really lovely butterfly. Um, I love the green, don't you? Isn't that beautiful? So green, eight O's, plus then you have that really wonderful, how is it described, metallic, Black variegated iris, blue iris. Blue yeah, yeah. amazing yeah. cultured yeah. pearls and then meters of beautiful white leather one price crash they are all limited kits no. i guess the amount that you goodness me wow wow Gosh. i guess the amount of jewelry that you can create from this as well masses no absolutely absolutely so, so you've got how much is the what's that, the meterage on the leather is it five meters or more no it might be more than that how many meters ross He's just having a little look now. That butterfly's lovely. I, and again, I, it's got the same little loop at the back. So it, it, yeah. it, it, it literally will fit into, a bit like the symbols, mm. I yeah, suppose. That's right. So yeah. fit into yeah. your um, seed beading designs. That's the strand of the pearls, and you're getting everything else yeah. for free. Yeah. Um, yeah. Five, five metres. Five yeah. We wow. don't normally get, we normally we get two metres of leather. So that's, a, yeah, so you're almost getting double leather. the length in, aren't you? Really nice, soft, supple leather as well. It's lovely to use. Beautiful. Well done. Again, we're talking about, what, £3 something, is it, per, comp per component? Uh, 19.99 divided by one, two, three, four, five. Talking about three pounds something, four yeah. pounds, four pounds. Yeah, yeah. um, okay, let's move on to the next kit. And again, you can be shopping ahead with each and every single one of these. So do make sure um, that you check out. Which one next? Let's go for the blues with the leather then, with the dragonfly. So it's one of my favourite kits of the year so far. Very popular yeah, on pre-order. It's lovely. Oh, Mark, that colour. Yeah. Quarter of the stock's already gone on pre-order. Look at that. Do you know, I've never seen that colour of blue. No. And when you take it out of the, out of the, uh, of the tube, it's really iridescent. It's, 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 it's beautiful. beautiful oh, colour. that's so pretty. And then wait until you see the quality of the clear quartz as well. They are best clear quartz I've ever seen. I I would yeah. agree. Yeah, I would agree. Dope. Completely yeah. flawless, aren't it's they? Gorgeous. You've got again five meters of your beautiful leather. That's in a sort of a, a lovely uh, deep midnight navy blue. And there is your lovely dragonfly that uh, Mark. I assume will fit in amongst your eight toes. <laughs> uh, yeah, your eight toes as well. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly the same. Um, yeah, this kit's proving to be uh, the most yeah. popular on your pre-orders. I can see why. It is lovely. Again, they are. It is a lovely iridescence. It's just, it's just a wonderful sight mm. to see, isn't it, dragonflies? So I, I did a, quite a big focal necklace using this kit. Well, yeah, thought, what yeah, was so that technique? Do you want to bring it over? So this is... I, oh, there we are. I bring this over. Shall I leave it there? Whatever you prefer. So this is similar. So, so this is... Um, Peyote, which I've made these little barrels. Do you remember we did it with the black, with the mukai yeah. in our last show? Yeah. So these are just slightly larger. I've used the, the quartz, and then I've just popped the dragonfly in the centre. Oh. And he just fits beautifully. I, I love this piece of jewellery. Yeah. It's one of my favourite kits of the year so far. I know we're only two weeks in, but I love it. No, I would agree. And again, that's the yeah. best, as you said, and Ross has said, I totally agree. Yeah. The clear quartz is, 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 oh, is, incredible. is incredible. Yeah. I mean, on the recording right now, where we're under magnification. Mm. Look how faultless they are. A couple of months ago, I was, on, I was next door in Gemporia um, showcasing the chestnut collection. Yeah. And I was on with Ellis, and she showed me it was a bit top secret. It's, apparently, it's the jeweler's Bible. It's the Levian catalogue. Yeah. And apparently, this year, 2023, is going to be the year of the dragonfly. Everything is going to be dragonflies this okay. year. Okay. So home decor, clothing, you name it, jewellery, especially jewellery, it's going to be the year of the dragonfly. So we're in quite early with the Oh, uh, get the your yeah, get your inspiration yeah. done nice yeah. and early. Oh, I like the idea of that. Mm. 
home decor with dragonflies. Yeah. They are stunning, I aren't they? I love dragonflies. It's beautiful. beautiful. Yeah, amazing insects. And you can hear them, the fact that you can actually mm -hmm. hear them. £19.99. Again, that is a, a fantastic price point for the clear courts, and you're getting everything else for free. That's five metres of your beautiful leather, the two tubes of your atos, your beautiful uh, little dragonfly, and then that flawless strand. £19.99. Each and every single one of these kits are very, very limited, though, so um, don't leave it in your baskets. I've only got two other kits to bring you as well. And any questions that you have for our lovely Mark, then do text us. We are, you can do that via the website or via the app. Drop us a message and um, we can see, certainly bring that to air. Um, amazing maker, well done to you, Nancy, Miss, uh, Miss Janet, Sally, Anne, Linda, Angus, Angela, West Sussex. Hello, Buckinghamshire, Lisa, Suzanne, Nina. Yeah, the, uh, for me, you, with each of these kits, you're buying your strand and you're getting everything else for free. That's how I look at this. Five meters of leather. That's really good. It, it, it's like four pound per yeah. strand, uh, yeah. per component, isn't it? Um, they are getting very limited now. Beautiful, pristine, eye clean yeah. quartz, 90 carats of. It's from Brazil. God. Yeah, well, that would highlights why it's so eye clean. I'd love to do a showcase on clear quartz. You know, it's a staple uh, that all jewellery makers yeah. should, should have in their stash to be able to use. So I think we should see, see Wayne and see if he can do it. Well, a... I actually asked Wayne for a colourless oh. hour. Oh, amazing. Ages ago. Right. He says it's just, it's, dif it's, it's difficult. difficult. Yeah, yeah, he said there's, because right. it's not that much available okay. um, in the market at the moment. But yeah, I agree with you. It would mm. be lovely to do, wouldn't it? Mm. And it would be your clear quartzes. It would be things like your diamonds, your zircons, mm. your topaz. Yeah, yeah. Well, Where do you want to go yeah. next, Mark? Keep dialing through, keep checking so let's out. Let's go. Oh, no. Let's, oh. let's go for the red. The red. Yes, they were the quartz and these little the little buttons. They're Beautiful. <laughs> so pretty. Again, you know, even if you don't use them all together, as separate components, you know, that red cord is going to be great if you do things like Marlers. They're perfect. Or knotting, knotting yeah, of your absolutely. pearls. With the quartz, all the pearls. Oh, know. beautiful yeah. with the quartz. And then you have these lovely little buttons in beautiful mukai. You get the two of them. See if I can pick those up. The clothes up. have buttons. Yeah. But it all seems to be zips, doesn't it? I think so. Yeah. I've got, I don't think I've got any, apart from shirts, I don't think I've got any knitwear or anything with buttons. I've got dresses with have buttons, you? yeah. Right. Quite a lot of buttons. Um, there you go. You get the two. They're cute. They are they stunning, are aren't good. they? Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. I mean, you could upcycle clothing, couldn't you, with genuine gemstones? You could, yeah, imagine. This bracelet's really pretty. So pretty. We're opening this kit up at 19.99. You've got 70 metres of your lovely Siam red cord, which we always talk about. Yeah, always. So I use the, uh, the beige cord from here, but you can do yeah. that with the red if you wanted to. Yeah, then, it'd be beautiful. Said, so I've made a loop lock and then I've used the button as the clasp at the end, so it just slots into the button. And that would be lovely and secure, won't well, it? Yeah, really secure. Beautiful. Great I'd, great way of actually finishing off your jewellery as an yeah. alternative, maybe, to your traditional mm. clasp. Yeah. We're opening, opening up this kit at £19.99, but we're not stopping there. Look, the strand of quartz on its own, can I say that, Ross? Should be fourteen pounds. Oh, should it? Yeah. Right. On its oh, own. Gosh. Right. You're getting wonderful carved, genuine gemstones, seventy meters of your Siam red nylon thread, um, as well. Are you ready? I think I know. Oh, I didn't. I thought fourteen ninety nine. Really, you did I as thought, well. Too, yeah, I was oh, like, he's Ross. going to do the kit, he's going to do the kit. You buy your quartz and you get everything else for free. Um, oh, Ross does. Ross doesn't like to be predictable, though, does he? Oh, I love that, Ross. Four uh, fourteen ninety nine would have been amazing. Look, I even want to say it. Eleven ninety nine. That has to be an on screen oh. sellout. Seventy yeah. meters of your cord. I mean, look at how perfect those colourless uh, colourless quartz are. They're Pristine, They're aren't they? Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. A clear court should literally look like a little dew of water, a bead of water. Yeah. There's no inclusions of anything, is there? Nothing. Nothing at all. Nothing yeah, at all. Eleven ninety nine. How many do we have of this one? 
We had 65, Paula, Olivia, Sussex, hello to you, Lincolnshire, Anne, Richard, Anne, Lisa, uh, Buckinghamshire, Pauline, Stella, Joan, Susan, Diane, Sue, West Sussex, Angus. Plus, remember, coming up at 12 o'clock, Mark's Masterclass, this would be amazing with the Masterclass kit, wouldn't it? Would. Because you've got yeah. the thread that would go with the, with yep, the beautiful coat of agate. Yeah. Half the stock has gone, says Ross. Do you want to do something crazy? I love it when he says it like that. Let's do something <laughs> crazy, shall we? What? Ah, oh, that means these are going to sell out, and I need the thread. Bless you. I desperately need these. And this, because this is nylon, it works the same way as Eslon, so it melts if you use yeah. your naked flame. So you don't need to use glue in any of your macrame. Yeah, just. But fantastic. Just, just cut and squidge and. And heat. And literally, when you said earlier on, condition condition it so yep. you create your own needle effective, Absolutely. effectively. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. <coughs> so all you do is you just put a little dob of the clear nail varnish on your index finger. Mm. And then just do this with your thumb and finger and just draw the last couple of inches of your thread through so it coats. Leave it for five minutes, it'll go rock solid. Cut it to a 45 degree point so you get an angle and then use that as the needle. And as your needle. Yeah. Job done. Right. We're going even lower. Right. I was going to buy these kits because I, 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 I want the pearls and I do want the clear quartz. This is the most yeah. beautiful clear quartz it I've is. seen in a long time. Plus the threading Gorgeous. material, it's all the plus, plus, plus. Mm. <laughs> these will be oh. great for your masterclass kits as well, won't they? Yeah. To go alongside one yeah. another, you could literally just match the two kits together. Well, that, that necklace you? on the right there, that's a, that's a marlin knotted. Ah. Do you know, I, the, I took the two strands and I ombre It took me hours. <laughs> I bet, because we'll, you've got we'll a have perfect a at, light yeah. condition as well, haven't yeah. you? We'll have that. a look at this at 12 o'clock, but I've ombre the two strands. Amazing. Yeah. These will, apps, this kit will sell out for sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. Um, please make sure you check out. We only had 64 of them. Apologies for that. If we had probably, I don't know. If we if we had five times that quantity, it's by the core screens, it's looking like it'll be a sellout too. Um, and that's because it is an absolute mm. giveaway deal. I mean, you're looking at two carved, beautiful mookites from Western Australia, mm. plus 70 meters of your lovely cyan red, which we always talk about, don't we, All when it comes to sort of threading yeah, and knotting. Yeah. Fantastic. Every single piece of jade, I, I think, should be knotted with red. Yes. <laughs> yes, absolutely. Without, uh, so if you and buy it just for the red thread. So, no. so wait, you're actually, you can buy, because we get this too. Oh, can I buy that quartz on its own? Yeah, you can, but you pay more than what's on that's your screens right, yeah. right now. Yeah, that's And true. you're getting everything else for free as well. You can buy it on its own, absolutely, but you'd be £14.99. You won't get this. You won't get these. So it's definitely worthwhile getting involved on Mark's kits. Um, the final 20, I'll leave that with you, um, everybody, so make sure you check them out. Okay, on to the last of the kits. This is right. very pretty. Yeah, this is this is this is this is gonna sell out, I think, because of those two buttons. They're beautiful. They're so and have oh. they got that detail on the back? Yeah. <gasps> you got that little um, this is what I'm gonna demo with these. They're lovely, aren't they? Aren't they gorgeous? Really high quality. Look at that labradorite. That yes. Amazing. That's beautiful. So they have on the reverse, can you see? Yeah. That's the same size as an 8.0. So it'll fit into your, your beading. Yeah. Oh, look the most that. amazing labradorite. Beautiful labradorescence. Then you have just here your goldstone. <laughs> then you also have that incredible colour of blue that we saw earlier yeah. on in the kits. You have this amazing silver, two tubes of your Atos, and I love this. The green. Isn't that a pretty colour? It's a really fine silk thread as well. I was going to ask you about that because I've, ordered, as, I, as I said, I've ordered some silks off eBay, and I was thinking for the life of me, I can't remember what what silk gauge to buy. I ordered forty-five. Is that too fine for pearls? No, no, that's perfect for pearls. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. It, it, it's too small for seed beads. The knot will pop in, right. especially in Ato. So okay. what you do is you double knot. Okay. And then that stops it from falling into okay. seed beads. Okay. But this would be perfect if you wanted, well, I, I, if you wanted I, to use it with pearls. So I used it for this necklace. So running all the way through the gold necklace here from the previous kit is the uh, is, is this the cord silk? with a needle. Yes, yeah, so that's that's got the silk running through it. Amazing. If I turn it round, you can see the the green knots at the top. Oh yes. Side of the clasp. Isn't it a pretty colour? It's like a teal, isn't it? A really beautiful teal. These are gemstone buttons, so you've got your goldstone, which technically speaking is a man-made gem. Um, plus you've got the labradorite, the, that wonderful 8 detail, so it's going to feed into your uh, seed beading. You get the two tubes of 8 and you get the silk. 
We're going to do the, uh, in one price crash, says <laughs> Ross. Right. Doing it in one price crash, L, because they're going to fly out even well, as soon as I bring that price to air. Mad. Were you expecting 9 99 no, no, not for any of them. Not at all. And these no, would no. work so amazingly well with your masterclass kits as well. They would. No, absolutely. If perfect. we could put those two hours together, I think we would. Mm. No, because they would, they, they, you know, the buttons are going to work with the air gates, uh, the silk you can use with the air gates, and of course your lovely Mayuki. How many do we have of this kit? We had 60 again, absolutely flying out. Um, any questions for Mark, do feel free to message us. Mark, I'm so excited. Which one are you going to demonstrate? So I'm going to show the, the candle, because I, I just love these two gemstones, buttons, they're just lovely. So I'm going to show So them. pretty. And do you know what? Actually putting them in home decor like this, they're out then, aren't you? You're going to see them. Yeah, Not I mean, it, away in a it, it's, it's bracelet size as well. So if you don't want to, if you don't want to zip it up and pop it around your candle like this, you can just pop a clasp on either yeah. end and you've got a bracelet. So it's multi, multi-function. Like that idea. I just love that. And then we've got the black Old the stone. Side. Yeah, it's just lovely. Amazing. Look okay. at that. Okay. So. Take it away. I've got a size 10 needle because we're using eight O's. You don't need to use a size 12, so you can use a slightly larger needle as well. And then I've gone for, I'm going to just pinch one of these because, oh no, I don't need to. Or do I? Yes. Because I need, I have sorry. those moments. I only need, I need, I need one as a stopper, that's all. So I'm just pinching one feeder. Okay. And I've got my, this time I'm using silver grey thread. Mm -hmm. I thought it would go really nicely with the Labradorite. And what we're going to do, we're going to be, do a bit of double dropping. Right. Which is really, which is really cool. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> so we're going to do a bit of peyote, but as I said, we're going to do something called double dropping, and I'm going to incorporate one of the, the buttons. Which button would you like to use? Uh, the labradorite. The labradorite, okay. So for your... So it's sort of, is that an 8 as well? That's a gold as well, isn't it? Have we got an 11 in any of these? Um, no. Uh, they're all 8 aren't they? I'm sure I bought some, some 11 O's. Maybe I didn't. No, they're all 8 Don't worry. I'll just... I'll Can just you use. improvise or just to get I'm going to use an 8 but I'm going to go up twice instead of okay. once, because it will slip. Okay, so we'll... There we go. So we could, first of all, you need to decide your pattern. And I went for 12 of the beads. So I'll, I'll go with the design that I went for with the actual candle holder. So I've gone for two silver. Now it needs to be an even number because we're doing even count, okay? So we've got two. Then we're going for two blue, four. Then we're going, going for four in the center. So that's eight. And then I'm going to do a mirror image. So I'm going back to two of the blue and then two of the silver. Okay, so that's our 12. You don't have to do 12, you can do eight if you want to, but bear in mind that you want to pop one of your buttons in the center and you don't want it overlapping your design. So we're gonna slide that down. And this is peyote, but instead of doing one bead at a time, we're going to do two. So you can double drop and you can also triple drop as well if you wanted to. And obviously, because you're doing two beads at a time, it's gonna take you half the time. So we're going to pick up two, of our silver, which will replicate the bottom row. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're going to go over the two silver through the two blue. And then you've got, at the bottom, you've got now four of your eight O's together. Then we're going to pick up two silver. So we're going to jump two through two. So as I said, it's exactly the same as your regular POT, but you're just picking up two beads at a time. And then we're going to pick up two blue, jump the two blue into the two silver. Okay, so it's kind of resembling like a little brick wall. Yeah. And already you've got those little, they, they call them castellations, and so, mm. up, so in is and out is. And I find it easier when I'm doing any peyote is to work in the same direction. So I flip my work over and then we're going to do the next. So we've got two silver. And the blue is now sticking, sticking out, so we know we're going to sew through those. So through the two blue, and then we pick up two silver. So once you've done the first couple of rows, it's pretty self-explanatory because you're just filling in the gaps. And then we're going to pick up two blue. Like so. And again, I flip my work over. You can work towards you away from me, but I find it much easier just to flip it over. 
and follow in the same direction. So we'll do a couple more of these and I'll show you how we incorporate the little button. So we've got the two and then we've got the two silver. I guess you could put these like over picture frames. And you could, no, you can do all sorts of things. Make napkin yeah. rings. So this is a really good, if you've just started seed beading, as this is new you, new year, new hobby. Yeah. Come on, what the? All the news. All the news. You're doing double drop and you're using eight O's, so this is really quick. So it doesn't take very long. Do you have seed beaded napkin rings? Mm, I have seed bead wine glass charms. Do you? Yeah. Lovely. With Swarovski. Very posh. Yeah, your table looks amazing at Christmas, doesn't it? I do miss Swarovski, I have to say. Yeah. Okay, so all you'll do then is you'll decide on the whether it's going to be a bracelet and then you need to find the central point, okay. which is then you're going to add your button. So for me, all I did was I, uh, the, uh, the candle that I've used is the perfect diameter of a, of a memory wire coil. Okay, so, so a bracelet coil. So I took a memory wire coil. coil, cut it in half, and then I, I used that as a measure because I wanted it to be a re reversible. Okay. Yeah. So, so to add our button, as you see, we've got our little loop on the back. You can just see it through there, okay? So because I've got a perfect, I've got, a, a, I've got symmetry at the back because I've got an even amount of number of um, pieces, I'm going to pick up two silver, which we're going to slide through. Okay, and then I'm going to pick up two silver and my little button. And I'm going to sew into the two silver eight O's. Make sure that just sits nice and neatly. And then I'm going to pick up two blues through to the top. Make sure we don't get that tangled, there we go. And then what you need to do then is you'll have to work the reverse until you've gone past the button. So in this case, you will have to go up and up and down towards you. Okay, so I'm going to pick up two of the silver. Oops. So picking up two silver, two silver. Then I'm going to pick up two silver. I still see the little loop from the back of the button, so I'm still going to go through the little loop. Okay. Pull that nice and tight. And then I've got the two blues. So I'm going to pick up the two blues up through. So you can see how quickly this builds up. And now because I don't want to flip it over because I want to be able to see the back, I'm now just going to do a, just a couple of rows coming down towards me. I know lots of people work this way, so it it's just depends on how you find it easier. Feel comfortable. Yep, okay, and then I've got, again, two silver. Bring that through. And I've got the two blue. Bring that through. I'm going to, I've still got a bit of button showing, so I'm going to stay in reverse. And then the two silver. And then two blue. Up through the top. And then you can see now that that button fits absolutely beautifully in the center. And then if you've got, you've got something to show, I'll do a few more rows and then I'll show you how we zip up. We do. Okay. We've actually ah. got a little base metal deal. Of, oh, okay. Of, they were hugely popular over the weekend. Right. We have the last remaining quantity and we're going to do it a close out deal. Oh, okay. 250 were launched, 45 <sighs> are left. Sounds good. 50, fuzzy, buzzy, Oh, I heard Bumblebees. <laughs> and they are the cutest. They're double-sided as well. You know, they're proper bumblebees as well. You know, the, the little round ones, which like aerodynamically don't make sense. They don't, do they? <laughs> Let's be honest. They don't. They hardly streamline a bumblebee. Um, but yeah, I mean, just so, so cute and so important, of course. They're integral, aren't they, to our, um, our very existence. 
And we're not just talking one or two. You know, you buy an, an Alex Munro pendant, you get one bumblebee. And it's beautiful. It is beautiful. Even on the underside, you've got its little feet all tucked up as if it's in flight. Really pretty. Lily Rose. Um, Gucci, of course, using yes. bumblebees at the yeah. moment. Lots and lots and lots and lots of big design houses are using bumblebees, which is fabulous because you know what? The more bumblebees that we see in jewellery and in fashion, you know, we're only uh, heightening our need uh, to, to, to obviously preserve these wonderful little creatures. Um, they are incredible, absolutely incredible. I was explaining, funnily enough, to Willow the other day, I was like, how important bumblebees are. I said, you know, they pollinate, they, you know, they, um, without, without bumblebees, you know, we don't have plants. And without plants, we don't have animals. You know, literally, it's it, it, they are integral, aren't they, to our our, our existence? Um, and they're really cute, really, really, really cute. So you're getting fifty of them. There we go. If you haven't seen these before, they were super popular. I only have forty five left. The price is crazy. Silver plated, little fuzzy bumblebees, and they are double sided as well. Um, the phone lines are about to go nuts. Nuts. For a pack of 50. Oh, no. 50 bumblebees. £9.99 <sighs> pence only. Joking. For 50 of them. 20 pence each. Yeah. Exactly. Oh, I was trying cute. to explain to Willow that a bumblebee doesn't want to sting you. She was like, oh, but they sting, mummy. They, you know, I was like, well, they don't want well, to, though. Only if you upset them. Yeah, they don't want to sting you, Willow. Believe me, they don't. No. Um, and she was like, oh, okay. You know, so we must look after our little bumblebees. Absolutely. Always have They're some sugar water. They're the most important insect in the garden. They bees, are. Yeah. I always have sugared water out in the, in the oh, summer. Oh, that's nice. Just leave some sugary <laughs> water outside, just for those bumblebees, just in case, just in case they get tired. He's a little, little freshener. Uh, Nine ninety nine. This will be the last time they're actually on air, unless of course we reorder them, which I hope we definitely do. Um, we had just forty five of them, and they're on the verge of selling out already. There's literally rows of you: Tina, Antoinette, oh. Carol, Christine, Pamela, Anne, Kay, Vivian. Like we are a channel of 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 putty cat lovers mm. and doggy lovers and all animals, really. Absolutely, I think we're an we're a all channel creative. of insects. All creatives Absolutely. are our animal lovers, aren't they? Yes. Absolutely. Have you got a favourite insect? I think bees have got to be up there, haven't they? I think bees. Dragonflies I quite like. Yeah, I like dragonflies. Snails I like. They are funny. They're really bad for the gardeners, but I do like snails. Yeah. They are funny. I think they're beautiful. You think they're beautiful? Mm. Okay. With the intricacy of the shell and patterns yeah. and colours and, yeah. No, it's lovely. Willow, Willow kept bee, uh, sh uh, snails. She's got a little, little summer house at the bottom of the garden. And I opened the, I went in there the one day and opened the little cupboard and she's got a little, I don't know, like a cupboard of snails that she goes in and feeds. <laughs> <laughs> feeds and waters them. Oh. Listen, you know, exactly. Then no, she's not doing any harm. She's looking after them. <laughs> uh, Nine ninety nine only. Um, amazing. amazing. Yeah, these will be the last time they're actually they on the screens right now. Well, they've got. If I if I show you that one like so and then this one oh, like this. Yeah. You can see they've actually got really, oh, brilliant. really lovely. Um, it's a stretchy bracelet, just a slip. And your leather cord that we've just had. Between. Yeah. That looks stunning in the summer, wouldn't really it? Really cute. Yeah. Really cute. They go on the leather. There's, you they know, were, there's a yeah, big yeah. drill hole through those, and you're getting all fifty of them as well. Twenty pence each. Twenty p. Twenty p per bumblebee. Uh, back to you. Okay, so I've done a little section here. So that was an inch, and that's only taking me five minutes. Okay. Yeah. So you can see the back. So what we're going to do now, so imagine that you've got your, your length that you're going to now zip up. This is, this is the best bit, I love zipping up. So you'll notice that on the bottom row, we've got an innie and we've got an outie. Yeah. So to make sure that you've got the, the right combination to zip up, the row above must be an outie and an innie. So we've got, if we had two outies, we wouldn't be able to zip them up. If we had two innies, we wouldn't be able to no. zip them up. So the fact, and also you can always tell you're in the right place because your starting thread is in the bottom left and your ending thread is in the top right, so it's diagonal, so you know you were in the right way. And all we're going to do is we're just going to fold it in half. So you can see now I'm exiting the left of the bottom. We're going to go across and up the two silver beads, just the two silver, like so. And then we're going to go to the left and up the two blues. Zipping up is one of the best things ever in seed beading, it really is. Then we're going to go across to the two silver beads and then we're going to go across and up the two silver 
keep pulling nice and tight. We're going to go across to the two blue. So all we're doing is we're doing a sort of a zigzag. Yeah. Sort of stepping. Like a corset. Like a corset, yeah. Okay, so, and then what I do then is just give it a little squidge. And then we're just going to take off our a little stopper bead. And then we're just going to tie a single knot, first of all. That would be a nice little element as well for it would. your neck. Absolutely. And if you wanted to, if you did this ring size, maybe I wouldn't go with I wouldn't go twelve beads deep, maybe eight. Yeah. That make a lovely ring with yeah. the, with that um, labradorite on on top. So we've done a single knot, then we're going to do a double knot, pulling that nice and tight. And then all I'm going to do with my needle still attached is to get away from that knot, is I'm going to go down two silver and then up two silver. Pull nice and tight, down two silver, and now you're ready now to go in and cut off your threads. And then all we're going to do is we're just going to, so I would probably put a little biro or something down there just to just to separate it up a little bit, like so. But that's your zipping up. So imagine so if I bring my candle across, that's just a version. Beautiful. So exactly what I've just done. Just keep just keep keep doing that technique until you get to the diameter of your. I mean, this is quite a big candle. If you want a little votif, you know the little mini mini candles. Or if you went down to eight beads wide instead of twelve, you could yep. put this around a tea light. Yeah, that's a good so, idea. Um, and so would that yeah. would that be tea light depth then? Yeah, that'd be that'd be, that. that'd be tea light depth. But uh, so I've shown you the double drop and to zip up. So it just depends what you want to, to zip up. Amazing. I like, yeah, I like the idea of, and I know you do this, make yeah. little components, yeah. don't you, That's to right. then uh, drop yeah. into, oh, yeah, Mark, so yeah. pretty, so beautiful. I love those components. They have been very popular, your kit. Amazing. Um, well done to everybody that has managed to get hold of that. Um, yeah, forgive me, I was just trying to mouth to Ross then. I was like, have we got any wildfire? Ah. Uh -huh. Because it hasn't, been, I don't recall it being on air for quite a while. Oh, amazing. Perfect. Do you like, like the grey? Yeah, yeah, that's my second favourite after the forest green. So forest green is really good. If you're doing, if you're doing uh, silvers and things like that, I tried to go for the silver grey, which is brilliant. Because it will kind of blend in, won't is that, it? Is that that one, is it? Oh, it is. N -O yeah, it is. N85. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So it's, not, it's not very much left. No, clearly, <laughs> clearly Mark does love it. Yeah. Um, thank you, much, Mark. There's not very much left. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> but it's literally the same thread that Mark just demonstrated with right now. I will be honest, I have asked for my own personal benefit as well because I need some threading material. Oh, okay. Right. I need it. Should we do a closeout deal? There's only 70 available, though. Oh, no. And this is all the wildfire that we have currently. Yes, I know. Unfortunately, really wildfire, I don't know how, why, but Beadalong can't sustain the quantity, the demand that we need here at Jewelry Maker. So get it when it's in stock yeah. and probably stock up if you can. Now, I know that's a great price yeah. Yeah. because I've tried to buy it elsewhere. £15. When we, when we were in lockdown and we couldn't get it, I bought Forest Green for £15 on eBay. Yes. Crazy. Yeah, off that yeah, river off, website. Yeah, yeah. 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 it off it prices. you pay much, much, much higher prices, yeah. and then obviously there's a postage on top of that as well. Yeah. I know we you have to pay postage with us, but it's one per day, seven ninety five. Right, yeah, right. thought so. Yeah. So, yeah, so um, all of, any of your your silvery tone metallics definitely go for the silver grey. It's, it's lovely, and again, it, it's I love wildfire because it disappears in it your does. beading. It really does. It does. So it's lovely. And with your gemstones. Yeah. I quite I don't know if I should or shouldn't and tell me if I'm wrong, but I also use wildfire with, with pearls quite a lot. No, that's nothing wrong with that. That's really strong. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah, sometimes if, if you're using glass, but I always had this problem with Swarovski actually, because they were they were so strategically beautifully made. Yeah. The interior drill hops sometimes were quite sharp. So yeah. if you were quite forceful, sometimes it would cut through the thread. Mm -hmm. But with the bicones that we get at the moment from Prezioso, I'm not having the issue. You wouldn't have that, obviously, with pearls. No. So it's, it's fantastic. There so, you go. Yeah. There you go. Hopefully yeah. there's going to be some of them left because I do need <laughs> I need the wildfire. <laughs> That's why I kind of put that little request in. But you are the most important. Clearly make the most of this opportunity, though, because there was only 70 available. Oh, and I would recommend stocking up when yeah. you get the chance. I, I, I just thought, gosh, we haven't seen any wildfire for quite a long time and it is so important mm. you know pretty much yeah. all of your amazing designers tend to go I'll be using it at 12 o'clock as well so. oh there you go you <laughs> yeah. need it for your beautiful coated agate masterclass that's coming yeah. up in just a few hours Can you remember the name of the lady that messaged us on our last show asking for a kiss cross demo I've been wrecking my brains trying to yeah. remember the lady's name it's a new viewer it's a new lady a new viewer 
wanted me to... Um, ah. I can't remember. Tina, that's it, in Kent. Tina! Tina, your wish has been granted at 12 o'clock. And she's messaged in this oh, morning. Oh, fantastic. Amazing. There you go, Tina. So is that what you're doing? There yeah. we go. Make anyway, sure you win. Roll on your viewers. New, new technique, new year. We're going to go over Kiss Cross again because it's lovely. It is beautiful. Yeah. It is so beautiful. Mark's, Mark's made me some Kiss Cross necklaces mm. and I wear them all the time. Yeah. All the time. Um, okay. <sighs> Mookite. This is amazing. Look at this. Absolutely amazing. It's not been on air for an hour. Now, if this oh. goes well, not today, obviously. We're gonna we're, we're gonna try. And why wouldn't it though? It's Mukai all the way from Western Australia. It's wow. natural. This hasn't been on air for a year. Um, yeah, we need to do we need yeah. to do a showcase of Mukai yeah, yeah. um, because also there's only or last time I researched it. There was only two license holders for Mookite remaining in the world. Once those licenses have gone, that's it. It's gone. This is a gemstone that I foresee running out before maybe your, your tanzanite. Um, you've got over a metre, 127 centimetres of natural Mookite. You know, just the whole wow. geographic logistics of this gemstone. It's incredible, isn't it? I love this stone. Me too. Yeah. We've got 60. Here we go. Should we, should we, should we quickly that. skim over this? Named after the creek where Jasper, uh, where the Jasper is found in Western Australia, Mooka Creek. Mookai is fast becoming a well-recognised Australian. They don't use semi-precious anymore. Uh, gemstone. The amazing colour reflects the Australian outback in its ochre hues. Due to a flint-like structure, Mu notice they spell it differently as well. Uh, Mukai is tricky to cut and polish as it will easily splinter. However, when successful, cabochons can look picturesque and can be made into spectacular jewellery. Mukai is mined in the Kennedy Range. It's about 100 miles inland from the coastal town of Carnarvon. Uh, sorry, I can't say it without a Welsh accent. Um, in Western Australia, the creek has many underground springs making mining wet and a messy job but the results are worth it uh, Tom Capitani and uh, Joanne Pass were very fortunate to be the last miners to obtain wow. a mining license in the area situated on the Mooka station which is now controlled by the Department of Conservation and Environment the area can be accessed by crossing the Gascoigne River which can uh, can be quite a challenge with four or six wheel drive vehicles only two existing mining licenses exist in the area as well that's it that is it Russ Oh, was it? Oh, I beg your pardon. These two leases are confined, sorry, Ross, uh, confined to the riverbed where the mukai is exposed and easily mined. The last 20 years of mining have depleted and reserves of, uh, um, re depleted the reserves of high quality multicolored mukai. Though brightly colored mukai can be seen strewn through the riverbed uh, from these mining activities. So they literally have to mine this gemstone now in the river which, as you can imagine, can be quite oh, challenged nice. um, with all the heavy-duty machinery. Now, if you want to have a Mookite showcase, drop us a message and we'll see if we, if we can make that possible. I think we need to maybe make the most of it because it, it could potentially it could potentially be um, one of those uh, gems that we, we say goodbye to in the foreseeable just because it's only from one location in the world. We're going to do it in one price crash. 60 available, did you say, Ross? Yeah. It's over a metre. So I'm intrigued what the 127's about. Yeah, it's a bit random, isn't it? What, what is that in inches, maybe? Maybe they've done a round off inches figure. Maybe. What's well, 127 in inches? Divided by two and a half, approximately. I so that six... Ah, uh, that's, that's what it is. Yeah. That makes yeah. sense. Yeah. That does make sense now. But no, we'll make it complicated <laughs> and put 127 yeah. centimetres rather than same 50 inches. <laughs> yeah, well done. Logical. That's um, again, yeah, make sure you do check out those baskets. Buy this, buy this ready for your Kiss Cross demo at 12 o'clock. Six mil is perfect. And I'm going to be demoing with six mils as well. It is, isn't it? Yeah. Really beautiful. And actually, yeah. one of the Kiss Crosses you got, you made yeah, me has got, right. has got right. Mukai in. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. Um, wow. What an amazing Tuesday morning show we have planned for you. We have got the launch of I'm so excited oh, I'll get this piece of jewelry ready for the but those what I love I want that strand of bike and for smaller it's beautiful you need it yeah, um, have really you got your phone it. handy if not I've got mine I have, um yeah. okay yeah we are launching for the very first time type a Burmese black jadeite in bike owns 
two different sizes with the fantastic Dave Trough. He's going to be stepping into the studio. I don't think. I know this is going to sell out. Yeah, yeah. And I genuinely believe this will probably be one of the fastest sellouts in mm. jewellery maker history. Do you agree? I agree completely. Yeah. I think this could potentially be a sellout in a matter of seconds. So be ready, be poised, be excited, because it's happening after this. Jewelry Maker has its own dedicated call center with highly trained staff waiting to help you with your orders or any queries. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewelry Maker, Sewing Street and Hobby Maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30-day money-back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, we have a mega sale on our website right now. There is up to 70% off items with over a thousand items available on all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. So pop along, take a look and start shopping. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Our friendly 
knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. How excited are we for I had to be a part of this, so sorry to encroach onto your desk. Never, but... and absolutely you should oh be part of it. Word. Especially as amazing. you've given a, you know, a, a fantastic idea that we've just shown Dave. We'll discuss with you in a few moments' time. Yeah. But I think this could be one of the fastest sellouts in Joy Maker history. Absolutely. Because we Brilliant. know our wonderful audience love bicones. And this is actually the first time the fantastic Dave has actually been introduced to the bike own shape. I can't wait, Dave, for this opportunity. Dave Troth, everybody. Oh, thank you so much. And uh, it's uh, amazing to be with you all this morning and, and with you guys and you, Mark. You're not encroaching at all. Not at all. In fact, um, you know, I was told by the team here at Jewel Maker, I'm always led by the team that, you know, you guys love bike owns. This isn't something that they routinely uh, carve or cut into jade eye. It's not really um, one of the shapes that they are au fait with in, in the Far East. So this is like our request, really. This is our request to, to the team in the Far East uh, months and months ago. If, if they have any of the type A black jade eye, if they could produce this for us. And for me, I've, you guys know if you've joined my shows, I've, I've never seen the bike and I've never uh, bought it to you guys. I've never seen it in any other gemstone. Um, so I was like a little bit of trepidation. Like, I wonder how this will, you know, how you guys will uh, receive it, how, how you guys will love it. And then I came in and I saw what Mark had, had created. Um, and now I can see why this is something that you guys love. And the fact that Mark's demonstrated that, that it can be done, that you can create something like this. And I was just saying um, off, off air, I don't mind sharing it with you guys, that I didn't even know and I always say this, I'm not really a jewellery maker, I, don't, you know, I haven't got that skill set. I know, I know you can learn it. Um, but when I see that, that for me is a piece of jewellery that, that Mark has created where I would think, you know, this can only be done in certain parts of the world like Bangkok or, yeah. or wherever because, you know, it's, you, you've got that piece but then there's this incredible kind of how, how many rows is it? Three or four? Yeah, talk us through it, Mark. Cause, uh... So this is, uh, this was actually on a show a couple of weeks ago where we had the gemstone toggle clasps. And this is a technique, if I bring this out, this is a technique called flat, flat kiss cross. Yeah. Okay. So on the back, we start with a seed bead netting, which is straightforward. Okay, so that's the back. And then on the front, we flip it over, we embellish in between. So if you imagine, Going from 11.0 to 11.0, there's a gap, okay, from one to the other. So all you do is you, is you do another layer of beading, and this is using black glass. Now, Dave, as you mentioned, you're not au fait with bicones. No. Nope. Bicones really came to prominence with Jewelry Maker about six or seven years ago when we introduced Swarovski. Okay, got you. And they, they, are, they bought bicones to JM in a massive way. And then we thought, well, why can't we produce not only in glass, but also in gemstones? And we try our hardest to bring as Absolutely. many gemstone bicones but as we can. But never would we imagine Jade Never. No, no, of course. No, but no. isn't it amazing that, you know, through, through uh, what we do here at Jewelry Maker, we've kind of pushed the industry in that way. You know, like I said, yes, yes. C c these being produced in glass, in Swarovski, in crystal, whatever it may be, is something that they can do very inexpensively. But then due to the pieces of jewellery like that, which are, it's like a tapestry yeah. of, of incredible gemstones. You know, it feels like lace. It, it's beautiful. Th th this feels bespoke. It feels couture. And I'm so, so excited, as we all are, the fact that we might have the possibility 
of doing this in jade. You know, you get with something like this with black glass and um, with the grade of jade that we're bringing you today, you get this incredible monochrome look. Now, I know it's all black, but when the light catches yeah, it, beautiful. it's like this domino effect of like yeah. uh, this flickering black and white, uh, uh, um, you know, monochrome uh, luster, which I think is sensational. Now, we, we, we spoke to the team in the Far East, we explained to them, you know, the, 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 what the bicone is, I guess, and, you know, if we could produce it for, for you guys, and they have. So I don't know quite realistically. I mean, six, seven years ago, it came here in, in Swarovski, and then we kind of pushed our cutters uh, and people around the world to start cutting that. This might be the first time that it's been done in jade. It is. Because it was our request. Uh, um, the, the reason that we, that we don't do it very much in gemstones, it's one of the most wasteful. Of course, because it's like a marquise. Well. That's it's right. it's That's like right. a marquee, so it tapers yeah. off at both ends. So yeah. really, it's sacrilege. And and maybe we can do it more in, in... You guys have obviously seen it on Jewelry Maker, and maybe a little bit more readily available gemstones. But to mm. do it in a gemstone that has now disappeared... Yeah, is, exactly. Is, ...is crazy. Not only is this the first time, it might quite literally be the last time. And, and you know, I heard earlier when you had the mocha, the Mookite when I was in there, and you were like, look, if you want another show, we'll try and get you another show. This is one of those that even if this completely sells out, the chances of us bringing this back, even when we know there's a huge audience for it, yeah. is, is, is few and far between. Now, I asked for them to do it in Black Jade, and we, we expected that it would be done in what is known as um, chicken skin jade. Yes. Okay, which I, I know it's a, it's a funny term, but th this is why I love uh, the, the, the Far East, because they say it as it is. You know, it's never a, a, a about value in terms of that way. When they use these terms, like mutton fat, you know, it sounds crazy. Like in the West, we would make that really sexy term, you know. We, we, we do, though, don't we? We love like yeah. Jedi spinels and all of these beautiful terminology. Like we didn't like zoocyte because it sounded, it didn't sound right, so we called it tanzanite, yeah. savorite. We're always trying to romanticize. Yeah. In the Far East, the gemstones speak for themselves. And what they do is quite literally say, right, what does it look like? What are we expecting? So mutton fat, most expensive gemstone in the world, doesn't sound very sexy. No. And so when, when we're talking about the chicken skin jade, it's not, it's not a, a, a derogatory term. They're just talking about with that variety of black jade, it is usually mottled with gray and black. It looks like burnt chicken skin. But what they've actually provided us with is something that is known as imperial black jade or omphacite jade, which wow. is, I, I think, and I, like I'm never an expert, but I think it is actually the rarest jade in the world. Now, I'm not saying it's the most expensive, but I think it is the rarest jade in the world. And the, the reason for that is, it's, when, it's, uh, when it's forming in the ground over millions of years, it, it goes through this process where at some point in time, it was actually imperial green. Mm -hmm. And then it carries on forming. It takes on a, a deeper and deeper color. In fact, it takes three times longer to form than the imperial green jade. It takes on this really inky appearance. And essentially, it's not black. Um, it is 99% tone green. Yeah. So we view it as black, but it is just the deepest green that you can get. That's what it is. Yeah. And when it's, when it's omphacite jade, which is jade out mixed with the ultra rare kind of omphacite, you get a tight, tighter crystal structure. Okay, so you never get coarse material. You get this incredible, I mean, looks, I mean, you can show that, guys. That is amazing. But it looks like the glass oh, in, in, in the bracelet that, that yeah. Mark has done. And I, I never yeah. expected that. And that, to me, even as someone who's been around Jade, if someone showed me that, and particularly if it was on Jewelry Maker, I would think that is stunning. But it's, it's going to be in some sort of Swarovski crystal or glass because it's just too clean. Or at the very yeah. most, a spinel. Yeah, or something that might be treated like an onyx that yeah. is heated or dyed. Now, I just want to quickly touch on the two varieties of black jade because even to me, a year ago, two years ago, I thought all black jade was black jade, that's it. Yeah. You know, we, we have all learned so much yeah, um, in the industry, but there is two distinct species of Burmese black jade. Um, and I'm just going to read it to you, you might already know this, but Burmese black jade I can really be classified into two different distinct, uh, distinct varieties or species. Okay, the first is the omphacite jade, which is what I've got for you today. And the second being known as the burnt chicken skin jade. So omphacite jade is far rarer than the burnt chicken skin varieties and exceptionally smoother in uniform texture and color. And it's often returned to as mok choy or Mexican green in China and inky jade in Hong Kong. Uh, this is high quality jade. It's actually a mixture, like we said, of omphacite and jade, which creates the ultra fine crystal size and occasional translucent ability. Now, not all omphacite jade is translucent, but um, all will have smooth, fine texture with a uniform, deep black color under reflected light. Now, the translucent pieces will exhibit glowing emerald green color when transmitted light is shown through them. And that is something we've got actually in the large cabochon, cabochon there. Mm -hmm. So with burnt chicken skin, you'd get mottling with gray, but with the omphacite material, you get this veining of green running through it occasionally. It's ultra rare, like they said, 
All omphasite black jade will be this incredible tight structure, but not all of it will have this level of translucency and these secondary colors of the green coming through. That is kind of like a, a throwback to its history, its yeah. formation. You know, at yeah. one point it was green and it's still got that kind of hangover there. That's an ultra rare gem, that's a specimen. It doesn't fit into the bicone series, but we're bringing it to you today. And, and um, I just want everyone to know that there's only one gem like that in the whole show. There's own, everything else is uh, opaque, yeah. um, which is stunning, incredible, ultrafine crystal, as you saw with that reflection of light. That's the only piece that has um, that, that, that unique, beautiful display of the green running through it. Now, they say, although the colors of these two jades are both black, the black color is different. Okay, the color of the burnt chicken skin, which is the material that we usually bring you, it's the material that is, is more readily available, even though they're both ultra rare, that's the material um, that forms in larger boulders. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the burnt chicken skin, you can get, you can, if you ever get a bangle or a carving of black jade anywhere, it's never gonna be onsite black jade. Okay. Because onsite black jade comes in very small kind of shards. You know, when you see a black jade bangle, type A, it's gonna be the burnt chicken skin. Ultra rare, ultra fine. But what you've got today is, is the rarest of the rare. And we, like I said, years ago, or a year ago even, six months ago, I might have thought all black jade is equal, black, black is black. But like they said, this very different color. The, the color of the burnt chicken skin variety looks gray, gray, black under direct light. And it's not usually translucent. When it's translucent, it shows light shades of white and black with no green. That's how you know that one is on for sight, particularly. Yeah. Um, the crystal structure is usually coarser. So it's a coarse grain material. It's the omphacite that gives you those fine crystallizations. Um, and that's why, like it says here, they're usually used for carvings and bangles. Now, because we don't have any of the burnt chicken skin for you today, I'm going to show you what it looks like. You'll you're remember it because pretty much 99% of all the black jade I bought you across both of the networks um, that, that we have bought you has been the burnt chicken skin variety, which is ultra rare. All the bangles I bought you of black jade, whether it's the hinge bangles or the solid black bangles, will be um, the burnt chicken skin, which is still type A, incredible black jade. It looks like yeah. this. And it's we, we know this, so we get those white and gray mottling features, uh, and it's a coarser grade. And I think, you know, even me, I wouldn't have been able to get a head around this even a year ago. You know, the different, I mean, especially when you're talking about an opaque gemstone, I, I would never think about talking about the crystal structure. No. But you can see it now. I think we can all understand it. Yeah. That's a coarse crystal structure. Um, and again, I'm going to show you an, another piece which is slightly finer. It's this slab. But that is still the burnt chicken skin. It's just a finer grade of yeah. it. Um, but then I'm going to show you what we have for you today. Okay. And there's a massive price disparity. That's why they, they're clear to say, these experts, that it is just two distinct varieties. Not all jade is jade in the same sense. This is the imperial material wow. we've got for you today. And it's just night and day. It is night and day. You know, if we go back to even the finest grade, I'm not even going to go against the lower grade. This is a medium crystal structure, um, medium grain. It, it still has those flecks of the white within it and the gray. But then when you switch to this, yeah. that's the ultra, ultra rare. That, and that is what we have for you today. Now, um, when we go and talk about that crystal structure, the GIA uh, says that, that jadeite has a smooth, even texture. And we know that it makes people want to touch and hold it. There is something really magical. I call it the X factor about jade. And jade's texture can be fine, medium, or coarse. Now, depending on the variations in crystal size and hardness, these texture categories are sometimes called, respectively, old mine for the fine grade. Because there is a belief in, in the Far East that only the older material, not, and there's no new material that, that has that fine crystallization. Okay. Um, then you've got the, the, the relatively old mine, which is the medium grain, and the new mine, which is the much coarser grain. And it shows them both there. I mean, it's two almost identical pieces of jewellery. Yeah. One is the fine texture, which is the imperial, and one is the coarse texture, which is known as the chicken skin. I wouldn't have known any difference in those, really. No, just, just, just a few months ago. I'd have been like, okay, color, it's just we? Yeah, absolutely and, uh, you know, how rare jade is. Yeah. But those two, the disparity between them is really stark now with our newfound understanding. Then there is the In Colour magazine, uh, which had this article about jade at jade. Um, it's written by Geng Li, who's you know, an incredible gemologist. And there's just this one piece where he says, an old Chinese saying for evaluating jade is, beginners emphasize color, which is what I would have done. Oh, black jade, black jade. While experts emphasize texture. Texture has long been considered a crucial factor in the appreciation of jade, including jade at jade, since ancient China. Texture reflects the aesthetic value of internal beauty. Mm. You have a really unique opportunity today. The first time we were ever seen bicones, first time the world might have ever seen bicones in jade at jade, wow. and you're getting the imperial material. So 
I found this incredible website. It was in Mandarin. It's been transcribed for us. But essentially, um, they're, they're documenting a trip to Mandalay where they're trying to acquire this ultra-rare imperial black jade. And they say, our search often leads us to low-quality, high-priced rough with little to no visible windows. Once in a while, however, you can find high-quality pieces for sale at extremely high prices. At this point, it becomes a blind gamble to know exactly what can be cut to produce pieces that will pay for the high cost of the rough stone while also providing a profit. And that's why, you know, like Mark said earlier, when you've got something this rare mm. and you don't get it, you know, and it's extremely expensive, and they're like, look, we've got to cut enough for this to, to, to pay for that cost, you're not going to cut the most wasteful cut. No. You're not going to go, okay, well, hopefully this is going to pay for it. We're just going to waste all of this. And yeah. Obviously, one is, is maybe okay, but to do a strand, how a many horse. times have you cut that <laughs> yeah. much yield out? And they say there are many tables of Chinese buyers waiting with signs that read black jade. These buyers attempt to buy up all the available black jade out of the market, which they would then send to China later to be perfectly cut by digitalized laser cutting. And this is how, who really utilizes laser cutting, which is when you get a gem and you x-ray it, essentially, just because you know, we all jade out as a skin. And uh, Lawrence Graff, this billionaire jeweler, uh, releasing the, the world's largest D-flawless heart-shaped diamond. Well, they do the same thing. Yeah. They do this computer imagery where essentially they put it through a machine um, and it will you know, penetrate into the crystal and say, right, this is how you get these cuts. This is the yield you can get by avoiding all the flaws. This is what they're doing with the black jade eye. Yeah. They say, finally, at the edge of the market, we find three pieces of rough that have been polished on all surfaces. That was on the previous picture where you saw the three on the hand. Yeah. This picture doesn't correspond with this. That's my fault. So they look nice, but there's no telling what will be inside once they are cut. My expert guide explains to me that the dealer will try and only show areas of the stone that are beautiful with polished windows. But if the whole piece is polished, then it means it's of a higher grade. And it was $7,000 just for those three shards. Wow. In, in a wholesale, not even wholesale, like at the mine, essentially, in the market. That's the opportunity that you have. And you see pieces like this on the websites where it's like, the ultra rare on site jade, you know, bracelet, a grand really, that ring, 690, that tiny, beautiful kite cut uh, is 990, then you've got just one pair cut, which is 790. This is all on site black jade, just single gems, single gems, you know, 3.9 carats, four and a half carats, um, sensational, but this is the difference in the burnt chicken skin and what you're looking at here, which is the on site or the imperial jade, like pieces like this, just a little 8.6 gram slab, grade A. Uh, Gem Lab certificate, five hundred and ninety dollars. Sally Hewer, who who helps us in our you know bid to find this material, showed me the price. She was like, when you're talking about the imperial material, she said a ring like this in the picture would likely sell. Now we're talking retail for between two and five thousand US dollars. Now yeah. of course, of course, that's in gold, but it's just the the fact that you've got that incredible yeah. clean surface where you get that beautiful uniform uh, 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 color and that fine crystallization. This is the burnt chicken skin now. This okay. is black jade bangle, incredible, 400 pounds, certified rare, natural, black jade bangle. But the reality is, and I want you to understand this, it's not natural. Even though it's listed as that on first dibs, when you read the, the, the uh, product details, the, the second to last sentence, this is a treated jade bracelet, as to be expected with such a large piece in this price range. Oh, okay. So they're saying, look, you're not going to get it for 500 pounds. Even though we put oh, natural, right. you should expect that it's not. And I know that because I've brought you the natural hinge bangles. Okay, I bought them to you at an incredible deal, completely natural. And I tried to replace these. Now, this isn't even the grade you've got today. This is the burnt chicken string grade, which is mm. extremely expensive. And the price has, has gone up so much since the mines are closed, as I'm sure you can imagine. Yeah. I, just to let you know, I sold that for £299. I sold it for £299, it's incredible. To replace it, it's $7,000. Wow. That's wholesale. Yeah. That's wholesale. Now, of course, that's one piece. If, if, for, you know, if I could get 200 it's still yeah. going to be in the thousands. Yeah, of course. You're not going to... Just wholesale. It's the exact of... same piece. It's the exact same wow. piece. Wow. This is, you know, like I said, the, the reality. Now, when I was out in Hong Kong in November... Um, I spoke to one vendor who had some Taipei material, and she said, if you want colors of jade, I've got these three really special pieces. No one in Hong Kong has these colors. So they've got the imperial black, the yellow color, and tricolor. She says they're all natural Taipei with certificates. They're $8,000 a piece. So she said, in retail, these would be 10 times that price. Mm. And I was like, so retail, you're saying these 80 grand. And I was like, is this Hong Kong dollars or US dollars? 
um, because that's a huge difference. And she said US dollars, not Hong Kong dollars. American dollar price would be 60 to 80 grand because these are Taipei and that's imperial black. Wow. That's what the, the opportunity that would bring you today. You find pieces like this. This is just a black jade necklace with turquoise accent beads, which nice. is incredible. 5,600 pounds on first dibs today. And they're really honest, actually, these guys are, because when you go into the lot of details again, um, second paragraph at the bottom, although these beads are classified as black jade, they're not piano black. That's yeah. what you've got today, piano black. Rather, they are more of a silvery black, which we know is the burnt chicken skin. An absolutely stunning color, and the addition of turquoise accent beads with the silver clasp make this a strikingly beautiful piece. But that's burnt chicken skin, five and a half thousand uh, uh, pounds. And I spoke to a gentleman whilst I was in uh, Hong Kong, whilst I was in uh, the Canton Road, and he said, in the West, they call it piano black. He said, here we call it imperial black. He said, I've sold four imperial black strands, which is what we've got for you today, just in the buy count. Yeah. He said, um, they're far rarer than imperial green strands, but a little bit more affordable. Wow. And I asked him, he said, it's so hard to make imperial black necklace because the rough is so small. No large boulders of that material. Mm. One strand could take 10 years in, in the size that he was talking about in the rounds. And he said, the last one I sold was for $18,000, but today I wouldn't sell it for less than 30. Now they are larger rounds, you know, yeah. they might be 10 mil or maybe 12 mil, but just the whole idea of getting a strand, he's saying it could take 10 years mm -hmm. because the rough is like shards, tiny, you sold them in the market, three, three uh, shards. You are talking about the piano black material today. You're talking about the imperial black, the omphacite jade. Even the burnt chicken skin today right now on first dibs in a strand is five and a half thousand pounds. This is night and day. We have a unique, very small collection of this material. I agree with Elle and, and, and Mark that I think this will be a complete and utter sellout. Oh, but like that. I think it's going to sell out in seconds. I, I do too. Do you agree? Completely. So, so we are going to give you the opportunity right now. We're going to start with the largest bicones. Oh, my word. The first thing I also, I noticed that a lot of the viewers who have bought bicones in the past, all of our bicones, Swarovski, Glass and Gemstone, the, the cone at the top have had six facets. Oh, wow. And as you can see from the video going around there, there's a lot more than six. Yeah, absolutely. So straight yeah, away, that, oh, that's even you better. You that. And you get, like I said, yeah. with that, you get those shards of light. There we go. You, you do. Oh. You really get this flickering effect of light. Now, I'm going to ask for 30 seconds wow. in the gallery, please, guys, and we're going to make this available. Um, just to, to manage expectations, how many do we have of these? 75. Okay, well, then I don't think that's enough. I mean, we, no. might, we might be wrong. The clock has started. We've when never this had bike codes like this. No. Never, no, never, no, never, no, never. No. The most beautiful yeah. bike codes yeah. I've ever seen. Yeah. Ever yeah. seen. There's 150 mm. carats of Taipei Yeah, grade. I mean, it's just piano black, it's imperial so omphacite black jade. It really is. Um, look, I've never had an experience with the bike codes. I've never seen it in jade, obviously. But when you get this, this dance with the light cascading oh. across these gems and you get that tight crystallization, that uniform color, the graphics are open. This is the only time you're gonna go, see 150 go, go, carats go, 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 go. of this legacy material. Legacy material. It's remarkable. It it's really absolutely is. remarkable. I'm, I'm a convert, like I look at this and I'm like, yeah, I love the bike on there. Yeah. I love the way that it interacts with the light. Of course, it is extremely rare uh, uh, to do. Um, got, a, got a message in from Haley in West Yorkshire that says, this, this variety of jade I'm unfamiliar with. Thanks, Dave. We're all learning together. Absolutely. You know, oh. any time that, that I can help with that, like I'm always learning. I'm not an expert. Um, I'm going to start right now. I'm going to start wow. at £3,000. Yeah. Which already beats the burnt chicken skin variety. Yeah, yeah already, exactly. No. We've got exactly. Richard in Dorset. You've multi bought Rupal in Middlesex. Susan, you're in. Brian, you're in. Pamela, you're in. Wiltshire, you're in. Uh, there's a queue forming on the phone lines or, or, or on the web. This is nowhere near, of course, where we're gonna uh, where we're gonna end. But but could. Oh, for but sure. So Should. could because I'm fairly sure if you looked anywhere else in the world, yeah. you quite probably wouldn't find bicones in black no, jade. No. I mean, I don't I don't know if you'd find a strand of piano black jade anymore. True. I don't think there you would that, because even in plain rounds. Uh, well, yeah, I think the, the, there's more of a heavy incentive to just sell them as cabochons, just yeah. loose gems because of the value of them. Uh, Maker in Devon is just multiple. Again, I'm going to ask for a 30 second clock. Um, okay. It has it is proving extremely popular. We we have far less than a hundred of these oh. available, so we don't really have enough. A lot of multi buyers coming through. I'm going to give you this clock. We're going to start the clock right now, and when this clock finishes, you're going to see another price that you're not paying, but could. It's going to sell out 
for sure. Absolutely. And I'm, I'm very envious of those people that managed to get hold of this as well. Have you ever seen? Never. I mean, I love, as you know, I'm a massive advocate. I love bicones, but even I've not seen bicones with as many side facets as these. No. So the work that's gone involved in this strand is just yeah. amazing. <gasps> oh my wow. goodness, Dave. Okay. Um, I, I just can't believe I'm going to say this, but I'm going to say it. Ross, take £2,000 off the price. <laughs> and of course, still, you guys know, if, if you guys tune in, you know that this was still nowhere near the final deal. Mm. But even in the wider market, this is it's an unbelievable deal. Unbelievable. It's, it's better than Absolutely. trade. We're in three figures right now. Uh, we're looking at almost a quarter of the stock gone. Um, a lot of you on the phone lines. This is where I'd start confirming, just so you know. There is nothing else like this at all. I'm going to give you your final price now. I'm going to go straight to it. Yeah. That's for a 30 second clock. I appreciate it, guys. But I'm going to give you a 30 second clock and we're going to take hundreds off this price. Amazing. And you are going to benefit from that. You're going to secure this legacy 150 carat collection of the legendary and legacy Omphasite Piano Black Jade. 20 seconds. Oh, my goodness me. Uh, yeah, this will be gone in seconds. As soon as. Gone in seconds. Yeah, I, I agree. You have your interest-free split payments. You know, I'd make use of those today if you wanted to get both sizes that we're offering. If, if, if this is something that you're interested in, if, if this is something that you, you want to get because we're not really going to be able to have the chance to work with it again. Ross, well done, by the way. Well done to everyone along the bottom of the screen. It's already checked out. It's already confirmed. There's a lot of you on, on the, in the queue. I would make sure you're checking this out with it in your baskets because right now, for this, which is crazy, we're going to get a 129. We are going to 129 pounds for the big 150 carat it's massive. collector's opportunity. It's huge. But also, you are one of less than 75 yep. people in the world for sure. that own this. Yep. Yeah. How exclusive. It, oh, it doesn't get more exclusive than that, nope. does it? So Let's we, be honest. Oh, my oh, goodness, Dave. Um, and, and the thing is, even with minimal movement that like we're seeing here in the studio, the way that it interacts with the light is so dramatic. It's incredible. It's so gorgeous. beautiful. It's, it's like a black spinel, isn't it? That's yeah, the, the sort yeah. of sparkle we'd expect from a spinel. Absolutely. Yeah, and, you wouldn't, and, and, and we shouldn't ha expect that of Jadeite, yeah. should we? Absolutely not. Be we shouldn't because, you know, this is, this is a gemstone. You expect it to have the occasional sort of mottling. That is literally, it's as black as black can be. Yep, yeah, 100%. And, and it's that uniformed colour as well. Unbelievable. That uniform saturation, that pure, incredible uh, uh, tone and saturation. The, the, the unbelievable luster, but due to the, the, the incredible crystallization, mm. the tightly compact crystals that are, that are woven together in the structure of this jade. It is the rarest such jade out there. Um, a lot of us are multi-buying. So really, oh. if, 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 if this many people are multi-buying, really it's about 50 opportunities, isn't it? Because yeah, we've got really. Linda's bought two, Rupal's bought two, Susan's bought two, Brian's bought two, Seema's bought two, Maker in Devon's bought two. There's a lot of you deciding to, to multi-buy on this. Well, there's a bit of a queue building on the phone lines. We're about 60 seconds, so it's not, it's not too bad. No. But it, um, just to avoid disappointment, web app, it's always the way forward. For sure. For sure. And we're only taking confirmations. Right, let's do a one-minute clock. I'm going to go one more time. I'm going to go again, Ross, on this, which is as you know, will impact the rest of the show. But we're getting, thank you so much. This is the minute clock. I don't know how many we have left, but this is when I check out. Because those of you that know me know I'm not just taking, I'm not just taking five or 10 pounds off. Okay, there's 19 left. <laughs> you can do this. Every <laughs> single one of you that has fallen in love with this today, you can be successful. Richard in Dorset's just bought four. I don't blame you, Richard. I don't blame you. Well done. Um, like I said, we are only taking confirmation, so we're not considering the baskets right now. You know, if, if, we're, if we're looking at the, the baskets, it's sold out three times over. Yeah. But I want to, to create the confidence for you guys at home. If you haven't even picked up the phone yet, or you haven't even opened the app, you can still be successful because the, the baskets mean nothing, really. It no, won't exactly. be there. It won't it's be there. Oh, like that. Yep, absolutely. So there's about, I don't know, 10, 15 chances remaining. It's really unusual to get anything bigger than a six mil bicone for us as well, is it? True. Very, very mm. true. Yeah. And here we are bringing you, Eight arguably, mil. this In is the data. pinnacle. <laughs> this yeah, is literally is. the pinnacle. Incredibly. Of all, I have to say, of all our jade strands. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's stunning. Because of the cut. I agree. I agree. I mean, it's a cut that I was not familiar with. I'm in love with it now. Um, but it is extremely wasteful, as you can clearly see. Uh, Ross, let's go to £99. Oh, um, wow. And then, and then look, we've got very <laughs> few opportunities coming up in the rest of the show. 
nothing like this. We have the yeah. other bike owners which would work perfectly with what Mark has created, that wonderful Beautiful. kind of tapestry. Uh, but this is the big size, the 150 character. Devon, Absolutely you've just bought three. Beautiful. Julian Bromsgrove, I'm imagining a jade kiss cross necklace oh, yeah. made with sterling yeah, silver beads. Um, how indulgent would that be? That would be beautiful. Oh. I can't yeah. get over that faceting. That is so exquisite. I know, it's, isn't it? it's literally mirror like, isn't it? Or yeah. you could be quite sparing and create. Oh my God, I, I only just realised the earrings. Yeah, I, well, I had to wear them, didn't I? Oh, I didn't even know we had them. They are <laughs> sensational. They They're look... a 99 pound pair of earrings. Oh, easy. Just, Next just, door, just, yeah. I think they'd be 129, 149. You know, right. you think about the, the different sizes of the bike owns, this geometric look. I mean, I can imagine. Next door, we've never bought bike owns. Imagine if they see jewellery like this, yeah, they're going to yeah. want to yeah. move into that because yeah. it has a complete unique, you know, you different look. You can make look. that, Dave, in a matter of five minutes. Yes. Well, I don't know if I could. You could. Uh, you, you guys. Mark could show you. You could. You yeah. could. You could. Yeah. It's Maybe. 12 remaining opportunities. Yeah. If there is a single one of these come the end of the hour, Mark and I are all over them. Oh, for sure. And, and like all I said, you know, once I've seen what, what can be achieved, like oh. the earrings, and the fact that those earrings are created in-house, the fact that they can be created, yeah. is something I would not have believed. I would not have believed. The if I saw those in, in, a, in a gallery or I saw those in a, a boutique jewellery house and it was like certified type A black jade, you'd think, well, of course, the best craftspeople have worked on these, you know, especially the lapidris. Yeah. But I, I didn't think this would be achievable. Caroline, good morning, um, all. That bracelet. Yeah, Mark, what a job. It to me, Dave. Um, I just want to thank you uh, for oh. my gift from your JDEC collection. Oh, no problem, my Caroline. Page. I'm so glad that you, you've received it. Uh, what did Caroline win? Um, I can't remember what, which one did you win, Caroline? Because there were seven uh, different uh, oh, pieces amazing. that we gave away uh, to, to people who liked the page. And Caroline, you were successful. I'm so glad you were. Of course, it was completely random, but yeah. you know, I'm glad that, that Caroline, you amazing, were one of those collectors. Amazing, Caroline. Now, if you are one of those people that have it in your baskets, Julie, I've seen you messaging. You've, I think you've still got it in your basket. Helen, West Midlands, Joan, Elizabeth. Out of the 75, we've got seven left. Seven of them. Yeah. And if you do miss out, you can always wish list it. Do you know what? Let's do, let's do a one minute clock to close the auction. Yeah. And whatever, whatever uh, runs out first, whether it's the quantity or the, the time expires, whatever it is, we are going to move on. So we're going to give you a minute to make your mind up and, and before we move on. How amazing. Seconds. Yeah. How amazing. Yeah, so you've got 55 seconds until we close this auction or until stocks last. Oh, my goodness me. Can you imagine this? Can you imagine this? The vibrancy of that, of that jadeite. I could have said that that was jadeite on that bracelet. And yeah, the luster we is mirror-like, isn't we it? We would, we would well, usually, we'd be scared to show something like that next to, you know, for instance, burnt chicken skin. Yeah, yeah, because, yeah. you know, nothing can look as good as glass. Like, you know, when you have the, the red crystal or the red glass, you'd never show a ruby next to it. Like no. a natural gem, it's very hard because that is just perfect. That's yeah. the point. It's actually perfectly manufactured. Yeah. The fact that this jade is... You know, beating it in its own game. And it's Mother Nature. Yeah, it's Mother Nature, yeah. It's 15 seconds, guys, nature. five chances remaining. Um, I, I would love for you all to be successful, although that can't be the case because there's so many of you. Uh, but we do have two remaining opportunities. Yeah, um, if you want 62 to check those out. people have it in their basket for the final two. Yeah. Congratulations, um, well done. That's unbelievable, unbelievable. My heartbeat is completely pounding. Yeah. This, this next strand. Oh yeah, this is the one. This is the one I was told that yeah, yeah, yeah. is the same size as the pieces in that bracelet. Mm -hmm. yeah. We heard a message from a collector earlier just yeah. saying that, just the idea of creating that. By the way, when you just pick that up then, like the, the dance of the light coming off it, it's just accidentally, look at that. Yeah. I don't know if you can pick it up on the camera, I don't know if, it's, if it would really showcases, but from here, when I'm seeing it catching the light, it's absolutely sensational. Amazing. And, and although it looks beautiful it's almost, there, it's not showcasing what I'm seeing. No, you, Wait until you get it home. Do you know when you um, back used to draw the little pictures in the corner of your book and flick it through and it looked yeah. like it moved? Yeah, yeah. That it had that absolutely. amazing um, sort of mirage of light, yeah. didn't it? Oh my goodness me. So how many of these do we have, Ross? 145. Amazing. So what do we always say? You know, the, the bigger the quantity, the, the bigger the deal. This is probably the most popular size, I would imagine. There's so there's a multitude of designs that you can create with this. Like the earrings feature uh, two or three of these gems. The, the bracelet, that kind of tapestry bracelet that we've created uh, is working with this size. You can have it stationed on a necklace amongst other gemstones. There's so much you can do with it. 
Let's do a 30-second uh, oh, wow. clock. Am I allowed to say the word sexy at yeah, I think quarter so. to 11 in the morning? I think so, 100%. <laughs> well, that's what it is, let's be honest, it is. Let's wow. do a 30 seconds. Thank you, guys. There's 24 seconds before we open oh, the graphics. Oh, my goodness me. Have you ever seen anything quite so no, spectacular? I haven't. Do you know, I know we've got big TV screens dotted around this building, and I know right now there will be yeah. people from all different channels yeah. watching. Absolutely. And not quite believing that this is Black Jade. Yeah. It's the same number of facets on the sides, even on the smaller bicones. Yeah, and which, make, which is work. exactly even more oh. difficult, really, when you're dealing with yeah. you know, coming down in size. If you think about, and I know this is a strange comparison to make, but I saw something yesterday which blew my mind and I'm sure many of you have seen things like this, but have you ever seen those carvings they do on the, on the tip, the lead of a pencil? Oh, have you ever yeah. seen them when they're like, yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. they'll carve something really intricate? Now, obviously, to carve something like that out of, you know, something much larger, like wood or, or marble or, or clay, is, 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 is still an amazing skill, but not as difficult as doing it at the, the smaller proportions. But something and that's that hard as steel. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, exactly. It's hard as steel, you're absolutely right. Um, and there's no room for, 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 for error in no. a bicone. No. It has to be almost methodically precise. Yeah, it's like uh, precision engineered, isn't it? Yeah. Essentially. Um, that's why we do it. There you go. Yeah, thank you, Ross. Oh these, are, these are what I was talking about. These kind of amazing, intricate carvings that are, that are done on the lead of a pencil. It's amazing, isn't it? I uh, did see something the other day. I think it was like a mother and child or something. But I was just like, wow, insane. And then you also see those other ones where they create those wonderful tiny sculptures and they literally put them in the eye grain of the needle. Of or a grain of rice. Yeah, or a grain, a of, grain rice. of rice. as well. Yeah. What? Um, they, what? Yeah, they take a grain of rice and, the, you know, we, we get... How is that possible, Ross? jadeite sculptures and... Oh, look. How is... I don't... I cannot believe that that's even achievable. It must be, but obviously that middle one. I'm like, how have they done that? That's amazing. It really is. It blows my mind. And Big Ben... In a pencil. In a pencil. Yeah. Can you imagine then? You spend all that time doing that and somebody yeah. goes. Just sharpens it. <laughs> <laughs> you find, yeah, you yeah. find your, your, your little in there. You spent hours doing that. <laughs> wow. But the thing is, well, how fragile is lead? Do you remember you drop a pencil and you start sharpening it? You just keep snapping off and snapping off and snapping off. And you just have nothing left in the pencil. <laughs> Um, but look, there's so many of you on the phone line. Sorry yeah. to go off on a tangent. I was just really wanted to, to make it really clear that you know, when you bring those, those um, design ideas down into a smaller size, it's much more difficult. In fact, it's more labor intensive. It's routinely more expensive. And, and then like Elle quite clearly said, when you're dealing with something as hard as steel, yeah. this isn't as easy as doing it on glass or doing it in, in any gemstone that we're aware of in the West. You know, most gemstones are very easy to cut, especially we've been trained for so long. But with something like this, it's extremely special. Now, we said we had 144 opportunities. That's amazing. It is amazing. Like, it, it's mind-blowing, really. I would have thought, there's no way. And it is still the same grade. It's that Omphacite Imperial or Piano Black Jade. It is type A. It's 100% natural. This is not dyed. This is not polymer impregnated. Mm -hmm. And what, you, what we're showing it next to right now should be unfair. Should be unfair. It should, it should, you know, the, the fact that this is natural, and then it's being compared it should, to ma yeah, manufactured glass, which we know is actually perfect. Yep. Perfect. Yep. And yet it is still holding its own. Totally. And and this is why I think it's extremely well received. It has 40 carats. It's still massive carat weight. Very usable. And I've had my eyes open today. At just just the amount of wonderful things you can do with these. Do you know, I always look at something like this and I'm so like simple minded because I don't I'm not I'm not a designer in that sense and I look at it and I go I just look at it as a strand and I think oh it's beautiful and then I see something that we can create like, this, like that which I would never think I mean I know jewelry like that exists but I wouldn't think we we could make it. But you it. know what yeah you know and, and Mark you demonstrated this literally a few weeks ago mm, didn't you yes. so if you watch that back yep. but you saying about the strand I've same Dave I'm not a talented jewelry maker, I can bead, I can do a little bit of knotting as well. But this knotted in between some of your, I don't know, some of your uh, white jade, Absolutely. your your yes. cotan or something like that. Well, just like with the um, broncharonic. I'm, I'm going to start right now at a thousand pounds. That's how good this deal is yeah. going to be. I'm going to start at a thousand pounds. Sorry, yeah. guys, that's where we're starting. Um, and, and just to you know, I, I completely agree. You know, putting this with other gemstones is such a great idea for me. Just like that necklace that I showed you earlier, which wasn't piano black, no. but it was five and a half thousand Just, pounds. Uh, yeah. That with turquoise. Yeah, lovely. You know, I do love the idea because it's that really sharp pop of colour, mm. that contrast. To have these unique, beautiful turquoise t moments in between black jade is a match made in and heaven. You can see how much better yeah. 
this strand that I have on the back of my hand and before it. Objectively as well. Even if we, that. But they're the first to admit that as well. That's what yes, I love about it. Yes. You know, with the bangle that I saw on first dibs, it was a bit misleading, said natural in the title, and you had to go into the lot details to explain that. But here, they, they quite clearly say in the lot details, you know, it's not, although it is black, it's actually mottled, yeah. it's still rare, but they literally explain, they even say it's not piano black. Yeah. They don't want you to expect what we've got. And that's no. still £5,600. And, and as we know, it's, it's larger, of course, but a round is much more easy to, to create than this unique bicone. Um, but a Scott Jamby, yeah, amazing. Lovely. Yeah, yeah you know, that kind of, that, that's a combination that works, isn't it? Black and gold, essentially. Beautiful. I yeah. love that combination. Oh, yes, oh, yeah. Caroline. Yeah. Yes, I love that idea. With South Sea Pearls. For sure. I'm still to see, yet to see everyone's designs, aren't I? Mm. Like, you know, everyone at home. I always hear about what they're going to do, but I never get to see what you guys get to see when you see all the things come in. On the Wall of Fame, yeah. It's, 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 tune in, um, 8 o'clock in the morning. Okay, see them there. I'll do that. That's what I'll do to, to make sure... Or we will fine. put together that Wall of Dave. Uh, I'll just tune in at 8 a.m. It's <laughs> fine. It's okay. Um, let's do a minute clock. Oh, Look, you know how it works here. It shouldn't, but it does. And we, we, when we have a large quantity, we do an incredible deal. Yeah. Bigger the quantity, bigger the deal. Realistically, what, as, a, as a, like a, a business, if you had a business mind, which I don't think any of us have here, <laughs> you know, <laughs> let's be honest, not. clearly. But if, we, if, if you're business minded, you know, that, that kind of, the, the idea of buying something in a big quantity to get a better deal at wholesale, but then selling it over time at the right price yeah. is how you increase your profit margins, okay? Yeah. That, that, oh, I'm not I'm like I'm not a businessman, but that's no, how it, it is. works, isn't it? it is. you know, or we could have divided this up and said, okay, well we'll put some on Gemporia, yeah. some on Jewelry Maker, and that way it's not as big and we don't have to go as low. But we are, and we're confident about that, and we are going to do it. And there's a there's a ton of you on the phone lines that want to own this material, and I'm I'm thrilled for you because um, I don't think we're going to bring this this cut back in jade. No. You know, it's difficult enough to bring jade back. But then to ask them, like you said, Mark, the mo hey, can you just carve it, cut it in the most wasteful cut? It's gonna, no one's going to do it. Or if, if it does, and this is why we always talk about why the Marquise is so expensive, particularly with diamonds. It's not because of the difficulty of the cut of a Marquise. There's many cuts like the Asher or the Heart Cut that are much more difficult. The reason it's so expensive is because you're expected to pay for the material that you don't get. Yeah. You know, you're expecting, someone's got to pay for that material that is being wasted if you want that divine cut. Um, Ross, we're going to take £900 off the price, and I'm not done. What? Yeah, I'm going to take £900. I, I mean, I off knew the you price. were going to go lower than the previous challenge just yeah. because that's the kind of thing that you do. Yeah. Also, as well, I think. But 99 Let's not forget, as well, you're actually getting more jade here. Not in carat weight, but in the fact that they're both 38 centimetres, but these are smaller, so you've got more of the individual okay. jades to work with. True. And if you are true, breaking true, it up, true, you've true. got more opportunities to work with it. You've got a whole yeah. load more of the jade in this opportunity. There's a lot of you on the phone. By the way, I'm not done. You get your, your split payment interest. And you know, what, what price did I start at today? A thousand pounds, did I? Or did yeah. I start higher a thousand pounds? And, and you know, the fact that I can go take 900 pounds off, which is I just know. so dramatic. <laughs> and you're probably thinking, yeah, well, of course, because you just called a thousand pounds and it's, it's a kind of fake price. I'm telling you right now, that's it's the not. reality for this material. Yeah, it's like not. I said, when I take you to, to, to First Dibs, um, which is in the UK, it's, it's a website that, that any of you can go on right now, and they have a black jade necklace. Okay, they are larger, no, no disputing that, but it's objectively, I don't know, if, I, I can't say it's a lower grade, but it's a more affordable grade. Mm -hmm. It's a more readily, readily available material. Um, and this is, I don't know if it's in silver or gold, but you can see it. It's strung, silver. okay, silver, and you've got black jade necklace, turquoise accent beads, and it's 5,600 pounds. Yeah. The fact that I put this at 1,000 pounds. Yeah. Is, exactly. is, not, is not actually me raise, hiking the price up sky high. Not at all. That's me doing an incredible deal. And, you know, I really actually want to, um, at some point, have an account on First Dibs. And I don't know how you get verified, but I'd love to have one. Yeah, I've always wondered about that, because uh, they are private sellers, aren't they? Yeah, they're amazing. They private are amazing. Sellers. I mean, the, the, the things you can find on there are, are genuinely out of this world. You know, it ranges from, like, antique furniture, like, turn of the century, mm -hmm. you know, uh, amazing art. You know, it's all, it's all that kind of calibre of, of yeah. things, right? And you're verified... Uh, is, is very strict as I understand it. I'll take a minute clock, I'm gonna go again in a massive way. Oh I'm not God. just taking a little bit off, we're gonna go huge. The jump's gonna be massive. Um, good luck to all of you, we had 144 opportunities. I would be multi-buying if, if I can, because even if, imagine if we brought the bicones back, and we did a showcase later in the year, and we said we've got black jade bicones, but it's the burnt chicken skin. Mm. You're not gonna be able to work with it with this material. Mm -hmm. 
Because it would be so different. Yeah. I guess the grain would make it harder to cut, surely? I, I, I'm, I'm sure they can do it. They can do it. You're right, it would be more difficult. It wouldn't have the same display. You wouldn't get lustre. Okay. Certainly not this kind of lustre. You'd get the shape, of course, but you wouldn't get the, the idea that makes this so stunning, that makes this so beautiful. That's why we haven't done it in white jade. Because I think you want that incredible, dynamic, contrasting luster. If you did it in any other jade, you're not going to get that, the way that this works with the light. And that's the beauty of the bicone. That's why we have those cylindrical facets on the top portion. That's why you get that unique geometric shape. Um, we are down to double figure stock now from 144 opportunities. Um, Ross, let's get a 69 pounds. Let's get a 69 pounds, which is, it is unbelievable. It's 40 carats, a, a huge amount of this wonderful, uh, interesting idea in terms of this project, this cutting. And I'm gonna say to you all right now, you still get your interest free split payments. And for, for, I would use it. I mean, there's no, there's no problem. There's no gatekeeping to that. I would use it just to make it go further if you wanna get more pieces today. Richard, again, you've got four of these. I think you've got four of the other ones as well. I can imagine the wonderful jewelry that you're gonna create. Could um, Ross just divide 380 by four for me? By four. 380 by four. 95. So the bracelet that Elle's wearing, the one, the, the Bico necklace that I made, that's a six and a half inch, and that used 90. So if you want to get any bigger, so you'd be able to do the six and a half inch with one strand. Wow, I thought it would be two. Go, yeah, if you wanted to go any bigger, because that's, that's quite small, yeah, yeah. six and a half. So if you wanted to go any bigger, you'd, you'd need the two. But then you could, make, you could make matching kiss cross earrings with the, with the remnants. You could make a kiss cross pendant. You can do other bracelet, so. Unbelievable. Yeah. Guys, there's, there's Heather's got four, Richard's got four, Meath has got three, and then I think uh, Eleanor, is that you? That's you, isn't it? <laughs> oh my gosh, you've got four as well. I was like, Eleanor in Worcestershire, Maybe. and I was like, that is you, I know it. You've got um, everyone else multi-buying to the tune of two. Well, I think Mark needs these as well, so I did get mm. you some. So Amazing. I think Mark needs to make this in black. Yes. Well, then I, I actually yeah. want to see that. I'm going to come back on a show when Mark yeah. brings it in. Uh, we should do something as well where... Not that, I mean, you work with whatever you want, Mark. I'm not telling you what to do, but imagine if, you, <laughs> imagine if we created the identical piece and then played which one's the glass. Yes. Oh, yeah. Imagine, yeah. and you, I don't think yeah, you'd yeah. be able to tell. That's no, how good this no. grade is. That's it how amazing And we should be able to tell, shouldn't we? Yeah. Well, I would never have bought a glass piece no. if I wasn't confident enough that the jade art could, could stand up to it and it's, it's blown it away. Uh, it really I mean, has. that's humbling. It's amazing to hear from yeah. someone uh, like Mark, who's an incredible designer. You know, when you, when you speak to people who are, who are working with, this, these, with the gemstones mm. and you, you hear them waxing lyrical about it or talking about the mm. quality of it, 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 it makes you feel great. Now, it's amazing for you guys at home as well that you now know that you can create the exact look that Mark has created with just one of these strands. Amazing. Which I, I genuinely, when I looked at it, I mean, what do I know? But I looked at it, I thought, probably going to need two or three, you know, just in my mind's eye, because there's so many rows of this. But you can do uh, exactly just that. Just with one well, of you, these, you can create that. Yeah, just do the centre if you, you want could to. Do. You could do, absolutely. Just do and I've, I've done quite a wide bangle. You can, do it, you can get away with half the width of that, and, you can, and, and then you'd have more than enough with your single strand. Out of curiosity, Dave, I mean, if something like this was on, on gems in black jade, mm -hmm. Could you guess the price? Oh my God, it would be in the hundreds. Yeah. It would be in the hundreds, because I'm only saying that because of, we've sold, like say, necklaces. Yeah. And I know the price of those. Uh, something like that with that level of int intricacy. Like even our collectors next door, we sell millions of pieces of jewelry, yeah. certainly in, 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 in a year. We've actually never seen jewelry like that. So I thought it couldn't be done. Or I knew it could be done, but I didn't think that, you know, I thought it would be something you'd have to outsource to somewhere really yeah, special yeah, and pay a yeah. fortune for. It'd be a lovely um, collection. Let's do, a, let's do a 30 second clock and I'm going to go again. What? I want you to be able to create what Mark has created, but I also want you to be able to get a second one and maybe create something else. I know Al's got four. Um, and, and, and I think many of you may, might want to do that. Now remember, everyone pays the final low deal. We absolutely don't have to do this, but we want to. We want to make this yeah. an opportunity for everyone. You know, and if you're thinking, think, uh, thinking, I couldn't do that, well, you can watch Mark's demonstration back as well on YouTube, but you don't have to. I've bought, uh, you know, I've bought a quantity to give Mark some as well, but also to make really simple beaded necklaces. But the earrings, like earrings you said, you like said this. the earrings like that, again, so high-end, so couture. Go 49.99, Ross. Let's, wow. let's give everyone a crazy deal today. But those earrings, when I look at them, I just think, there's no way we, we can create those. But obviously, El said and, and, and Mark says, and you guys know as well at home, you know you can create that. 
And that just looks so divine. And that's just utilizing yeah. a very small portion of this. And yeah, I think I've right. bought many showcases of Black Jade, for instance, next door. I don't think I've ever bought earrings that look as good as that. They're amazing, aren't they? Yeah, and that's so beautiful. I don't know why, but they are absolutely so high end, so couture. And so simple. Yeah, and so, the so earrings simple. we bring might just be like one cabochon with a shepherd's yeah. hook, and that's it. Yeah. But that is just so elegant. That beautiful, understated, dramatic drop. Very elegant. It has that like moment of modernity. Yeah. Like it looks modern, but it also has that cl that really classy feel to it. There's a load of multi buyers on this one. Yeah, look how many people have got really five. Well, yeah, done. I don't blame you. We've never done. I I would never. You know, when you kind of think like, you can you can. Oh, it'd be nice if we did this gemstone in that cut, or we did this. Like we, I've just had. A, we had an email yesterday from yep. Wayne saying like, guys, it's the birthday. You know, is there anything we've pretty much purchased it? But is there anything in particular that you're interested in that I can maybe get in and answer the last few months? Never in my wildest dreams would I even contemplate saying buy cones in 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 type AJ. No. Whether definitely not black. No. And then not this grade of black again. I didn't even think this when we ordered it. I was like, right, just a black jade. It'd be great to get that luster. But the fact that they've gone and got you the omphacite material, that they've used that material for this collection, is, is just mind-blowing. Rapidly think... pushing four rows of names, jewelry makers. Yeah. So um, if you haven't yet checked out, we are hugely over-allocated. And you've got to remember, look, uh, uh, Saima, you've just bought three. Fiona's got two. Pauline's got three. Jean's got two. Alison's got two. I've got fives. Yeah, everyone's getting twos, threes, fours, fives. I'm not surprised at all. Yeah. Don't be put off by that quantity. There is still time to dial through, though, Dave, isn't it? For sure. Like I said, we, we are, especially in moments like this, we're only taking confirmations to make it fair for everyone. Um, so we want to say, that's why I'm really reticent to, to read out the kind of baskets, because then I think you think it's a lost cause. You know, the, the fact is, the baskets... They're amazing, it's great, but it means nothing in, it, nope. in, in, in an auction where we know we're going to be oversubscribed. So you can definitely be one of the 11 that calls up right now or uses the app right now or checks out right now. It's not the fastest to put it in the basket. It's the fastest to check out yeah. that is successful on these opportunities. So we want to make you aware that you can all be successful. It can be done. There are nine genuine chances on your screens that are here waiting for you. And there's two of the eight. Oh, oh, there's two remaining of the eight. Amazing. <coughs> but make sure that there's a huge the eight. eight. You can get both of those for under £150. Yeah, and why wouldn't you? You know, why wouldn't we when we can do that? Just unbelievable, isn't Single it? Single figure stock now, guys. And in the uh, 12 o'clock hour, I'm going to be demoing the Kiss Cross, which I think is the technique for bicones yeah. without a shadow. Is that, is, that the, is that what we've done here with the bracelet? This is flat kiss cross. The, right. the, the kiss cross we're doing at 12 o'clock, it's a tubular form. Oh, wow. So if you imagine yeah. that curled over. Yeah, amazing. Yeah. Almost yeah. curled. <coughs> um, which would be amazing, yeah. wouldn't it? Yeah. So you'd use the six mil, the little four mil as your, as your little sections, and then the eight mils as your, oh, beautiful. your bumpers. Beautiful. Yeah. Um, we've Richard's got, just got six. I don't blame oh. you. Uh, well That's done. Congratulations. Beautiful. If there's even one or two chances remaining, check the website uh, or check the app. Same with the 8 mil. We did have, uh, I think, two of those strands left. Yep. Um, so, you know, if you can sneak in and get that, then absolutely, by all means, go for it. Oh, wow. Very, very special. Wow. What an amazing showcase this is. Okay, we're about to bring you... Do you mean this pendant? Or? Wait, before we even show it, if it is this one, before we show it, can I um, just quickly uh, run back through to my... Um, that piece that, that I wanted to really share with you guys, which was, you know, we see the burnt chicken skin. Let's sh I want to show you guys this. So this is the burnt chicken skin grade. This is the really high grade or A grade burnt chicken skin. And then do you remember the, the juxtaposition when we jumped to the imperial, yeah. right? That impressive display of, of oh type A Jada. And then whenever you want, guys, in the gallery, if you want to show everyone the... the really special, beautiful pendant that we have. Oh. Take a look at this, that wet look finish, that really tight crystallization, that Imperial. uniform color. And I love the trio of natural old mine turquoise at the base. Now, by the way, these turquoise, better. well, these turquoise were, were the original jade. So thousands of years ago, before they, jade used to be a term that was used for all the most valuable and precious gemstones in ancient China by the okay. emperors, okay? So it applied to three or four different gems. And okay. one of them was this legendary turquoise. And you can't get any more. I mean, most turquoise that you see in the industry is treated or will be matrixed. You know, it'll have webbing. So all Sleeping Beauty we bring you, uh, even if it's in the 18 karat gold, will be treated in some way. Mm -hmm. So known as the, the, the Zachary process. 
This is 100% natural, this wonderful trio of incredible original old mine Chinese turquoise with the legendary imperial black jade uh, a pear cut. It is a, a feature, a, a finished pendant, isn't it? Yeah. As we're bringing this right now. So it's a wearable, ready to go piece of jewelry. I think this would absolutely look amazing. 925 actually. sterling silver. How many of these do we have, Ross? 100. Okay, that makes sense because for me, I'd have made earrings. But that would mean we'd only have 50 opportunities. Can you imagine with those trios of turquoise underneath framing the face, just oh, two drop fun. pair of, of this incredible grade uh, jade? And that's so easy to do. As oh, for you guys, yeah. really, really yes, easy absolutely. to do. Yeah, yeah. Right, 30 second clock, and then we'll bring it in, 100 opportunities. Wow. Maybe a lot of you might like the idea of making earrings, which means if you are multi-buying, there's maybe 50 opportunities realistically. 24 seconds, the unique, incredible turquoise, the Taipei uh, Omphocyte Imperial Black Jade. Amazing, amazing, amazing. I'm going to try my hardest to, here you go, so you can visualise what Dave is suggesting. Yeah. Would you, Mark, would you remove the, um, the chain? And just keep it on the actual. Just keep yeah, just just keep the bail and just just pop the uh, shepherd's hook. Food Graphics food. are open. Yeah. I love that. Oh, look at that. But this this is what I was um, alluding to earlier. So in this book, they always go on about. I know it's it's getting old now, but this book, uh, Jade: A Gemologist's Guide, it gives you the history. It goes into the the origins of jade, and the title of this uh, this chapter is the Four Great Jades. Sorry, cheers, Adam. The Four Great Jades, and here you can see them. And there's the turquoise. Oh, yeah? So basically, when they say the China's original, uh, four grade jades. So top left is Hishan jade, which is your mutton fat. Then you've got uh, Dushan jade. Then you've got uh, bottom left, uh, serpentine, essentially. And then below right, turquoise. And this is that legendary turquoise that you really, really struggle to get now from this legendary location. Wow. And so to have, you know, the, the original, one of the original four great jades in ancient China. To have Which that is this, this turquoise. Dependent. Yeah, just that trio, just that beautiful, uh, subtle nod to the history yeah. of this legacy gemstone. Then you've got the Omphocyte Black Jadeite Cabochon, the, the largest single carat weight we've seen in the show. Um, Absolutely. 100 very, quantity. Yeah, and, and I actually think, Dave, that cabochon, our cabochon here, is actually mm, yeah. more reflective. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Than, I agree. The, the, than, the, than the example that you showed a few moments ago. I agree. There's more luster. Mm -hmm. and, and it's that it's that beautiful, what I always call the wet look kind of finish. And you, I think when we say that, we understand what we mean. It, it literally appears to be wet. Yes. It? You know, it has that slick, beautiful sheen. Slick. Now, that's not waxed. That's not anything going on there. There's no film over it. No coating. It's just, no, no, it is just that tight crystallization. Now, this is how good this deal is going to be, but you have to be really quick. You know, when we've brought you the other pieces, we've started at you know, £2,000, £1,000. I'm going to start right now at 499 That's where I'm going to wow. start. Obviously, we're going to be nowhere near it, you know that, but just to give you some idea, some insight, because this is, there's only 100 opportunities. I wanted to start off by showing you how serious we are about this piece. Um, Linda, you've got three. Richard, you've got three. Well done. Oxfordshire, Devon, Surrey, Middlesex, Kent, Essex, Sussex. Look at that. It's beautiful against the skin, isn't it? Right. Uh, please have a 30 second clock. I'm going to ask her a 30 second clock. I'm going to go to another deal and, and just want to let you know right now the deal you're about to see. Just remember I've said this is not what you're paying. So the deal you're about to see, and I think it will just completely sell out of this is not the final price on this unique, exquisite piece of jewellery. And in 10 seconds, you're about to see it. I don't think anyone's, anyone's ready. Susan's got two, Brian's got two, Oxfordshire, you're in, Linda's got three, Richard's got three. That's 10% of the sweets, stock gone. Sweets, maybe? Maybe a few sweets. Oh, uh, I think it would make sense. Yeah. This is the price you're not paying. Not paying? 79.99. Not paying? Not paying. I'm going lower. I'm going low, I just wanted it's to give you, and I've said that, even if it sells out now, I'm not going to finish the deal, I'm not going to close the auction, I'm going to still take a chunk off. And remember, I, love, I don't just take £10 off. No, you don't, you don't, true, that's very, very true. I love that, every time that you uh, step into the studio, Dave, we not only are treated with the most beautiful gemstones, but also I love the, you know, you know what we learn. Um, I never knew that about turquoise, and I love the fact that it's included alongside, mm -hmm. they, put, they match beautifully. So, so when we think of, of turquoise, 
you know, when we think of the history of Turkish, yeah. specifically when we learn about it in the West and we read the GI articles, we always talk about, you know, the Egyptians, we talk about the Persian turquoise, mm. turquoise from the Middle East, but actually the oldest turquoise that goes f back far further, but this is before they were trading with the rest of the world. Yeah. It already it almost been mined out or they'd lost the kind of seam before they were integrating with the rest of the world. Mm. But in this Far Eastern culture, this was known as the one of the four original gems. Amazing. So this really? is it. This We've is got serpentine to wear here as well. Certainly. On the serpentine, there you go, um, is is one of the four original gems. You can see how, how even though now it's it's been deciphered and, and it's different in terms of uh, the modern kind of vernacular, like it's been, you know, it is serpentine, it's not jade. The way they still revere it. I mean, when yeah. we showed those four pieces, if you saw that, it was like a jellyfish carving, did you see it, of mm, the serpentine? Yeah, yeah. Like the way they work with that material, it's craftsmanship. 30 second clock, these are gonna go right now. Oh, Richard's got six, yeah. Devon's got two, West Midlands has got two, uh, East Sussex has got two, Hampshire's got three. We had 100, we don't have 100 now. We're at 79.99 for a finished, unique piece of jewelry. And it's finished right now, but it still can become something else. You, you can decide what you want to do with this piece. That's the beauty of you guys being uh, uh, jewelry makers, understanding yeah. the process, making well, earrings, do, doing whatever it is that you see with your imagination. You've got the ingredients here, Dave. Mm -hmm. Three components that are on that first dibs necklace. Turquoise, yep. silver, yep. and imperial jade. Yeah, absolutely. Um, final deal for every single one of our collectors. Uh, be as fast as you can. I tried to give you some insight, I tried to give you some warning. 49.99. 50 quid. Wow. <laughs> 50 Actually, yeah. correction, theirs wasn't imperial. No, no, theirs, theirs was, was burnt the, chicken skin. It's still chicken sensational, skin. but you're right. You know, this is... So you're getting a better grade. Mm -hmm. It's in silver, natural white topaz. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Oh, that's incredible, isn't it? 49.99. Yes. What a beautiful Valentine's Day gift. You'd love uh, that from Tom for 100%, Valentine's Day, wouldn't you? 100%. Yeah, and I think they've just got it right with the three turquoise. I think any more than that, and it would have detracted away from Yeah, it would have been overpowering, wouldn't yeah. it? I think it's just that tiny moment, that kind of yeah. uh, subtle kind of accent. It does remind me a bit of the Harry Winston ring, though, with the Mandarin garnet. Yeah, and the turquoise accents. And the, and the accents. turquoise yeah. accents. It reminds me a little bit of that. Everyone's, you know, working with, with uh, you know, colour right now. Everyone's mm. working with turquoise in particular. Very few have access to the natural material. Amazing. Natural. Yeah, natural turquoise. 49.99. I wasn't expecting that, Dave. No. But look at how many multi-buyers. So, yeah, I do think a few mm. sweets yeah. um, are on the horizon. Um, I love it because also this uh, uh, jewellery can be, I've, I've always described it this way. You can have jewellery that is beautiful. You can have jewellery that is pretty. You can have jewellery that is fun. You know, it shows your personality. This is that striking, edgy, it's, it's yes, different. It is, no, completely. I think it's beautiful. I think we've got the topaz as well. Yeah, uh, amazing. Uh, and two and a half, well, 2.2 .2 grams of solid sterling silver as well. Uh, but look at the quality mm. of that amazing imperial black on for site jadeite. Uh, Ayrshire, Tina, Moira, Cumbria, hello to you. Devon, Meath, Richard, Susan, West Midlands, loads of multi-buyers getting involved. Yeah, Valentine's Day, mm. all the occasions. Okay, um, uh, I'm not even going to ask for a clock, but I am going to tell you right now that you know here at Jewelry Maker we bring you you know, the loose gems, all the components, okay? Very often, it's not very often we bring you finished pieces of jewelry. The reason this is here is it was a closeout. It was offered it, the price was so good that I was like, we're, we're gonna take this, we're gonna bring it to our collectors. Now, realistically, uh, it was a bit of a fight because really I should just put this next door. Mm. I should just take this straight away next door. It's a finished piece of jewelry, it's kind of how it works. That's how we separate the yeah. two uh, when we're buying. Uh, but the, the deal is this incredible closeout. And the fact that we have this Imperial Black Jadeite Showcase meant it would just fit perfectly here. We're at 49.99. This is a closeout. I'm going to offer you the same great deal, 29.99. What? Take advantage. There was what? 100. There's not 100 now. 29.99 is oh your deal. Goodness. You're going to have to be fast. You're going to have to check this out. I don't know oh who's going to be successful. Word. Oh my word, Dave. Yeah. We could literally have walked this. I don't know, four meters next door. Oh my goodness me. Um, it is going to sell out in a nanosecond for, for sure. Imperial. It's crazy, isn't it? Omphocyte black jade. At 
Madness, absolute madness. Linda's got five. Angus, Surrey, Carol, Candy, uh, London's multi bought Jean, Susan and Brian's got three. Susan, Sandra, Tracy's got three. Maker in Oxfordshire. Dave, this is going to be gone. In of a course. In a heartbeat. You, uh, Linda's just got five. People, I hope there's not many people in the office today. Oh, God, no. Because can you imagine if there's all like the gym's crew, they're going to be like, what? What are you doing? <laughs> Why is this not on our channel? Yeah. 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 Um, Luckily, it's going to be on and gone. Yeah. Um, let's do. Let's, should we do a minute clock to close the auction? Yeah. I minute clock so. to close the auction. I can't leave this on the screen uh, for too long. We're at Thirty quid. It's madness. Uh, which is just ridiculous. As you guys are aware of that, clock started. Once this expires, the deal is going to move on. But you have the opportunity right now. Thirty pounds, twenty nine ninety nine. Did you plan on doing that? No. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. No. <laughs> As I I'm didn't sure you can imagine, it. it's a closeout. When we get a closeout, you get a closeout. It's a finished piece of jewellery. Um, which is something that we, you know, we don't usually bring to you oh. here. Uh, but you get the opportunity right now. And, and you know, with the deal, with the deal that you've got, with the deal that, that you have here, like you know, you, it's better than cost. Essentially, you can just take this apart and create whatever you want. Just take you it apart and just create. Feed that onto a sterling silver chain. Of course. Get in touch with First Dibs. I don't oh, know. Yeah. I've not done that, but no. maybe give it a whirl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And I'm fairly sure make profit. For sure. 16 seconds. Oh, my goodness. Or, you know, you've got the opportunity coming up to like 10 seconds before this deal disappears. Uh, lots of you seeing the opportunity and, and multi-buying. I think that's the right way to do it. When a deal's this good, just take advantage. It's already gone. Good luck. Well done. Thank you, guys. Amazing. Wow. Amazing. Amazing. Um, I wasn't expecting that at all. Neither was I. Um... We have. Yeah, this is this is my. I'm, I, I did. Do you know when I was prepping last night, and I was that I was reading sort of our descriptions. I think it's got it's it's, it's a language. Yes. On, on its own, and I'm yeah. sure it's a language that you're. Yeah, yeah. You know, you so every so often gizmo. What's a gizmo? All oh, right. Um, kiss cross. What's a kiss yeah. cross? Yeah. A puffy pear. Yeah. Um, for me, it's, <laughs> it, it's it's a pear cut, isn't it? It's a pear cut. It's stunning. Puffy pear, I mean, it is what it is. <laughs> but, uh, you guys probably I did know better than I, I do. It. I but like, I just hey. think, sometimes I just think, what are we doing? But it's great. <laughs> and I guess it's really, you know, oh. it gives you the idea of exactly what we're talking about. It's more of that three-dimensional shape rather than a flat bottom. Um, I, I'm in love with this. It's beautiful. And, and this is the one that I was talking about that has the, the, the remnants of its history within it. It's the green coming through. We talked about the omphacite. We talked oh, about that good. material showcasing those, those secondary colours. It's unique. It's special. It's a giant carat weight. How many do we have, Ross? 30. Oh, no. I actually... 30 carats and there's uh, 100 available. There's barely any... Oh, okay, sorry. It's 30 carats. I thought you meant we had 30 available. I was worried. No. Okay, we've got 100 opportunities. Fantastic. That's great. Okay. I was like, oh... No, 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 30 it's carats, it's, it's huge. I knew it was huge. Look at that. I thought we were saying we had 30 available, and I was like, well, there's no point even talking about it. It's just Look at how gone. beautiful that is. Yeah, I'm, I completely agree with you. Right. Let's do a 30-second clock to bring the graphics in. Um, I've, we've never had access to this material. Now, remember, we talked about the Omphocyte Black Jadeite. And um, they said, you know, not, not all Omphocyte will be translucent, but when it is, it's going to show this green colour coming through. Yeah. Uh, we've never had it. I've bought you one for Black Jada before across both the, the channels. Never seen it with the green coming through. Do you know what this reminds me of? You know you had that bangle that I, th I think... Yes, I remember. You know the the Jewelry House weekend. Yeah, where it with, had with different... The, the pepper jadeite with the black and the green. Yes. Through. Yeah, I mean, you know, it is essentially what you're looking at. 30 carats right now. I think, you know, a lot of you might look to multi on this and get the earrings, uh, get the, the, the huge... Just get one piece if you can. There's a hundred opportunities. Um, and, and we're going to do a, an incredible deal for all of you. A, a fantastic deal for every single one of you. Just to show you how good that deal is going to be, I'm going to start at a thousand pounds. Wow. It's a giant carrot weight, but it's not just the carrot weight. It is the grade of the jade. It's, you know, there's very few jade arts that we haven't bought to right now. Yeah, this we bought you everything really red, uh, the, the, the wonderful yellow material, mm. the russet grade. Um, we brought you the white jade out, we bought you grey, we bought you black, we bought Lavender. you the tricolours, we bought you everything, lavenders. You're getting the opportunity right now to get a grade of omphacite that very few, even jadeite dealers, have managed to acquire, that have managed to see. Um, sorry, we had a question in then saying, is it drilled? Yes, half drilled. Okay. So what that means, it's uninterrupted on the bottom. Mm -hmm. um, so top drilled. So, so then it really does actually lend itself to earrings. Earrings, it? earrings, I think, a pendant bale. Yeah. 
Uh, yeah. Hang on. Sorry. That's my fingerprint just there. That's all right. Um, all right. Min minute clock, please, uh, guys. And I'm just going to go straight down to your price because I can see how busy it is. There's a lot of you there. Um, I'm actually jealous because I didn't get a chance to get this before we came to air. Um, so if there's anything left, I'll be taking it. Beautiful. Just unrivaled. Rarity. Yeah, it is. Unrivaled rarity here. Again, you've got the tight crystallization. You've got that wonderful sheen, that luster, that, that uh, incredible interaction with the light because of the tight crystallization. And then you get these, this bicolor almost with the secondary beautiful greens coming through um, and that beautiful deep inky black color, the mock choy jadeite. I can imagine something quite gothic with these yeah, earrings, yeah. Uh, like a pair of earrings and a matching pen. I think they'd be really beautiful yeah. in sort of a, yeah, like a gothic well, style. Well, you know, when you think about like, um, I don't know, antique furniture and it has like a patina to it, mm -hmm. as like, you know, the where it's aged. And this is essentially what's happening with Mother Nature here. You know, this is that unique patina that is, you know, prevalent and, and permanent within where you've got that moment where it switches from that imperial green into the, well, the ombre side black jade. Ross, this is going to be wild. It's going to be a really, really fast auction. Okay. I'm going to just do one price. It makes no sense, but I want to do it for every single one of you. We're going to go to 49.99 and it's going to oh. be gone. It's going to be gone, 49.99. I can see you on the phone lines. I don't know who's going to be successful. Probably shouldn't go that low. Probably should have gone 149, 199, 179. We're at 49. 99. This yeah. should never be in double figures. 30 carats. Yeah. It's enormous mm -hmm. in terms of its size. And I'm, uh, you know, in my peripheral vision, mm. I can see that um, chicken skin jadeite ring. Yep. You've got the green within this instead of the uh, sort the of the grey and interiors. the white. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely remarkable. Loads of multi buyers. That's Taipei. Well. That's certified. That's natural jadeite. And it's showcasing these wonderful. Uh, balance of these two unique colors. You've still got that amazing reflective. Yeah, of course, that, yeah, because it's the emphasis, you get that unique yeah. crystallization. That, that means that you don't get that chalky appearance. It's not a coarse grain, it's a fine grain, which, which means that you're gonna get that luster, you're gonna get that performance with the light. It's, it's a magical piece, that, which, the likes of which we'll probably never see again. No, which uh, again, just looking at a few pieces, mm -hmm. Um, they're beautiful, don't get me wrong, and believe me, I would not turn my nose up to any of them, but you know, you can see the difference in the luster on each of those pieces. Uh, yeah, because as we said, this is that yeah. coarse grain. Coarse grain. So um, when you look at the burnt chicken skin, uh, for instance, the ring here that you can see, it doesn't have luster because it is that coarse grain. Yeah. And you get the fine grain, you get that kind of wet look appearance. Um, and the light just bounces off it, and then you get the combination of the colors as well. Ross, let's do a minute clock and just give everyone an even better deal. Really? <laughs> yeah, we're just going to do it. <laughs> we are going to do it. This is going to be a one show wonder, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. It's going to be on and gone. Yeah. You've got um, 53 seconds to, to get yourselves on the phone and get yourself in with a chance at acquiring this. I would imagine we've got people from our, our, our sister channel watching today, Dave, because they obviously do follow you to, uh, to Jewelry Maker. If, by the way, you're thinking, how do I turn that into a piece of jewelry? We can even bring you the pendant bales that you glue into oh, place. Oh, wow. You literally yeah. just glue them into place. And that's it. But that, sounds like, that sounds like something I could do. Yeah. Anything else maybe is out of my realms of, of, of expertise, but I think I might just be able to glue yeah. something in, into the top of that drill hole. Um, it, it will be very easy. And that's exactly what your, your, you know, the, 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 the big jewel house it, piece. Oh, for sure. And, well. But look how it then just transforms it. Yeah. It just transforms it. Completely. Completely. Ten seconds. Oh, my word. Goodness me. Lots of multi buyers. Just liquid like the luster. Mm -hmm. I, don't, I can't. Twenty nine ninety nine. I had nowhere else to go. <laughs> Twenty nine ninety nine. Because you always say you don't just take yeah, the tenor I know. off. Yeah, I've kind of backed myself into Shot a corner there. Yeah, there, definitely yeah. have. Um, live and die by it though. And we're at, <laughs> we're at thirty pounds. Take advantage right now. Um, wow. A lot of you are, are taking the opportunity to buy three. Maybe that's pendant and earrings. I don't know. Mm -hmm. um, so you've got Patricia who's bought three. Uh, Julie, who's bought three. Richard, who's been extremely you know, busy this morning, has bought three. Janice, you've just bought two. Well done. This is as low as we can go. This is a, an unbelievable deal on this material. Look at that. There yeah, you go. You can see it clearly there when you shine the light on it. Oh, my goodness me. There it is, that beautiful green. The, the, the story, isn't it? It's mm -hmm. the story. That's of it. Yeah, I mean, yeah. that's that moment, that unique moment captured in time. It's the first time I've seen it. I've seen pictures of it. I've, yeah, I've read about it. But to see it frozen in time like this, this so moment when it, when it started taking on that deeper 99% tone green. 
um, is sensational. Julie, you've just bought five. Well done. Amazing. So, Dave, when you were over in Hong Kong, yeah. um, uh, was it the beginning of this year, wasn't it? Was it the no, no, it was like year? November, I think, yeah. Was it? Yeah. Oh, I've lost all track of time. Maybe it was December. Months. I think it was November, but yeah, um, late November. Did you, ever, did you see anything like this? No, didn't. It's really, really, really rare. You know, it's hard to find. Yeah. Saw, you know, million dollar jade, saw everything. It just is extremely rare to find material like this. Do a minute clock to close the auction. Mm. Uh, Richard, you've just actually bought six of these. So between Julie and Richard, that's yeah. over 10% of the stock. Collector in, in London has written in saying, well... Uh, goes perfectly with the ombre strand you bought recently. I completely agree. I remember that. Uh, oh, yeah, I know. Million, no problem uh, to, to that you collector. Loved that. Mark loved that one as <coughs> well. The ombre of, yeah. uh, of sort of dark to grey. Yes. Deep grey. Yes, that would be beautiful. You've got so like half a minute do. really to get involved, half a minute to make your mind up, to be as fast as you can, to take advantage, to multi buy if that's something you wish to do. Um, opportunities like this, even for any price, are mm -hmm. hard to find. There are literally 21 remaining opportunities now. Um, be quick, be quick. Yeah. This is the thing, you know, it's at 29.99, we shouldn't be able to entertain being able to purchase a gemstone of this caliber and this no rarity. No way, not on earth. You know, you went to Hong Kong itself. Went to Hong Kong, I mean, I've been to Myanmar. You know, I've been to the place yeah. that this material comes from and haven't seen it. Um, it's, yeah, even when we was going to Hong Kong before COVID, yeah. you just didn't see this material. You'd see Imperial Green, You'd see your mutton fat, you'd see material like that, but this is just ultra rare. It's like a specimen, almost. Wow. Um, so well done to anyone who was successful on it. There's nothing else like that in the remainder of this show. There's nothing else like this before that that's ever happened. So there's even one available. Just jump on there and get it. Um, last up, I wouldn't describe them as puffy. No, I don't see that. So I've got one more auction with you, is that right? One more auction. One, one more, more auction. auction. I'm intrigued. They're not puffy pears. It's a great term, isn't oh, it? We love it. We love it's it. A great it's growing term. on me. They're quite sweet, though. Yeah, they quite are. Quite sweet. You get these lovely curves. Um, yeah, a drop. It's just a, it's a full drop, isn't it? Mm -hmm. But it's a, very much a jewelry makerism. Um, oh, my word. Aha. Oh my goodness, can you imagine the two? Oh yeah. my goodness me, Dave. The uh, combination. Sorry, gorgeous Dan. Can I borrow a board, please? Sorry, we're calling uh, we call it No, of course. <laughs> I, can see, I can see why. Um, look, how many of these do we have, Ross? Uh, uh, 35 carats, so there's 100 available. Okay, this is going to be a wild deal. It'd be as fast as you can on the phone lines. Unique translucency. Um, unbelievable, massive carat weight. Again, you can see that crystallization. You can see the way that this is performing. Um, we are, well, Elle's going to show you. Oh, I've just got something, work. literally. It's let's, 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 uh, 30 second clock to graphics. My final auction with you. Yeah. We're going to go out with a bang. Um, and Elle's taken the, the, the bicones. Oh, both sizes. Let's see what you're doing. And uh, should we go I'm kind of thinking like asymmetrically. I like that. Yeah? Yeah. That maybe you then do. Mm -hmm. Look how that just makes it pop. This. That. And oh, this. Oh, wow. Um, do you see where I'm coming from? I think that's the best piece of jewelry I've seen on any of our channels. Just if that was a piece of jewelry, that's four figures. Uh, here, by our standards. That's four figures, I think. That's £150 for those bicones. Wow. You've just done. This for twenty nine ninety nine. Yes, you're right. I like, I like. I'm thinking like a almost like a it. lariat. I think that is. I genuinely have never seen jewelry like that. That's amazing. Now. It's that would. You be guys can create beef. that at home. You can create that everything yeah. that, that, that is on your screen right now is available. But that just looks so designer, so high end. It, it, I would, yeah, if I saw that anywhere in the world. Uh, it, it would be price on application. I would yeah, you wouldn't, it wouldn't look out of place on someone like First Dibs, would it? Yeah, I mean, and and our job makers when, do that. Well, even more than that, when we go to Hong Kong and we see we go to booths that are, that are you know, Chinese vendors mm -hmm. and they'll have like a glass cabinet with like maybe one imperial green pendant in it. And it would just be, there'll be no price. You know it's going to be six figures yeah. or whatever it's going to be because it's just divine. If I saw that, it would have no price, and I would not want to ask. It's, it's a much larger uh, uh, carat weight than the previous piece, over five carats larger, 100 quantity, 10% of the stock's already gone, and I'm going to do you a crazy deal. Richard, you're in straight away. He's bought six. Yeah, amazing, Richard. Amazing. I'm going to start right now. I'm going to start at... Um, this is so crazy. I'm going to start at 199 pounds. Wow. Not three grand, not two grand, not 1,000 pounds. I'm going to start 
there. It's a perfect size. It perfectly balances yes, as well. If you, like, if, you, if you purchase the previous pendant, it's, it literally matches. Mm -hmm. Plus, I'm going to say, the actual um, texture is yes. the same. Yeah, yeah, of course. So you've got the same level of translucency, just different... You've, got, you've actually got... I think you've got a higher grade of translucency here, which is sensational. Really? And I think to, to have... That, that design that you've just created for me is what it's all about. Yeah? Um, uh, so now I'll take a minute. Now you're making me want to buy the drops to recreate uh, this. Well, you have to be quick because look at the phone line. Yeah, that's very true. We, we, thank you, uh, Paul. We've got a minute clock. We, it started ticking. This is my final auction with you, so I am going to give you uh, a, a phenomenal deal. I would love for you to be able to create that look or whatever look it is that you desire, whatever you think that you can create. But that, to me, when I see it laid out, because when, when, it's hard for me to imagine, when I see it like that, I'm just like, yeah, that in a glass cabinet, oh, yeah. in, in, in a jewellery store window, in, in a convention centre in Hong Kong, or on the Canton Road, that's priceless. Yeah. It is half drilled as well. Sorry, we've had another message coming through. I should have said that. Mm -hmm. um, so half drilled, undisturbed on the underside, uh, underside. So yeah, it is perfect for literally creating your pendants, your drops, your rings, whichever yeah. it is. I'm going to one oh. deal. I'm just going to call one deal, my final deal, um, the, 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 the kind of the, the piece that we're going to go out with. I know Elle still has the incredible jewellery to bring. Oh. I also know that Mark is bringing his wonderful uh, masterclass in, in half an hour. Um, five, four, three, two, one. Ross, I'm sorry, I don't know what it says on your sheet, but I'm going to get a 29.99. Oh my I am. Goodness. Yeah, I know it's a larger carat weight. carat weight. It's a bigger carat weight, um, it, but it matches, and, and, and you know, you, you get know, that juxtaposition. I think. If my maths is correct. Go on. 210 pounds to make that necklace. Phenomenal, phenomenal. That that's awesome, isn't it? It's ridiculous value. You can make that for £210. Yeah. Congratulations to everyone um, scrolling along the bottom of the screen. You guys are the ones that are confirmed. You guys are the ones that have checked out. You, you're the ones that will be expecting to receive this mm -hmm. in a matter of days. Um, those of you that are still um, with it in your basket or maybe you know, still trying to make your mind up, I want you to know that it is very competitive. Uh, there's a lot of you. If this is something you want to create, if this is the piece you want, then I would be checking out immediately. Yeah, absolutely. Don't leave this to chance. I'm joining you on this opportunity. It's absolutely beautiful. Uh, 29.99. Oh my goodness, Dave. I didn't think you know your shows could get any better, but I Thank think you. today it's been one of my favourites. I agree. I mean, look, this is you know I'm completely led by you guys. I didn't know about the bike own, um, and you guys wanted to work with it. We've we've really tried to bring you that. I think we've exceeded all expectations, and then to bring you the other pieces that we've oh, got in this yeah. collection. Um, it's been a phenomenal show, one that I won't forget. And um, I just wanted to finish on a high and take you to an ultra low deal at 29.99 for the 35 carat pear shaped piece. Dave, end. absolutely amazing. Thank, Thank you, you Thank from you. every single one of us. Oh, no problem. For, um, for the, the amazing uh, efforts that you go to to produce these beautiful opportunities. No problem. I'll be back with you very, very soon. Uh, thank you to, to, to all of you guys who have tuned in. Like I said, don't go anywhere because Elle still has amazing pieces to bring you. And of course, Mark is waiting in the wings to bring you his incredible masterclass. But I'll see you guys very, very soon. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewellery maker, sewing street and hobby maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Buying with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. Here's a quick overview of how to get involved. When you see a product you like and you want to purchase, you will see the graphics appear on the screen. You'll see the item code and a starting price. As time goes on, you'll see the price drop. And as viewers call in and customers add it to their baskets online, you'll also see the quantity decrease too. 
No matter at what point you order, everybody pays the final low price. And there's only one PMP charge on everything you purchase throughout the day. We offer you a 30 day money back guarantee. So there's no risk whether you're purchasing for the first time or any time. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you purchase with Jewelry Maker, you have a 30 day money back guarantee? Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. Jewelry Makers, did you know that you can purchase as many times as you like throughout the day and you'll only be charged one postage and packaging fee? No matter the size, weight or quantity of your order, how many times you check out that day, we will still only charge you that single PMP. Keep things simple on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Makers, we have a mega sale on our website right now. There is up to 70% off items with over a thousand items available on all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. So pop along, take a look and start shopping. that calls are free from a UK landline and our phone lines are open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewelry Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane. Our friendly and knowledgeable help team are available 24 hours a day, 365 days a year. If you have a question or query, contact us on 0800 644 655 and press option 2. Alternatively, you can email or drop us a direct message on our Facebook page. Jewelry Maker, happy to help. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join our community of over 69,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions. You can also find us on Instagram and even TikTok. Make sure you get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website. Click on the TV guide. This will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Mm. I'm exhausted. It's a bit full on, isn't it, when That Dave was a comes funny in. noise, wasn't it? That yeah. was a very strange yeah. noise. Yeah. He's amazing. He is amazing, isn't he? And just yeah. lovely. Yeah. Just lovely and yeah, I just love the fact that he's like a sponge. You can just mm. He's got immense it's taste. So, in no, I'm the sponge yeah. and Dave's the one giving the education. That's what I meant. Yeah. <laughs> I said that all the way around way around. He's got amazing taste in shoes as well. Yeah. I imagine he's got a huge he's probably got like a shoe room. A shoe room? Yeah. You never see him in the same pair of shoes twice. Really? I always look when he comes in the studio. Yeah. Really? Mm. I've got to now yeah. look at Dave. Well, yeah, it's in, shoes are important. Yeah. I think so. Anyway, <laughs> we have yeah. still an hour and just, uh, just under an hour and a half left to squeeze in more amazing deals. But um, I, I'm, 
I will be bringing you very, very, very limited quantities of your, um, of your jadeite. Other than the four mils, they are all available on pre-order, quantities less than 20. Oh, so no. you do need to be really, really quick on these. That includes the green bicones at the back, that includes the 10 mils, the six mils, four mils we do have more of. But before we dive into that, Mark, um, at 12 oh, no. o'clock, we have got your masterclass. At last. I, uh, yeah, it's been... So we ordered, we ordered these in September. Yeah. And we thought that they'd be here for New Year's Eve. Big, spectacular, but they didn't Amazing. Arrive. So we've got them today. But it's all good because we've got them yeah. now for, 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 for your spring and absolutely. summer collections and absolutely. things like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, now, have a little look on the website, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. You can't... Can we pre-order, though? No. <laughs> no, I mean... Oh, I'm relieved, actually, because we, we, we wouldn't have any left. That's true, yeah, yeah. Mm. Yeah, no, no, I wasn't really? expecting pre-order on your masterclass. No oh, way, it would oh, sell out. Yeah. It would sell out in probably a nanosecond. There's loads of people wanting mm. that. And the jewellery you should... Oh, it's incredible, Mark, as always. But can we pre-order on the jade? Uh, you can actually see it. It's available on pre-order, so do speak to our contact centre if you wish. But limited, with the exception of the 4 mil, all less than 20 in terms of their quantity. I adore black jade. It's beautiful, isn't it? It is so beautiful. And you might think, as Dave said earlier mm. on, black is black. It's not, though, is it? It's so, there is so many different, you know, you could look at, okay, black spinel. Black onyx. Black onyx. Black agate. Agate, yeah. jet. They all have a look, don't they? Obsidian. Mm. They're all so different, yeah. aren't they? Yeah. So, so different in their appearance. But this is... That imperial black, that fine, ultra fine texture, just amazing. I think the black jade's got a softness about it, doesn't it? I love it's it the so most, I think, with pearls. Yes, yes. I think if, if I had to choose one black gemstone to go with pearls, I'd mm. choose black. No good call. Jade. I, th I, I, I don't know whether it's sort of the translucency or whether it's mm. that amazing fine texture, the quality that we bring to our audience. Um, but I, I love it the most with pearls. I think that oh. they just work together so beautifully. Limited, limited opportunities. Um, we cannot put together a showcase of black jade. This is it. This is pretty much it. Um, I know Wayne was in the gallery a few moments ago. Has he got any black jade on, on order? No, I didn't think so. Oh, no. This is it. Yes, this is it. Oh. And I know Dave uh, hasn't oh. been able to purchase any since um, for, for quite some time. The mines are closed. That's what we should be expecting, to be honest. It was a daft question on my part. Shall we start with the larger size? Is that what you've just said? Oh, we're going to do the bicones. Let's start with the bicones. Again, same applies. The whole conversation that we've just had with the black jade, st same applies when it's green. Mm -hmm. This is one of the world, world's most valuable commodities, and this is one of the most wasteful cuts because the similarities from, to, from a bicone to a marquise it, it, it is, it's very close, isn't it? Yeah, very, very absolutely. close. What I love about this, it's not faceted. It's smooth rounds. The, the, the actual oh, cone yes. inside. It's beautiful. Oh, no. What? There are 17 available. <laughs> and they're absolutely ginormous oh, as well. You could literally just have one singly on a, a bit well, of leather a or chain. Yeah, yeah. Oh, friendship bracelet. Yeah, That's a nice one. idea. Yeah. Cufflinks. It's a really nice cufflink size, actually. That'd be amazing. Look at the size of the mark. Beautiful. They're 8 to 10 millimetres. So pendants, you know, these could be your Chinese lanterns. These could be, oh, yes. I don't know, your little oh. markers in your Marla necklace. You could use these maybe in amongst the beautiful uh, um, imperial black jadeite that you had a few moments ago. But uh, well spotted that, actually. You haven't got any facets all the way around here. It's no. really lovely, very liquid-like, isn't Beautiful. it? And you could put six together to make a flower, which oh, I, that's nice. another reason I love bicones. They really tessellate together because the angle is 45 degrees, so it's absolutely perfect. So it's lovely. Do you remember that's 45 degrees all the way around that we've oh, cut away? I know. So this should be a considered strand. Mm. Should be 16 God. available now. 200 carats. I love this shape. I love the tumble shapes as well. I love the rondelle mm. shapes. I love rounds, don't get me wrong. I love all of the above. But um, it's unusual to get these, but I, I also think they're really quite 1920s. I think they, they bring are, a really el yeah. real elegance, I yeah. suppose, um, to your designs and your jewellery. Yeah. Look at the quantity, it's dropping. 
And that's people making confirmations even prior to us bringing that amazing price on your screen. Type A grade. You've heard from Sally Hewer. You've heard from the, uh, the, the man himself, Dave, who's went over to Hong Kong. What were the two gemstones that he was desperate to purchase? Pearls and Type A Jade. Was he successful? I, I think yes with Pearls, no with Jade. No. £99 to get over 200 carats of this beautiful gemstone. Straight away collectors getting involved. Absolutely gorgeous. You know, you could so easily. What do you think? Just alternate them. I yeah. think they're absolutely amazing. What I would use the bicones for, would, if, when you're doing your, your Marla necklaces, have these for your markers. Lovely. And your tassel topper. Yeah, because it draws the yeah, eye down, it does. doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Um, there are 11 left. You're going to match the price of the four mil black jade. Didn't they go to? <laughs> Didn't. Okay. <laughs> I'm not saying that. <coughs> I'm not saying that because that's. Wow. I don't want to clear out jade. Oh, look, look. It's not going to take long, is it? No. We get, there it is, forty nine ninety nine. We've got seven of them from from mm. the seventeen remaining. I think it's, it's quite a nice masculine shape as well. The bicone, yeah, a smooth one like this. I think it's lovely. They do. They look beautiful. Yeah. You've got an amazing, amazing luster. Again, remember, jadeite should look like melting mm. ice. Mm. You know, it gets that wonderful kind of. It kind of pools the water oh, just yes. on the surface. Yeah. Yeah. Three of them left. Rupal, Vivian, Richard, Kath. Hello to you, Irene. You've got yours. London maker, Joy, Diane, Lanarkshire. You're there. Tiny, where you? Uh, well done. You've got yours. Um, we've got people multi buying as well, but you do need to check them out. Linda, you can still do it if you check out those. But that basket. Don't be put off by the quantity. It's got to be allocated on a first come, first serve basis. We can't say any fairer than that. We've got just one of them left. Twenty of you with it in your basket. So let's move on. Um, amazing, mm -hmm. amazing. And that's the only green jade out strand that we have mm -hmm. for the rest of the show. Should we do the eight mils? I need these. You need these. I, I don't want them. I need them. You've got a project in mind. Yeah. Oh, you have. Mm. Because I bought some of the Bronca Onyx faceted four mil rounds, yep. and the larger size as well. And I want, I've, and, and I tried on that day to actually get right white jade, uh, sorry, black jade out to go with it, and it all sold out. I'm, I, I will wait till the end of the show, or at least the end of this hour, to make it fit. Because <laughs> um, there's less than twenty of them, so. Type A black jadeite, plain rounds, uh, just beautiful, aren't they? If we're lucky enough, we see what Dave showed us very kindly, you know, that strand over in First Dibs. You can look oh, at yes. First Dibs, same, yeah. as, same way we do. These are private sellers, or I, I don't know, I've never actually even attempted to sell anything on there. Perhaps it's something we should look at. Um, but yeah. who, who I, I assume sort of offer their pieces, they evaluate it, they price it, et cetera, et cetera. I'm, I'm, I'm making assumptions there. But we showed you a type A black jadeite necklace with Dave, didn't we? That actually had the burnt chicken skin texture. This isn't burnt chicken skin, which is still beautiful, don't get me wrong. This is imperial black jade with the turquoise, remember? Over 5,000 pounds. I like the way that was constructed because it was three beads, then a turquoise, three beads, turquoise, and that looked like Oh, so it just wasn't even right every other? No, it was every, it was every other three. Yeah. We also had some really beautiful silk earlier on, or, or rather yes. nylon cord, that cyan red. We How did, nice yeah. would that be just knotted, knotted in between? Yeah, that'd be perfect. There's less than 20 available opportunities. Totally natural. Here it is. There it is. Oh, there we are. It looks beautiful with the turquoise. Can we just skip to the next page? Because you can see it up close. Mm. See, every other three. Every, oh, yes. Yeah. Uh, this luxurious and rare black jadeite jade necklace is composed of 30, uh, 37 certified untreated black jade beads that graduate in size from 8 mil to 11. Okay. The strand is uh, complemented by uh, 14 three millimeter robin egg blue turquoise beads stations, uh, beads stationed along the strand and a 14 carat white gold clasp. Oh, I beg your pardon, I said it was silver. It's not, it is white gold, but actually the bulk of the value is not in the clasp, it's in the gemstones itself. Although these beads are classified as blacked, 
black. They are not piano black, rather um, they are more a silvery black, an absolutely stunning colour um, and the addition of the turquoise accent beads um, with the silver class make it. That's where I got silver from. With the silver mm. class make it a strikingly beautiful piece. Instead you of know, you notice that they've not put chicken skin because they, in their, their thinking that it would people off buying them. It's only us in the know Mm -hmm. But know that it's called chicken skin yeah. and, and pigeon blood and all that sort of thing. So they've they've not even put the proper description on there. Yeah, we prefer piano black. Yeah. Mm. This is not that chicken skin colour. No. What is the marker bead, please? Oh, fair question, because we mentioned about the marker beads I don't and the think I, I don't think I've got a mala with them. So on a traditional mala, you have 108 knotted beads. And at every 27, you have a larger bead or a different bead. Um, it's well, probably, it's prayer, normally different. It? It's, not, it's a normally a different bead. So if you're meditating with your eyes closed and you, you say a prayer on each of the beads, you'll know when you get to a marker bead that you've gone a quarter of the way around, half the way around, three quarters. Oh, here we go. Here's a picture here. So you can see we've got the darker bead and then we've got the larger beads. They're what you call your markers and you have three of them on a traditional 108 marla necklace. Yeah, and if you don't yeah. want to go the traditional route, they are also really nice as a de design Absolutely. feature, aren't Absolutely. they? The marker yeah. bead can yeah. be just a design feature too. Yeah, um, yeah. really good question there, Linda. Thank you, Thank you yes. for messaging yes. in. Yeah. Look at the quality that you are getting. It is imperial green. It is liquid black. Do you know, you know, you know, when you look at something like that necklace, really beautiful earlier on, that almost looks like it's, I don't know, like a matte stone, I guess. Do you see where I'm coming it's from? It's got a look of lava kite about it, Ooh. to be honest. I know, I know, I know, I shouldn't say that. But. I get it, though. You know when they're like sort of mm, sandblasted? Yeah yeah. Uh, yeah, 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 I get it. But this is li literally so, so liquid like in its luster. I, I feel like I, don't, I could almost pour it. Yes. It's yes, that reflective. Right. Yes. Again, I'll wait to the end of the hour that I'm all over these because I desperately need some black jade. <laughs> desperately need black jade. I've got the, wow. the piece of jewellery in my head that I want to make. I've even got the silk for it. £99 for 200 carats of that beautiful imperial black colour. Eight millimetre size. Amazing. I've got 20 of these, or rather I had, don't anymore. I've got five of them left. We've got the six mil and we've got the four mil. Six mil, again, less than 20. Four mil, we've got slightly more of those as well. Um, make sure you check out. Hello, Samantha. Hello to you, Susan and Brian. Hello to you, new customers. A lot of multivires getting involved. Don't forget, you are literally minutes away from Mark's amazing masterclass that we have literally waited months on. We have. <laughs> months and months and months. Uh, you may, you can do it. You can do it if you check out your basket. Mm. I'll be joining you on this, my lovely, because it's absolutely beautiful, the quality of this. Look, look, if we just get up close, I'll go dive into the six mils in a second, but look at how reflective this is. That's beautiful, isn't it? And the cameras aren't doing it justice, are they? It's liquid-like. Amazing, amazing, amazing. It's nice that we've got all three sizes. So <clears> you could create the graduation, you couldn't could, you? could, yeah. Graduated Kiss Cross will be amazing <gasps> with this. Yeah. First um. price, classic Ross. <laughs> Not what you're going to pay today. We're going. We're in the six mils now. Graphics for the six mils, but yeah, really beautiful. You want to keep something really simple. We had the red silk earlier on with one of Mark's kits. If you wanted to just knot it, no clasp, literally over the top of your head. How stunning is yeah, that? We yeah. are not stopping here. We've got less than 20 available of the six mils. If you want to get hold of the eight, you still can. You still can, just, I think, anyway. There was like one or two, I think, left when we left that auction. In 43 seconds, we are going even lower. I'm going to assume this is from, I mean, obviously, when it comes to... Um, all black jade is technically a green. It's, it is actually, um, if I was to show my uh, torchlight to it, you would see it's a really, really, really beautiful, inky, dark green. So ignore what the words on the graphics. You can see alongside the imperial uh, black strand, next to it, it has that intensity, that pure black colour. We shouldn't be going lower than 99.99. And we all know what happens when the beads get smaller and smaller, don't we? Hmm. Oh no. 10 left. And this split pay. I'm holding my breath because I don't know what Ross is going to do, but I've got a feel. Yeah. <laughs> 69.99. Down to the final four. Again, yeah. 
Um, again, there's been a, yeah, an eruption of activity on the web and on the phone lines. First come, first serve. We can't say any fairer than that. Um, I just like the idea. Maybe replicating, get, taking, it, taking it. No, don't replicate. We're inspired by Taking inspiration from that beautiful necklace earlier on, how about replicating the, the colours? If you haven't got turquoise in your stash, using that with your silk. Yeah. So what about like a turquoise? We had that beautiful yeah, teal did, earlier on, didn't really we? Nice. That'd be really soft, wouldn't it? Yeah. yeah. Oh. Amazing. Now, they're flying out. Well done. Now, the four mils, we do have a bigger quantity. Could I use the four mil mark in that bracelet? Yes. If you didn't want it as sparkly as, and uh, yeah, you can glittery, which would be a bit more subtle. Yeah, any, any four millimetre round, you can use four millimetre round or bicone, absolutely. Cube, you can do it with cubes as well. Look how beautiful they are together. Go on, Lisa. Imagine that in a really lovely, long, yeah. you know, navel skimming, type A, <laughs> imperial black. Mm. Jadeite necklace. It's the style of necklace that, that Anne and Sue are now world famous for with the, with the larger have, yeah. at the back getting smaller at the front yeah. in reverse. I think that's ingenious. I love it. That's stunning, isn't it? I absolutely. And if I got all three of these strands, you know the cards are silk, would mm, that be yes. enough to do that long line necklace, yes. do you think? Absolutely. Wow. Right now, it's about the four millimetres, always one of our most popular sizes because you can use them, you know, individually. You can use them in things like your, uh, um, your looming. Mm. You can yes. use them in kiss cross. In your kiss cross, rosary link. This rosary link. I'd go gold if I was rosary linking, I think. Yeah, nice. I like the gold. Really pretty. Peyote, oh, as she said. Beautiful. Yeah, like you said, your bead looming. <sighs> amazing. I love chenille would be lovely in this. The chenille stitch. Ah, oh, beautiful. Yeah. We're at 69.99. We do have a bigger quantity, but I tell you what, Ross, tell me what you're going to. Go on, tell me. Oh, yes. It's, it's so good. Mm. For imperial black, natural, type A jadeite, we're going to go lower than a pound per carat, which is just <laughs> madness. We are talking about black jadeite takes three times longer than any other colour of jadeite. You know, if you remember the Mason and K color wheel, it has transitioned through every single one of those colors. Um, even Imperial Green that it once was, and it's just literally tiptoed over. It can take millions and millions and millions of years. Well, it does take, not can, it does yeah. take millions of years. It's like amber, isn't it? That takes, the longer it's left, the darker it gets. Yeah. Isn't it? Oh, this is considerably yeah. older yeah, than older. amber, though. Yeah, yeah. The price is coming in. I hope you're in. I hope you're there, ready to, to secure yours. Okay, again, we'll dive into a break in a few moments' time. I'm all over each and every single one of these sizes. Forty-nine pounds and ninety-nine <laughs> pence only. And all I'm going to do is I bought some of those pearl bundles um, um, that we've brought to air. Um, I've also got some lovely pearl strands um, that have just been sort of waiting, waiting for mm. their black jade. I, and today is. The, I know we haven't got any on order, so it's now or never. It is literally now or never. There's a bigger quantity. When you say bigger, how big? 40, okay, so it's still not massive, is it? Uh, Simon, Samantha, Susan and Brian, Christine, Rupal, Vivian, Linda, Samantha, Brenda, new customer, uh, well done to you. Christine and Devon, you've got yours amazing. A lot of multifiers getting involved. Um, the four mil, well, half the stock has already gone. There's still opportunities, though. You know, the four mil, for me, is one of the most versatile of sizes. It's the most versatile, I think. Do you? Yeah, because you, you can group them together to make a beaded bead, mm. in effect. So you can make them go, you can make them get larger or smaller. They, they go on. They, what I really like about this as well, they have really good drill holes. Yeah. So you can get all your... Um, Even the four? Your, I think so. I think so. Probably get your elastic. Oh, yeah, yeah, easily. Oh, yeah, yeah, easily, look. Yeah, so even your elastics yeah. will go through if you wanted to keep it ultra simple on a stretchy bracelet. Um, seven of them left. Well done, everybody. A lot of you still there. Um, I've got one final auction before we dive into a break, and we literally launched your amazing masterclass, so that's very, very exciting. Um, okay, I'm just going to borrow my star by sheet for a second because this is a beautiful parcel. If you've watched the entirety um, of uh, the Black Jade show, well, not just black, I know there was other editions as well, um, and you're looking for probably one of the best deals, we're all looking for the best deal, aren't we? Here it is. Because this is, the, the only explanation to this is that it's a closeout deal. Seven millimeters, six, oops, sorry, six 
individual stones look at how glossy they are they do they look already. literally <laughs> wet they should do that's top quality the only reason we are doing this is because we have how many okay 50 available it's not that small a quantity then we've got the birthday round the corner it's all pretty much pretty much bought and ready and almost scheduled and planned for your birthday event we need those locations yeah. within our vault. We are going to promise a closeout deal on that wonderful, historic, beautiful, rich, imperial black jadeite colour. It's not that burnt chicken skin, which I still love. Absolutely love it. You know, I've, I, I love the bangle that we brought you. I love the carvings that we've brought you as well. I love some of the strands that we've brought you in the, uh, brought to you in the mm. burnt chicken skin colour. This isn't. You couldn't describe this as that, could you? No. You're smiling. Do you not right. like that terminology? No, 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 no. It's, it's, it's nothing to do with that. I, I was just thinking that four days into our birthday week this year, we've got a coronation. <laughs> and we have. Yeah. Yeah. It's amazing, isn't it? It's going to be a massive week. For us and the country. Ah, oh, yeah. How wonderful. Yeah. How wonderful. In four seconds, close out deal. Now's the time to get them. You've got a beautiful parcel. <laughs> Ross has said, I don't think anybody knows quite how low these are going. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> yeah, 1999, Ross. Can we physically buy them for that? No. no. He says no. No. No, I wouldn't imagine so. You've got to make, uh, we've got 50 available. It is a close out deal. Um, <laughs> grab them whilst you get the chance. You know, if, maybe you're not looking for the entire strand. Maybe you are looking for the odd few for marker, yeah. well, just marker earrings. beads or... Yeah, three, that's... You've got three pairs of earrings there on a head pin, yeah. but keeping it the length. So you have the length of metal with the jade at the bottom. Oh, just what, and suspended. hammer them? Or would you have no, them? No, just, just, just as it is. Really, oh, really, really simple, beautiful. but on a, long, on a long earring post. Well, they should lovely. be more than 19.99, shouldn't they? Yeah. They should be. Um, make sure you check out the, 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 your baskets. This is a, a clock until the closure of this auction, wonderful jewellery makers. So, um, and the closure of also our Type A Black Jadeite Showcase. Coming up after the break, we have got one of the most amazing, amazing kits. Times two. That doesn't make sense, that sentence, does it? But you know what I mean. Um, most amazing at Masterclass. You've got beautiful kits coming your way. Stunning jewellery, Mark. Bless you. Thank you. Stunning, stunning jewellery. Again, I don't think I know these are going to sell out because they are so breathtaking. You've got that lovely iridescence. The video that you uploaded on um, oh, yeah. Facebook. Mm. Incredible. The closure of this auction. We're going to duck straight into a break. Get yourself ready. Make sure you check out your baskets. Get yourselves ready for what will be an, a truly inspiring masterclass. We'll be back after this. <laughs> Hi guys, I'd love for you to join me uh, this Wednesday. We're gonna be bringing the launch of uh, the Caribbean Incredible Amber. This is a gemstone that has captivated the industry. Uh, you know, thought previously only gem quality amber kind of came uh, from the, you know, the, the, the Poland uh, Baltic regions, but this material has been making waves and for very good reason. It is the collector's choice for amber. Uh, I can't wait to talk to you about that. And then straight after, we're gonna be bringing you Bursa Natural lavender jadeite, a material that was thought to never exist outside of Myanmar. This material isn't just those pastel shades, it's incredible deep uh, saturation with its own incredible deep history and I can't wait to share this epic jadeite with you all. Want to know what's going on in the next show? Then head over to our website, click on the TV guide this will tell you who's presenting, which guest we have joining us, along with what's going on in each hour. If you ever miss a show, you can catch up by clicking on the day you missed and then click watch this show. You can also view what product was on and if it's still available to buy. Catch up on Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker are proud to be part of the Gemporia partnership. Our partnership family includes Jewellery Maker, Gem Collector, Gemporia, Sewing Street and Yarn Lane.
Jewelry Maker are excited to be teaming up with Cast. Cast is an exciting concept where you can design and create your own silver ring, pendant or earrings with ease. Each kit contains specialist blue jeweler's wax, which comes in a variety of exciting shapes to offer you the most flexibility with your designs and comes complete with a selection of tools. Your pieces would then be sent to Birmingham's historical jewellery quarter and be cast in sterling silver. The co-founders James and Luke, along with their lead designer Julia, will be joining us on the show to guide you through everything you'll need to get started on this exciting journey of taking your designs to that professional level. Tune in on Friday the 20th to be inspired, learn to design and get creative with Cast. It's a new year, so that can only mean one thing. It's time for those new year resolutions. And it's the perfect time to start a new hobby. Jewellery Maker, Sewing Street and Hobby Maker are here whether you're starting something new or advancing your skills on a current hobby. With all the tools you need to start, as well as expert demonstrations from our great guests. Are you starting a new hobby this January? Share your new makes with us by tagging Jewelry Maker, Hobby Maker or Sewing Street using the hashtag New Year New Hobby. And watch us every day from 8am to 1pm on Jewelry Maker. On Hobby Maker, 6 to 8am and 1 to 6pm. And 8am to 1pm on Sewing Street. Jewellery Makers, we have a mega sale on our website right now. There is up to 70% off items with over a thousand items available on all the W's at jewellerymaker.com. So pop along, take a look and start shopping. Welcome back, lovely jewellery makers. And as, as if like that, we're in the afternoon. Already? Where's Already. this morning gone? Crazy, isn't Just it? gone so, so, so fast. But it has in one aspect, but not in another, because... How many been people have been waiting for exactly. to come? And also, that's just today. What about behind the scenes, waiting for this parcel, <laughs> to, um, these amazing oh. kits to arrive? Mark, can we just start off by showing that that amazing bust? Well, that's actually two necklaces. Should I bring it's, it across? Oh, it's gorgeous. Do you, you want to have a look at it? It's so beautiful. So it's got two necklaces on there. So you can, if you take the wire one off first and then you're left with the kiss I want to literally look at it like, like this. Uh, I love this colour. Look at how amazing. It, it, I, I literally was drawn to it straight away. In the sunshine, it is spectacular. The colours just, oh, it just looks amazing. We've not had very much sun over the past few days, actually, to get really good pictures and, uh, and videos. Oh, you managed mine? Yeah, I did manage. You know, what you put on, uh, <laughs> what you actually put on Facebook, I thought was, was, was perfect, and it just captures. Yeah. What is it that's so special? We love agate, of course. Well, I love, I love agate. Mm -hmm. I've always loved agate. And... And again, I feel I always, I always take under my wing gemstones that are in plenty and people sort of poo poo them a bit because they are so readily available and so common. So agates and your quartzes, I mean, absolutely love. Yeah. And, um, and for me, agates, we used to back in, I mean, jewellery maker, it'll be our 13th birthday in May. That's great. And I think, I think it was the first year or the halfway through the second, we had some, a smaller amount of coated agate. Mm -hmm and absolutely flew out. We've not had it since, and I really missed it. And then it must have been about a year ago when we, when we bought it back, Wayne managed to find somebody that could supply it for us. And I was completely mesmerized by it. And it just adds that extra little something, along it with so the faceting oh. as well. And it's, so I mentioned earlier, so for your, your, you know, your, your mermaid pieces and your peacock pieces, everything, everything that's a bit ethereal, and you just want that extra glow. And as I said, they look beautiful on screen, but you get them outside. Yeah, they really oh. do come into their own. I totally yeah, agree. Absolutely. Uh, and, you know, it's, it's one of those kits. You know, I'm not going to say specific colour because they're all the same. Mm. So um, you're getting two different kits. You know, you could wear each and every single one of these pieces to any event. Any event. 
Absolutely. Whether it's a yeah, barbecue, yeah. whether it's, yeah. you know, um, a, a, a gala dinner, mm. whether yeah. it's, you know, drinks with friends, whatever it is. You could literally yeah. wear each and every single one of these pieces. I think it was um, not the last time I bought it to her, but the time before that. Do you remember I made Willow with a little micro mala? Oh, Do you remember that? that every that's day that's on coated holiday. agate. So, you know, for all ages as well. Yeah, she it's loves just, it. It's just lovely. Every oh, single night we went out for dinner, she wore that. Does she? Yeah, every <laughs> single night. Um, on holiday, and where is it, you know, when yeah. she gets the opportunity? Well, what's nice about the bundles we're bringing today? They've got six and eight mils combined. So you can do different sizes. So you're not, you don't have to buy sixes, you don't have to buy eight, it's all, it all, it's all together. I love it. So but my favourite, can I show you this? Because yeah. I'm so proud of this. It did take a long time. I bet it did. <laughs> so this is, this is the right hand kit. We've got, we've got two here. strands of purple. Yeah, so, so I did a mala. So we start at the base with the dark. As I said, this, this took longer to grade than actually did to knot it. And then as you go further up and further up, it gets lighter and lighter and lighter and lighter all the way up to wow. the very, very top when we get to that pale. So all of those colors from dark to light come on the two strands. That's just two strands. But they don't them. come in that order, do they? No, you need to no, be able to grade them. Uh, but you've got them in blues, you've got them in greens, you've got them in baby blues. So it's really nice that we've got the same colour in two different sizes, which we've not done before. Wow. So it's really nice. So wait, Mark, I've just noticed that's in two different sizes as yes, well. So, so this, this, what this you were is, saying, so you had to colour yeah. grade and colour. two separate strands. Yes. <laughs> I yes. see. Yeah, oh, my goodness Aren't they just me. spectacular? So you get the banding, you get the faceting, mm. you get the coating, you get everything in one little stone. That's why I just love them. Absolutely. And you also them. get a huge carrot weight. You've got two Massive. separate kits. Two separate bundles, that's right. Um, which include the two different sizes, Mark, as you were just saying. Yes. Yep. In fact, some of them you get three different sizes. Um, they, they always sell out. Always, always. This one in particular, I've, I've never seen that. I've not Palette. seen this. I've not seen this. Palette it's either. beautiful. Yeah. Think blue lace agate meets. Yeah. yeah. No, it's called. Rose Quartz meets Moonstone. This is stunning. Mm. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's a real nice, gentle pastel tones. Perfect for, for spring and summer. Absolutely amazing. Do you know, I know which one I would choose first, but... Well, what's perfect about these is they all work together. They do. I've, I've mixed and matched all of them. They really do. Which, that's it. You get the two. We've got them separate opportunities, whether you want to go yeah, for the darker colours, whether both. you want to go to the lighter colours. What we cannot, I know these will be, will be sell out. They always today. sell out. I've never bought coated agate to wear and they haven't sold out. So you need to be really quick with these. And as I said, we, we due to get these on, on, a, on one of our big shows of the year, New Year's Eve, and we, we couldn't do it. it. It was delayed. Before we introduce the first kit, mm. talk us through each of your amazing pieces, Mark, because these are absolutely okay. beautiful. So, so I, again, I kept colours to colours. So I've shown you the purple. Then we've gone on to the blues. So again, I've, I've mixed blues. and matched. So we've got the dark blue from the first bundle and the, the, the powder blues from the second. Um, and then I've done a, a, a macrame piece on here. Again, I've done lots of tassels, I have to say. Um, then we've got the pinks from both ranges. We've got the greens, which I've mixed with purple cord. Again, these are all, these are all over the head long line necklaces, so they, they can be worn so easy wear. Um, I did a, a triple shambhala, which is one of my favourite techniques. So that's just from one strand mm. of the 16 that we've got coming up. And then we've got these simple wear bracelets. Let me just move these out of the way. So these simple wear bracelets, all macrame, all with uh, ties or, or slider clasps along the base here. And then various earrings. So these were the earrings I was talking about with the jadeite. Just, oh, beautiful. Just, that's just two. And it goes to show when you've things, got a, yeah. a single stone with so much impact. Yeah, you don't need anything else. No. And the, the earrings next door, I took that, these were to go with the necklace I made. So again, I've managed to graduate size and colour from dark to light. So, you, so as I said, so the greens, for example, you can replicate that. The baby blue, you can replicate that. The mm. pink, you can replicate it. So there's so much scope. Tell you what, I tell you what, if you, if yeah. you are lucky enough to get these kits, You've literally got your uh, uh, your arts and crafts Absolutely. table yeah, yeah. or Absolutely. your artisanal market or your yeah. Etsy shop literally sorted, yeah. haven't you? And then these two here, if I take I this one I love those up, this together. Is, so this is just showing you the scope for rosary linking. This is one of my favourite colours of the two bundles. Yeah, mine it's, too. It's like a, a labradorite base with the amazing pinks and turquoises 
again, so it takes really nicely to, to wire, so you've got all your rosary linking as well. And then this necklace I've left on the bust, again, this is this, this kiss cross, which is what it's made for, but I've done little stations on this one. Oh again, my just, goodness Again, me. in the sunshine, it's just beautiful. I, I like this, it's a real subtle colour palette, but it's got a real pop of vibe, a pop of colour. Yeah, it's, no, it's, just it's beautiful, and I love them layered together yeah, as well. They really work together. Okay, are you ready? Mark, I'm, I know which one I would choose, but which no, one you do choose, you want to you choose? choose? You choose first. Okay, it's lovely, isn't it? You did, you did say when you walked in this morning, that was your... My favourite. Favourite It's beautiful. Yeah. It's absolutely beautiful. Yeah. So all of the tones oh. in this bundle go alongside the tones. So you've, in effect, so, you, we've we've taken one big bundle and split them into two. So yeah. You've got your lights and your darks, but you've got the lights following on with the darks with the second bundle. So yeah, because so they're just perfect. I mean, look at that. That would go so oh. perfectly with that colour that you yeah. just said, with yeah. that almost labyrinth like base. They are breathtaking, aren't they? And of course, of course, of course, of course, it is going to be a sellout. I, I can't choose a favourite strand. I love them all as much. But the potential of what you can create. I mean, those earrings just using, what, two individual so solitaires. The countdown, just so you know, is to when we bring the graphics <coughs> live. Um, I'll give you all the housekeeping right now, just so you know there are. So, oh, no. Oh, I didn't know the amount. Oh, no, don't. What? It's only 79. Well, I've got the 80th, which I've used. Is that for both bundles? 49 and the other one. These, you will need to be really quick. 49 of well, the of dark. Of course, we would have endeavoured to get more. Sorry, 59. 59 of the dark. Of course, okay. we would. Is that right, Ross? I beg right. your pardon, there's 59 of this bundle. This is the one that is incredibly limited. Um, if we could have bought more, believe me, we would have done. Because these always, as Marcus said, always sell out. The descriptions, it's saying coated blue, coated green, coated... No. That's the other one. I'm fairly sure. It depends on the... Coated rainbow grey. Oh, yeah, no, it might be. I would say that's that one, would you? Yeah, that's, that's rainbow grey. Yeah. yeah, I'd say that's this one. We can swap the photographs around. That's all good, don't worry. We're getting to that one. So this is the one we've got the most limited of. Is that right, Ross? He says, I'm just dotting the I's and crossing the T's. <laughs> it's all good, it's all good. I, I don't think people are gonna want just the one, uh, one bundle anyway. I think they're gonna want both of them. So I don't think it really matters. Um, I think just the, oh, the right, picture's right. the wrong way round. So for this, for this auction, EWXC79, this is the bundle yeah. that you are going to be getting. It's that darker colour. Uh, to be honest, they are both incredible, aren't they? Oh, my word, look. Yeah. There's, there's literally 59 of these available, or rather they were. It's just beautiful. It's so beautiful. If we could have bought 500, then we would have done, wouldn't we? Mm -hmm. Half the stock's gone already. Oh. 60% of the stock's gone already. Um, Janice, Linda, Sandra, Neil and Linda, Maria, uh, Buckinghamshire, Susan, Tina, uh, Kathy, Susan and Brian, Stella, you've done it, you disappear off the bottom of the screen, I can't see everyone's name. Jennifer, Alison, Joy, Linda, Andrew, Julie, Claire, Kathy, Anita, Geraldine, Susan, Tyne and Ware. I can't keep up, I really can't. It is going to be a sellout. We're at £79.99. and pence. That's £10 per strand. And it's, do you know, the one on screen right now is the one that you will be getting. The one that you will be getting. You have to check out as soon as you possibly can. You know, when was the last time that you had coated our gates? I think I had a tiny amount beginning of December. Okay. I think. And then it, I hadn't had it then for, for quite a few months. What? <laughs> We're going to take this under uh, £50. Oh, no. Well, it's not an extra 10, is it? Oh, we should have been closing this at 59. Because of everything, because basically the photographs. Oh, yeah. no, really? Oh, Under 50 pounds. Silly, silly, silly. We'll silly. get it sorted, though. 
Over 100 of you have this in your basket. Mm. There's your price point. Uh, 49.99 should have been 59, I beg your pardon. I, say, I think this is the first time we bought the two sizes together in a bundle rather than having to oh, buy yeah, individual yeah, yeah. sizes. Oh, yeah, yeah, because normally you'd probably have yeah, to buy two anyway. Right. And they are literally coordinating. So here we go. So you've got, there's that rainbow. There's two, I call it grey. That's a bit... I wouldn't go grey. It's so pretty. <laughs> there's two yeah. of the greens. You've yeah. got the two of the blues. You've got two of the purples as well. Um, stunning. Do you want to know how many we've got left? Mm. Oh, no. All around the world getting involved, Mark, as well. We've got Florida, Julie, hello to you, Richard, Tracy, hello to you, Anne, Susan, Norma, Ali, Linda, Joanne, Florida, Debbie, Lin uh, Linda, Alison, Andrea, hello to you, Maker, Karen, hello, West Sussex, Claire, Audrey, hello, Meath, hello to you, London, Caroline, Lorraine. Who's taking that last one? Oh. Until next time. On a positive note, there are 79 of these. It's so beautiful. It's so, so beautiful. I'm just imagining these on memory wire bangles. Oh. They're just, just maybe an inch of a seed bead color. And then one you know, gun metal, I think gun metal 11 O's and 8 O's with any of this particular range. Because you've got that really stark gunmetal, quite pedestrian colour, and then the softness of these. I think they'd be beautiful. I love, there's one of the strands, it's got this subtle mint green. It has, it. yeah. It's beautiful. How pretty that is. Yeah, it's gorgeous. It's like a cloudy day, isn't it? Clouds on a blue sky. Oh my it's goodness, gorgeous. look at these. See, these two here would work with the silver grey yeah, from the I other ones. That's yeah. probably my favourite colour here. Yeah, that mint green. Oh, it's, yeah. it's beautiful. And then, How stunning is this? I, I, it, it's it stunning. No. And do you know what, Mark? Thank goodness you did champion your agates. Because if you hadn't, I don't think we'd be seeing strands like this. You know, um, they're absolutely beautiful. Just magical, aren't they? Just magical. You know, if I was to show this any age as well, whether you're, you know, we're uh, uh, sort of in our senior years, whether we're sort of middle age, even down to sort of our babies would absolutely love this. It's beautiful, mm. absolutely beautiful. There are 79 available. The previous kit sold out, is that right? Yeah, it's gone, it's gone, it's gone. This is gonna do exactly the same, exactly the same. I like them mixed up together though. That was, it was bothering me that they were in such, a, <laughs> such, such amazing order because the color, the colors just really complement one another. Look at this. As I said, you wait till you go outside. It is the most spectacular thing you've ever seen. Yeah, so it's not doing them favours, <coughs> is it, here no, in the studio? No. When you get it home, oh, my word. That's beautiful. Do you remember the twist necklace I do where you just thread them onto wire and then you group them and just twist them? That would look amazing. I've, I've just got, I've got vivid memories of you yeah. introducing those yeah. necklaces. Vivid me memories. Literally, I think it was... The studio just behind us and you had them all lined up across the floor, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. Really vivid memories. Um, Mark, amazing. £79.99. pence. Um, we'll Are you? stop in there. No. <laughs> I, I don't think You're we've done nice the pastel ones. palettes, have we? I don't think. I don't recall the pastels before, no. Maybe the old one or two, but we've never had a... Not a full We've palette. never had two of the same in different sizes before. No. It's beautiful. It's flying out the door. Are you ready? We're matching oh, the price. Gosh. Matching the price. Loads of you there. I wish we had more. I really do. But at least we've got some. Mm. And it has, you know, we have been waiting for it. Well, you in particular, Mark, yeah. have been waiting for it for weeks? Yep. Months? For months. It's months. <laughs> September we ordered, the beginning of September. Yeah. Just you know, we've, we've still not been able to get red. Oh, that'd be gorgeous. Yeah, we just can't get it. It's too expensive. But never mind. Got everything I else. Love I love this. Black. Black would be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. That would be quite cool, yeah. wouldn't it? Forty nine ninety nine. You do need to be quick because we literally have how many? And have we got now? Fourteen. Fourteen remaining, says Ross. We'll keep you updated on it. Mark, I can't wait to see your beautiful creation. So while I'm doing a demo, I'm going to challenge you. Okay. Right, so there's a challenge. Okay. So ombre, all of those 16 strands along that T-bar. That's going to be my challenge to you. 
mix up the parcels. Mix up the parcels and ombre. I can hear Dan stress right now. <laughs> and then ombre left to right. I can sort them out at the end of the show. But ombre. Don't do it. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Challenge accepted. Okay. 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 So this is this is for Tina, who messaged in on our last show, asking what was Kiss cross, what is kiss cross? We, I want to find out how you do the kiss cross. Now, it's a technique I've talked to it more times than any, um, but we've had so many new, new viewers since, since the COVID and yep. that horribleness. So um, any, any excuse to share, because I love, I love it. And it's probably one of the most beautiful techniques that we bring to air, mm -hmm. and it is hand on heart, the most simple. I can teach you it in five minutes flat. Which yeah. people think, what? And when but you honestly, look at it as well, you honestly. don't imagine it to be uh, to be as simple as it is. No, the end it, result is ridiculous. beautiful. So for Tina and anyone else watching, the picture that you're seeing on screen here, now these are our little sections, little kiss cross sections. What do we call them? Normally? Modules. Little modules. So the kiss cross, if you wanted to make the full necklace, all you do is you just repeat everything I'm about to show you now. So I'm going to make you one of these little sections. And then you just repeat and repeat the length of the necklace okay. that you want. Okay. Now, I always do kiss cross in either six millimeters or four millimeters. Six millimeters is a really nice size to start. And if you go down to four millimeters, it then becomes micro kiss cross, which is a, a name that I've coined. It just everything goes smaller. Yeah. So once you've got the, once you get the, the gist of your kiss cross. You can then go down smaller. You can go up to an eight mil, but it starts getting really heavy to wear. So I would either go for the six or the four millimeter. So I've got my six millimeter. So I've gone for the, the, the baby powder blue. And you need two sizes of seed bead. You need an 8-0, which I've got in the silver. And then you need an 11-0, which I've got in this galvanized gold pewter color. That's all you need. So you need your gemstone. You need an 8O and you need an 11O. I've gone for a size 10 needle. You can either, so if you're starting this technique, go for a size 10. Um, then I, I tend to use a size 12. And for this one, I'm using the forest green because it, I think it will disappear. As you can see on the board there, it completely vanishes. So I've gone for the forest green. So there are two sections on a kiss cross. And all you do is you alternate between your gemstone seed bead, gemstone, seed bead, gemstone, seed bead. As long as you remember that little routine, you never add seed beads and gemstones at the same time. Okay, it's always seed alternate. bead. You alternate between the two, okay? Apart from the first row where you incorporate both, okay? But I'll make that clear. So you can go up to any width, any diameter in your gemstones, but obviously the, the more gemstones you use, the larger the hole down through the center of the tube, and it does tend to flatten. You mm -hmm. don't want your tube to flatten. So okay. I've always done three. I've, some, I've gone up to four once, but I, wasn't in, I didn't really like it. So I've always go for three. So you, you, you're gonna go for your three gemstones, okay? For your three six O's. So this is your first row, and this is the only time that you will add your seed beads and gemstones together. So I'm gonna pick up an eight O and a gemstone an 8 and a gemstone, an 8 and a gemstone. Okay, so you've got three 8 and three six millimeter rounds. This is, the, as I said, this is the only time you're ever going to add them together. Okay. So we're going to slide them down, leave a little bit of a tail in case you want to add a clasp later on. And we're going to tie a single knot followed by a double knot. Like so, okay, so you've got your section. So this is your beginning of your kiss cross. Okay, so just lay it down and make sure you've got that little triangle shape. So now we're going to add our seed bead row. So we're going to sew away from the knot. So I'm just going to sew through the eight, through the gemstone and exit through an eight O. Okay, we're ready to go. So we've got our gemstones, and what we're going to do now is we're going to do what's called a seed bead arc. And this is a number of beads, a combination of beads that is going to surround your six millimeter gemstone. And I've already worked this out for you. So if you do decide to go smaller or larger, just have a play until you get the right combination and the right amount of beads that fit your arc. So for, for six millimeter rounds, you'll need the following. 
And bear in mind, we're not adding gemstones, it's just seed beads on this round. So we're adding one, two, three elevens, one eight and three elevens. And we're going to go round the outside of the bead into the next eight. Oh, so you can see now we've got this cute little arc of beads That's around. Pretty. So it fits perfectly. Okay, so I've, I've done the hard work for you with the combination. Then we're going to do exactly the same with the next. So one, two, three of your 11s. One, eight, three 11s. We go round into the next eight. And you see again, we've got that little arc around the gemstone. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to do the next, exactly the same. So one, two, three, 11s, one, eight, one, two, three, 11s. And then we're going to go round into the next eight. This, if you want to watch this, sorry, Mark, I was just yeah, thinking no. out loud because I know Tina is watching right now who asked right. for this demonstration. Okay. Tina, if you want to watch this back, maybe whilst you got, when you've got it all set up, you know, you've got your, mm. your you've got your kits maybe, or you've got strands, whichever it might be. We're on YouTube as well, so you can actually, if you make a note of the date and the time, right. yes. you can actually watch, rewatch it back as well. So yeah. Mark's demonstration, yeah. so you can stop and start it. At you your can own do it along with me then as well. Yes, it's a nice way of, of doing it. Okay, so we've we've done our our seed bead section. At the moment, we've just added our third arc. And we're in this middle 8-0. And what we need to do is what we call a step up. And this is the most difficult little bit. Adam, would you mind going in just a tad? Sorry, Ready? I shouldn't, I shouldn't produce like that. OK, so we're exiting the middle 8-0. OK, so we okay. want to do our step up. So what we're going to do is we need to get to the outside corner. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our needle and we're going to sew up through the 3-11s and the 8 Okay, so we're now at the point in the corner, okay? So we've just added our seed beads. What we're going to do now is add our next row of gemstones. So can you see we've got one, two, three corners, okay? Ignore the ones in the center because that was from the previous row. So we've got one, two, three corners. So what we're going to do is we're going to pick up our next gemstone because we've just added our seed beads so we now know it's going to be gemstones. Mm. We're going to jump all the way across to the next corner with our gemstone. Okay. And then we're going to see it's already starting to pull up. Okay. That's what you want. You want to form a little cup. So you can see now there's a corner we're exiting. The next corner, we're going to pick our next gemstone. We're going to jump the gap into the 8 -0. Pull nice and tight, and then already look the space is there waiting for the eight, for your six millimeter round. So we're going to take our gemstone, jump the gap into the eight o. Pull nice and tight, and then what I what I tend to do just to give it a bit of strength is I just take the needle and I go all the way around through the gemstones. You don't have to do this, but I I just feel it gives it a bit more strength. So one, two and then three, and then we're going to exit the 8-0. Okay, so all I've done is I've just taken the needle round all of those six components. So I'm exiting. Already almost a module. Already, you can already see the zigzag starting yeah. to form. Okay, so we go, but we've just done our gemstone round. So now we know that it's going to be seed beads. Seed beads. And you can already see the, seed, the gemstones waiting to have their little arcs. And we know that the arcs are one, two, three, elevens, one, eight, one, two, three, elevens. So we're going to go around the outside of the gemstone into the 8 -o. And then we're going to do the next section. So repeat. So one, two, three, elevens, one, eight, one, two, three, elevens. We're going to go all the way around into the next eight. And then we're going to do the same. So this is our final one. So one, two, three, and an eight. One, two, three. And what we're going to do is we're going to go round into the eight o, and then we're going to do our step up. So we're going to continue through the three elevens that are already there, exiting through that corner eight o. So we're going to go round the six mil into the eight. And then we're going to do the step up which is going to continue through the 311s, exiting through the 8 at the top. 
pull nice and tight, bring up the three little bead sections. And you can already see now it's waiting for the yeah. gemstones. The gaps are already there. So we've just done our seed beads, so we know it's gemstones. So one across the gap. And it goes. Turn. One across the gap. Into the eight. And then one across the gap. Difficult to see the drill holes with, the with all the colour flashing. Across into the eight. And that's our next section. Again, we're going to go around the outside. As I said, you, you, you don't have to do this. But, um, but I guess it makes sure it's you know, yes, completely it just, strong it just, and it secure. Just, it just adds a bit of strength. And is this a type of seed beading that you can literally just sort of put down and you come can, back to? You can because you always know where you are. Yeah. You know, you always know where you are. So that's into here. Okay, so we've done our gemstones. So now we know that it's seed bead round. So if I show you the side ver so on the here. So the 8O is the kiss and the 11O is the cross. So that's how I've given it its name, kiss cross. Its real name is tubular netting, which yeah. sounds so dull. <laughs> yeah, a bit clinical. But it says what it is on the tin. It's a bit clinical. Mm. Yeah, so I'll just, so if you wanted to stop here, um, you would then make lots of these little components and you would tie off. If you wanted to continue to, for a necklace, all you would do is then go back to your seed bead round. So, so one, two, three of your 11s, one, eight, one, two, three, 11s. We go round the six mil into the eight. It's always used it, when you're starting this as well to use different colours between your eights and your elevens, just so you can see where your kisses are. So then we're going to go one, two, three. Well, you can certainly eight. choose from lots of different colours, can't you? Because these yeah. are all um, absolutely, yeah, stunning with the iridescence alone. Just a bit of a stock update, um, by the way. Um, there are four left of this kit, and none of the other one. Is it? What about the other one? Yeah, sold oh, out. Gosh, right. That's sold out. So four left of this kit, which is, this is the, is this the paler one or the brighter one? Paler one. Right. Oh, there you go. Oh, yes, you can see. You can kind of tell by the description. So there's rose quartz, aqua agate, coated right. white agate. So, yeah, yeah this is the paler uh, colour palette. I've done the ombre. I don't know if you'd agree with me there. I'll have a look. I'll inspect it in okay. a minute. It looks all right. <laughs> So I'm coming out through this 8O in the centre. Okay, one step up again. So you'd, all you're going to do is you're going to continue through the next three 11s, exit through the top with the 8O. And then as you can see, you then got your gaps for your 8O. So what I'll do, I'll quickly show you how I tie off, how I finish off. Is that all right, Ross? Yeah, no, yeah. plenty of time. So I'm jumping the gap into the eight, going round. As I said, it, it, once you get the, uh, the routine it does do you reckon I, I reckon quickly. I could do this oh easily as I said it's one of the easiest it's quite addictive though you're always looking for gemstones that you can use and this is this is it all started with the Swarovski for me the bicones which is what we we're talking to Dave, to Dave about earlier okay so when you get to this point okay if you want to finish all you all I all I do to tie off okay this is as I said this is a very small section so I'm just going to go all the way around and all you do and I found this is much easier and much neater instead of tying off, is all you're going to do is you're just going to go round and round and round until you can't get the needle through anymore. The needle gets stuck. And then all you do then is you just cut your thread. Because once the thread has gone round twice, all the way round, it doesn't unravel. It can't unravel. There's nowhere for it to go because of the angles that the beads mm. are. So all I do is just go round and it takes a couple of minutes, but it's, it's quite a therapeutic little thing to do. It's just going to go all the way around all the, and just keep going until you see it's already starting to get a bit, bit tense. So I'm just going to go all the way around. See, I can't, I can just about get through the... You're wiggling now, aren't you? Yeah, wiggling. so I'm really struggling. So I'm going to come out of the eight and then I can then go in and know, rest assured that once I've cut that thread away, that's not going to unravel. And then all the, and then you do at the bottom is you is you do exactly the same or use this to pop a clasp on, which I've shown again that'll be on YouTube as well. So if we can have a quick look at the um, at the necklace I made, mm -hmm. if I bring that across. Yeah. Um, so this is this is the the little section necklace. So 
can you see I've made the sections which has got which has got three rows okay so gemstone seed B gemstone seed B gemstone I've tied off top and bottom so that would be the little component and then I've taken a separate piece of thread to thread them all onto I've made 10 of these little sections and can you see I've got I've got the thread coming up through the center so if I show you the piece I've just made can you see there's a gap coming up through the center yeah so all this, there's plenty of room there for your needle so you come up through the center of your component pop on a little 11 o and this just locks everything in place if you didn't have that seed bead there you'd find that the cotton would pull like that you see it would pull to one side and it wouldn't sit right so once you've got that little seed bead in place it locks it into position and then you decide what sort of combination of gemstones or beads you want Amazing. in between and then you just continue threading it all on so i would probably make your little components first put them all to one side and then just let your imagination run wild with the setting up of your necklace and as i said that's a complete 360 over the head necklace with the spacers but what you can do you've got plenty of scope in here with you got you've got eight of your six mil strands mm. Just alternate and just make a complete 360. Have you necklace. ever, and I think you have, I seem to remember it, have yeah. you ever ombre an entire kiss cross? No. Oh. I've done stripes with rainbow. Yes, that's what I'm rain, thinking of. With a rainbow, of. but I've not, I've not ombre I mean, That would surely be an impossible task. No, no, no it'd be quite time consuming, but it, it would be lovely. Would uh, be here's lovely. Tina. Tina. Oh. Thank you so much, Mark, for that brilliant demo. I promise. I will now stop hounding no, you. You're no, no, don't be silly. I'll, I'll, any excuse to do with it. There'll be lots of viewers saying, oh, no, not this again. But any, any excuse. To I do really this. enjoy seeing the kiss cross as well. So but even but um, give it a go, Tina. Um, I do promise you, you it, it is very addictive. You will, you'll be looking for anything you can kiss cross. But, but send us a Wall of Fame picture in. We'd love to see it. Oh, absolutely. Honestly. Absolutely. And don't forget, it is actually on, uh, um, it's, it's on YouTube as well, if you It'll need to watch YouTube. it back. Yeah. Um, OK. So let me have a look at your ombre. Let's then. see if you agree. Do you know when you put, I did it, and then I doubted myself, and ah. I arranged it. So <laughs> um, Dan, was trying, Dan was trying to take it away. I was like, no, you can't take it away, Dan. There's only one one alteration I would make, and you probably did it, and you moved it. I would do that. Mm, yes. But no, that's that's really good. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Because the pink is being picked up in the pink coming off of the little. See, now I was thinking bits. about base colours. Ah. Uh, so I would put that there at least. Right. Okay. No, isn't it good. funny? Isn't it funny? <laughs> I definitely think you're right there, yeah. because that's almost white, isn't it? Yeah. Well, it is white underneath. So what's your favourite? If you had to choose one strand out of all of those, just one. Just one strand. Yeah. Right, that would be mine as well. That one. Isn't it strange? There's all these really dark purples and blues, it's but I love that, because it's got that mint green. It's, yeah, it's absolutely scene. stunning. Yeah, no, it's lovely. But I do, uh, yeah, I love them all. It's really difficult, really difficult. Um, there are only a couple of those kits Amazing. left now. Just two of them. Amazing. Well done, everybody. Okay. Ooh. We've got some one metre oh, strands. Fantastic. So you can be in Kiss Cross Heaven. Kiss Cross Heaven. Should we start with some eight mils? Black. Uh, agate. Uh, Beautiful black agate. Eight. Yeah. So, I would use, so I would use the eight mils as the little, what have I done with it? Here we go. And also a great alternative yeah. if you, if, if, to your, your yeah. black jade eye, if yeah. that's not your budget. So I would do the six millimetre rounds with your little kiss cross stations and then use your eight mils in between to do your little station stoppers. Look how beautiful that is. Mark, it's even absolutely with that, stunning. Even with that, with that black agate as your station stoppers. Yeah, stopper. love it. Perfect. Absolutely love it. These are all our gates, so um, yeah, we're going to be a brand new premiere opportunity. Oh, gosh. Beautiful luster. When we were describing our gates, or black gemstones rather, did we say black agate? We did. Did I'd we? No, I'd never forget black agate. Yes, oh, I love black agate. Love your loyalty. <laughs> the loyalty to this beautiful gemstone. Yeah. That's a full metre. So, Mark, you could make a lot of kiss cross, couldn't you? Or your malas. Or your malas. Or your knotted pieces, yeah. Or sort of like you said, the little markers, the station points yeah, in between. Yeah. Oh, are you ready, says Ross? No way near, Danny says. Between now and the top of the hour, we've got a lot of amazing agate deals that we're going to be bringing to you. I knew it. I what? knew it. Ross, that's the naughtiest deal today. He's a rotter. Oh. 
Sell out as much as he said as, as we possibly can between now and the top of the hour. Um, you're not really a rotter, Ross. He says, I am. I say it myself. You do say it. You, you do say it. But we know you're not really. But that is a, 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 a pretty incredible price tag. Yeah, that goes beautiful. What's 1,000 divided by 8 or 200? 1,000 uh, divided by 8. That's 125. Ooh, where did that come from? So 125 on there. You need 108 for a Marla. So you have a full knotted Marla and enough for a bracelet and earrings. How match. incredible. For £9.99. <laughs> Mark, I remember when. We'd be wow. lucky if we got sort of um, a 38 centimetre strand for 9 yeah, 99 absolutely. You know, you are it's getting a, a metre. We certainly yeah. have. We certainly, certainly have. That's why I almost, uh, I always kind of jumped on my soapbox a little bit. You know, when we, are, every so often people are saying the price has gone up at Jewellery Maker. It really hasn't. It's yeah. gone significantly yeah. down. We open a broader, we offer a broader selection. Mm. Yeah. So, you know, back in the day, we didn't do jadeites. We didn't do jadeites. We didn't do strands that were sort of 70, 80, 90 pounds. We didn't do them. You know, we started off with your agates and things like that. But now our, 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 our uh, portfolio is much, much larger. They're flying out the door and they're perfect to go alongside your um, amazing kiss crosses. What about, um, and you've mentioned Marlers. Yep. What Memory wire. Memory wire. You can do your macrame bracelets. With your eight o, with your eight mils. There's nothing you can't do with an eight mil. No. Nope. As I said, I, I, I probably wouldn't kiss cross. You could do graduated kiss cross, where you start one end with a six, with a four mil, then a six mil, and then you do one row of eight mil down the middle, mm. and then six mil, and then four mil. But I think if you did a whole necklace in heavy. eight mil, it'd be really heavy. Well, don't worry, because actually they could be the markers, couldn't they? Like yeah, these yeah. in between. Yeah. yeah. Because. I have got six and four of we as we well. Have, yeah. Oh no. We have. I've got the six mil there. And they are oh. full meters as well. So yeah, if you want to use the eight millimeters for the little individual markers, oh, you can do that. Yeah. Right now it's all about the six millimeter size. And when we come to the four mil, I'll give you the combination of beads for the smaller micro as well. So if you've okay. got a so Tina, if you've got a pen and paper handy, I'll give you the combination for the seed beads. So you can do this, the, the micro as well. You're learning the micro yeah. and the uh, more traditional crisscross yes. as well. Yep. Six millimetres in their size, you can see the difference there. <coughs> so yeah, as Mark said, maybe a little bit heavy to do your crisscross in your eight mil, but use the eight mil, uh, it's, it's up to you. Um, use the eight mil maybe as markers. You're getting a full metre once again. Hang on a minute, if the eight mil was oh, no. 9.99. Ridiculous. Yeah. This with gold seed beads looks incredible. Just, just keep it monochrome. Just classy. Gold, gold and black. Looks beautiful. Really classy. Yeah. Beautiful. Eight pounds and ninety nine pence only. Make sure you do check out those baskets, everybody. It's flying out the door. I can see lots of kiss cross on the wall of fame. Yeah, I hope so. It Can't. warrants it. it. Absolutely warrants it. I it's love beautiful. It. And and, and it. as a backdrop as well, the black in particular. Yeah. Yeah. You know, if I I don't know. Let's get. Imagine it with the yeah. blue. Just incredible, isn't it? It's just a really pretty colour combination to go alongside. Pink, I think the pink would look beautiful with it as well. Yeah. It just it just works oh, with all no. of them. About to sell out. Let's do the four millimetres now. Okay. So. So, with if you're doing kiss cross with four millimetres, you it becomes micro kiss cross. Okay. So, so the, I'll try not to make it complicated. So. In the demo that I just showed you, your 8-0 bead mm -hmm. change for an 11-0, and your 11-0 beads you used drop to a 15-0. So all you're doing is you're going Scared from 8 down. and 11 to 11 to 15. Mm -hmm. and that, So exactly the same combination, so 111 and three 15s either side, so exactly the same, but you're just dropping two seed bead sizes. And yeah. It is stunning. Micro Kiss Cross is beautiful. Well, you've got quite a few of my micro pieces. Yeah, they? in the earrings, they're so yeah. pretty. And yeah. I always yeah. get compliments on them as well because it's not something that you see every single no. day, is it? No. It's, it's so pretty. Lovely. And it's perfect if you want to make the matching earrings, yeah. isn't no, it? Yeah, absolutely. Um, okay, four millimetres. They'll go oh. beautifully with all of Mark's amazing masterclass kits. Seven pounds and 99 pence. It's not a 38 centimetre strand. That's amazing. So could I do, how many would I need to make, say, um, well, in a, in, a, a um, in a kiss cross, you need five rows per inch. Okay. So you need 15 beads per inch. Okay. Let's try and work this out. You get 250 in this strand. So 250 divided by 15. I can't do that maths. 
250 divided by 15. So that'd be about, about 17 inches. So with a clasp, that would be a full 18 so inch this necklace. Will do a full so that would do a full <gasps> kiss cross, micro kiss cross. Yeah. But at 7.99, you probably want to get a couple. Yeah. Three of those. Yeah. If you want two, you could do a 360. <coughs> oh, that where you link, where you link one end up to the other. I love that. So where there's, there's no, no clasp. clasp. All, yeah, I love that. Over the and also probably really there. comfortable to wear. And they're not very heavy either. No. I would be multi brand because also you don't often see your black gemstones. I know we have just right. stepped outside of a blacker right. uh, jadeite, but they're very, very few and far between. Um, now, the remaining strands that we have um, are all four millimetres in their size. And they're all going to go with the black. So you can alternate, ones. you see. You could, go, you could bl choose black and a colour, black and a colour. Let's go yellow. Black and yellow? That's my favourite. So if, with the four mils, what would you use? What size stone? Would you stick with the other black four mil? Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So I'm going to keep the black on the back of my hand because yeah. I think they would work perfectly. Look at that. Always beautiful. Black and yellow. Lovely. Gold sea beads? Yes. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Or maybe a turquoise colour. Because uh, I love turquoise and lemon yellow. It's yeah, very spring. That would be lovely. Yeah. Now they're all four millimetres. We're going to do literally some close out deals between now and the top of the show. Um, full metre long yeah, strand, amazing. glorious sunshine yellow, literally that's like Mr. Happy, isn't it, right yeah, there? It's beautiful. £7.99 pence only. 0800 655. Make sure you do check out your baskets if you're on those phone lines, then speak to our wonderful contact centre. How many have we got, Roscoe? 60 available, and yeah, here everybody comes. Mm. They're just joyous. You know, I said earlier on in the day that um, you can, I think jewellery can, can, you can almost um, pigeonhole jewellery to a certain mm. degree. So you can have jewellery that's beautiful. You can have jewellery that's a statement. You can have jewellery that's pretty. You can have jewellery that's fun yeah. and playful. Yeah. I think these kind of yeah. colours can be, yeah. you know, quite playful. And again, the formula is perfect for your memory wire. Just yeah. threads that entire strand onto, I don't know, six or seven coils of your yeah. memory wire. I mean, how easy wear really are they? Pretty. Yeah. Really pretty. And adjustable at the same time as well. Yeah. Um, yeah. We had 60 opportunities. Debbie, Jean, Yvette, Rupal, Daniel, Carol, Audrey, Pauline, Richard, Janet. Well done. Um, let's move on to the next colour. Do you want to choose, Mark? Orange. orange. The lighter of the oranges. This one? Yeah. Oh, it is very Fanta-esque. They're all going to go with the black. So yeah. if you've bought, so I'd, I'd get one of each of the black. And then you know that all of these colours are going to go with, with the blacks. It's, the, it's that perfect foundation, yeah. isn't it, to all of this jewellery? Oh, the black that. colour. Yeah, that's, that's beautiful. It is that proper Fanta. Yeah. Did I tell you that I got my paparaccia? Did you? Yeah. What, paparaccia course? No, sapphire that you, you bought get, to wear. Did yeah, you? Yeah. It's amazing, isn't it? Love it. Yeah. In it the little is, box. Is that, is that going in your special box? Yeah, that's in its special box on it already, isn't it? Yeah, with that's box. true. That is yeah. very true. Oh, my word. Look at that. Well, it is like a sunset. Yeah. You know I what we're looking at myself. right now? I don't blame it's you. It's gorgeous, isn't it? And again, there's plenty of scope to ombre all this if you wanted to. That'd be a nice little job. Little project. Seven ninety nine. I love it. Use, ye use the yellow as well if you wanted. Yeah. I think they yeah, work yeah. together. Oh, yes. Orange and yeah. yellow, beautiful. Yeah. Or maybe contrast because we've got lots of other colours to bring you in the agates as well. Between now and the top of the show, we're bringing you just, just crazy low deals. We love full mill gemstones, don't love we? Them. Love just them. because they're super versatile. As you said yeah. earlier on, Mark, you can beady bead them, can't you? Simple stretchy bracelets. Love it. I mean, no, you can't go wrong with them. And being agate, they're really strong beads as well, a bit strong gemstone. Can I just point out as well, you, so, you know, we, we felt sorry for Agate, didn't we? We were like, mm. oh, I feel sorry for it because it's kind of shunned, it's kind of put to, you know, it's, it, 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 it's, there's other gemstones that get the limelight, if you yes. like, and I get yeah. that, yeah. I get that. However, Van Cleef and Arpels use it. They do, yes, that's true. <laughs> so it's yes. not that shunned, no. <laughs> not at all. No. £7.99, pence. well done, everybody. Look at, look at how that's busy beautiful. it is today. Love this. Okay. So I would. Oh no, it's your next. No, go on. You go. I would keep with the orange, and I would put in with the purple or the pinky purpley. This one. Yeah, that with the orange and the black would be That's lovely. Beautiful. These. Are, hang on a minute. One, two, three. These are your whole chakra colours. The only one we haven't got is the purple. Looking at them, but we've got all the other six chakra colours. Hmm. So you can do your chakra. Very nice. A chakra kiss cross. Oh, or rainbow, nice. yeah, the whole rainbow. Yeah. That'd be amazing. I like that idea. Yeah. Look how beautiful that colour is. Yeah, I gorgeous. think this is going to be one of the most popular. I do as well. Yeah. Purple always is. 
Yeah, just lovely. It's it's a creative colour, very positive colour as well. Lots of people gravitate. Hang on, Ross, have I got the right one? Yeah, this is the pink. Yeah. Is it pink? Yeah, we don't we haven't got the purple. Yeah. I'm describing it as pink as purple. It's magenta. Yeah. It's a very uh, yeah, true it is. Yeah. Actually, here in the studio, it looks yeah. far more. Yeah. Magenta. No, yeah, this is the one. Pur this, the purple is really dark. You'd know it a mile off. I have to say, on the screens, it looks yeah. purple. It is yeah. more magenta. Yeah. It yeah. is more magenta. Yeah, absolutely. Beautiful colour. I love it. Gorgeous. £7.99. pence. Oh, that's amazing. Absolutely amazing. How can we do that? That's a bottle of wine, isn't it? Yeah. You know, exactly. How long will that last? It's a glass if you go to a, a, to a, to a yeah. pub. Yeah. I've got a little secret, a bit of a trade secret Ooh. about wine in... Um, you probably know this already. I think you've told me. I think I've told you already. So I was, I've been, I was in the wine business for 10 years when I, when I left school. And if you have a bottle of wine or a glass of wine in a restaurant, the price they charge you for the glass is the price they pay for the bottle. Mm. So just bear that, in, bear that in mind. A small glass, yeah, a 125 mil, the price they charge you is the bottle. Oh, what? Sorry, pay. what was that? What size? 125 mil. Oh, what? <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> <laughs> what size? <laughs> Didn't know they existed. <laughs> um, okay, let's move on to the next one. Can what? No, no, no you, you choose. choose. No, I chose the last one. You choose the next one. Blue. Cool. I love That's the blue. Lovely. It's, it's, it's appetite stunning. blues, isn't it? it? It really is. It's like a neon appetite yeah. colour. Full yeah, meat, yeah, long legs. Yeah. We're, we're going to show them all anyway. I should imagine. Yeah. Again with the black. Stunning. Lovely, Absolutely stunning. This is why we love our black gemstones because. You can use absolutely anything mm -hmm. with it. You really can. Yeah. £7.99. pence. How many have I got, Ross? 44. It's actually quite limited. Yeah. And blues, again, always very, very popular. Uh, 7 99 Gosh, I, we learn something every day. I did not know that you were in the wine business. Ten years. I ran a wine shop in the centre of Oxford. Did you? In Student City. What's your favourite yeah. wine? My favourite is Chilean Merlot at the moment. Mm, very nice. Chilean Merlot. Australian Shiraz. Very nice. Quite nice, yeah. I'm a or part and quite partial to a glass of Bollinger. Oh, <laughs> oh yes. Yeah. There you go. Did I get you some Bollinger once upon a time? You did. I yeah. did. <laughs> yes. You've got to treat yourselves every yes. so often, haven't you? Yeah. Or everything in moderation, that's yeah. all. That's all. So at $7.99, well done. Debbie, Yvette, well done. Pearl. Keep on dialing through. There's loads of you there. Uh, go on, Matt. Orange. Orange. It's like a burnt burn, orange, burn. isn't it? Oh, Sienna sort of colour, isn't it? It's lovely. Oh, Firopal-esque. This work with all your ambers. Yeah, it's pretty. Listen to the red, but yeah. they have got, yeah, like a, a, a warmth to them, mm. I guess, an orangey, like a terracotta-like colour. It, yeah. Straight down to it. <laughs> 7 99 um, 7 99 amazing, amazing, amazing. Um, it's been busy from start to finish today. We kind of knew it would be there, Mark, didn't yeah, we? No, I'm glad. Um, so we want to see all of your beautiful Kiss Cross necklaces, bracelets, mod the mm. module station necklaces yeah. as well. I think that would be beautiful. Um, I don't know if there's any of the masterclass kits left, um, but they are, yeah, extremely limited. I've got one more to do. A red two mil. We haven't done the green. We'll put it on the web. We'll pop it on the web for you. Two millimetres, oh. so these can be your little... They'll be the kisses. You could use them as your kisses with your seed bead crosses. It doesn't oh, have to be in Mayuki. You can no, do it with you your gemstones with as well. well. £2.99. Yeah. Oh, that's ridiculous. £2.99 and pence only. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Crazy. Check out those baskets, Crazy. everybody. It's been a lot of fun today. I've really enjoyed yeah, it. Yeah, it's been good. It's been good. Wow. And you're back next week uh, on the I'm weekend, I'm on Sunday you? with you. Yes. With the long-awaited return. And I've asked for these again. And they've, they've, these should have been in before Christmas and they've just arrived. Mosaic shell. Really? Yeah. We've got those back. That's we have. incredible. So those what brand part new of kits? Colours, brand new colours in kits. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah. We've just yeah. put the greens on, by the way, your four millimetre rounds as well. So, yes, I'm back with you now on Friday. I'm back. I'm doing Friday and Sunday uh, um, uh, this, this weekend as well. 
Hannah on Friday, so I know an amazing show on Friday, and I know an incredible, it's, a, it's absolutely a massive weekend, a huge, yes. huge, huge, huge weekend. Yeah. Enjoy the rest of your afternoon. Thank you so well, much, my thank darling. You. Mwah. Thank you. And we'll see you very, very soon. Take care. Bye-bye. <laughs>